Hi, good morning. Hi, hello. Hi, chat. Hi, good morning. Hello. Hi, hi, hi. Sorry, I'm a little late. Sorry, I'm a little late. I had to cuss up a couple things before I uh 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 start streaming. But I'm here. I'm here. Hi, hi, hi. Um, um, um. Not too late. Um, 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 um. Let's see. Who's here? Hi, Fosby. Hi, Bonker. Um, 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 um. Hi, Gambit. Hello. Hi, Ash. Hello. Hi, Mons. Hello. Um, um, um. I think I got every single major announcement in the playlist. Hopefully, I didn't miss anything. Yeah, uh, chat. Ash set up a playlist with all the game trailers from yesterday so we can watch them and I don't have to see any of the cringe shit. Uh, that happened yesterday and we can just watch the trailer so that's what we're gonna do so thank you ash um hi traves oh my gosh my ear is all itchy ah ah quality beam true hi archmage oh whoa no what's this notices your slug whoa yeah i think it's sick <laughs> It has, it has every disease. Um, 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 um. I was on YouTube Mobile. I had to add that shit one by one. It was annoying, but it's worth it. I appreciate it. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. Yeah, we'll, 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 we'll spend uh, probably the first part of stream stun locking on that before we move on to bacon pans. Because I think when I get into the swing of bacon pans, I'm not going to want to stop. Because I want to try and finish it today. Feels like we're pretty close to the end, but I, I, I don't know. We'll, we'll, we'll see. Um, but yeah, so we'll do, we'll do game trailers and stun locky shit first. Um, 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 what do I, what did, what did I do yesterday? What did I do yesterday? What did I do yesterday? I figured I'd do it, save you time since I know you'd want to watch the announcements anyway. Yeah, otherwise I was just going to go through the game trailers YouTube and just click the ones that looked like interesting to me. At least this way I can now like go through them and if they're cringe, I could just skip it. <laughs> like and then move on to the next one hi slonky hi abby hello good morning um yeah i kind of have milk voice i think I, I think i have a little bit of milk voice today um um and my eyes feel like they won't open all the way because i'm still eepy um 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 i was up pretty late last night i was up pretty late trying to set up like so i i was trying to like set up some more toggles for vt studio because uh glottal uh, updated our yippee, uh, which I showed you yesterday, but now it's like actually ready to go. Now it's ready to go. So we got a brand new yippee, but I was trying to like plug in all the, uh, the switches between like all my other models, which is a pain in the ass. Um, and I got stun locked because Slidoru, none of the outfit toggles that I've made for it, like where I've like painstakingly set like glasses or, or something. Um, they weren't fucking working, which was pissing me off. So, um, 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 I ended up like fucking doing that for, for like, I don't know, half an hour before I was like, fuck, I'm gonna have to redo all these, but yo, <gasps> hi, Yuxi, hi, slug, can I see him? Yeah, I'll give you a free yippee. I'll give you a free yippee. Um, and Hig, hi, good morning. Thank you for the shrimp and the spippy. Hi, Yuxi, how are you, rat? Hi, rat. What's up, rat? Mmm, stremch. Hi, Icky. Stremch. Mm. Yo, the rat. Yuxi, have you seen my V-Bridger update? Look at my look at my spicy mouth. I can do all sorts of spicy things with my mouth now. I haven't been awake at this time in months. That's crazy. That's crazy. Yeah. Well, I'm glad you're awake. It's nice to see you. It's nice to see you. Uh Yuxi has terminal. Yuxi has terminal FF14 addiction. <laughs> Thank you for this bippy hig. Yeah, so true. Yeah, but we won't we won't hold it against her. We we love this rat. We love this rat in this house. Um curse of EPB upon each true. Um 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 okay here, hold on. Um um I have no other thoughts other than FF14. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, it really be like that. Um rat. Okay, rat. Hi Ace. Um 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 okay, let me yippee. <gasps> let me yippee. Let me yippee. Whoa. Hello? Hopefully it's not breaking. Hi? Hi! Yippee! Hi! 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 Whoa! This is not supposed to move. This is not supposed to move. This goes over here. Yippee! Curse of the yippee be upon ye. Look how it look. Whoa! It's like a spider now. <laughs> It's so, it's so, it's so, it's so movie. <gasps> Hi, Deckard. Hi. Um, 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 strenuously letters. True. 
3 a.m. is three letters, too. I only stayed up till 3 a.m. today on Dragon Quest. You're playing 11 again, right, Mons? That's what you said. You're, you're playing through 11 again? I really want to finish Bacon Pants today so we can play the new Dragon Quest game next week. Holy shit, Slippy! Hi! Hi! Stick bug! Yeah, I can, like, move like a stick bug now. Also, watch. I can do this. I can... I can... I can... Shut up, chat. <laughs> I can get mad at y'all now. It's so cute. Oh, and Glottal set this up too. Glottal set this up too. Glottal set this up too. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Watch. 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 <gasps> Made. Made Slippy. Made Slippy real. Made Slippy real. Made Slippy real. Slippy serious mode. Yeah. Serious mode. Yeah. This one has a maid outfit too. Um, 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 new Slippy looks awesome. Glottal is so cracked, and he's so nice to me, and he does all this, like, f stuff for me for free, and, and he's just a really good friend, and, 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 and I love him a lot. Don't tell him I said that, though. Um, um, hi, Mookie! Uh, Slug, I got my Carolina Reaper peppers. Time for the spiciest sauce I can make. Whoa, Carolina Reaper spicy sauce? That sounds, that sounds scary. Um, 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 you like super spicy stuff, Abigail? Oh, made Slippy kind of got a dumpy. Yeah, made made Slippy a little caked up. Like we got some thigh meat back there. See that? Yeah. I'm having a heart attack. We are apparently going to penalties here. What does that mean? What's that mean? I don't know how to sports ball. Thank you, Glottal. True. Um, 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 um. What's the sports ball? <gasps> Hi, Giuseppe. Yeah, any sniffers? <laughs> any sniffers? <laughs> Raj showed me a TikTok yesterday. <laughs> where, where, um. <laughs> This lady had a haunts and she like she was like bending over to like fix something and and she like recorded the TikTok and the haunts like like leaned down to like like try and get like a peek and and then and then like when she like fully bent over he was like he was going in for the sniffa and she like booped his snoot and he was like oh like she knew what he was going to try and do it was it was very funny to me it made me think of you chat it made me think of you it made me think of you as like my chat is that haunts um <laughs> it's like that's that's my chat there they are also i don't know if you noticed um um somebody pointed it out yesterday i didn't notice it until the first time i loaded this model but do you see anything uh uh particularly suspicious about my eyes do you do you see anything particularly suspicious about my eyes does it does <laughs> does anything look uh particularly suspicious about them uh, fuck you. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Sussy eyes. No. Um, um, slug's cock is out under the dress. Yeah. It, uh, flattering that you think it's that big, but uh, no, not a chance. Uh, five kick to the goal each. Whoever has more wins. <gasps> oh, that actually does sound familiar from when I played Son er, Sonic. From when I played soccer as a kid. Yeah. What's that movement back there, Slug? It's just my, it's just my leggies and my, my cheek meat. What do you mean? Um, 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 Hi, Glottal! Hi, Glottal! Hi! Thank you for, thank you for making me, making me, yippee! Thank you for giving me Amoga size. I love them. Thank you for, for making this. Hi, Glottal. Hi. Hi, gay couple. I love you. Hi. Wow, cute slug. Hello, hello, sluggy slugs. Hi, pasta. Hi, pasta. <laughs> I know Kasara ratted me out yesterday, but I'll tell on myself today. Um, I'm glad you like it. I love it. Why it is? Sometimes scramble doesn't work. I feel like mix it up bot doesn't work all the time, and it makes me angry. Here, let me do it. <gasps> it's not even gonna do it when I tell it to do it. What the frick? What the frick? What the frick? Uh. Well, here, let me refund y'all. I don't know why it's not doing it. It might be broken. I don't know. Mix it up might be scrambled. Um, but, 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 <laughs> every time I, I end stream and, and like, you're one of the primary people, uh, that comes up on my list, I'm like, okay, we can't raid pasta again. We raided pasta like the last, the last like four times. And then I'll like, actively try and look for other people to raid <laughs> and then i'm like fuck it we're just gonna raid pasta <laughs> like i'm like he's too fucking cute we're just gonna raid pasta 
<laughs> every time. It happens every time. Um, 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 let me see. Good morning, slug. Cute new model. I hope you're having a good morning. Good morning, Clem. Thank you. And I am. I'm having a good morning, damn. Yeah, I don't know what's going on with the, with the thing, but, um, 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 hopefully it gets fixed later. Um, 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 I'm glad you like it. I love it. Gay couple doesn't even sound close to glottal slug. Your brain is weird. Yes, it does. Gay couple. Gas cap. Um, 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 yeah, glottal. Yeah, I got I got a little bit of cheek meat back there. I got a little bit of dumpy on this model. Uh, probably gonna restart, mix it up. Oh uh, yeah, you know what? That's probably a good call, Deckard. Here, let me close it. Which is a pain in the ass because usually my issue is I forget to open it. <laughs> so I actually remembered to today, and it didn't work. Kink over this model. I'm so jealous. It's so cute. I love it. Um um um. Slug is your brain okay? No. I often question your existence and sometimes my own, Slug. You are a menace to all possible societies. Why? What did I do? I didn't do anything yet. I haven't done anything yet today. Wait, have I? Wait, have I Have I been... Have I been... Did I do anything today? Here, refresh cache of current page. Let's see. Nope. Still fucked. Still fucked. Uh, turn it off. Turn it on. Still fucked. Yeah, I think it's a mix it up, but... Uh, not... I think it's not a skill issue on my part. Uh, enjoy your slurk, Abba, 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 Gramps double, exactly. Genuinely concerned for you, dude? Why? What are y'all, why are y'all gaslighting you? It's the real Christmas gift. Have a good Friday, Schlug. <gasps> Hi, k Fru, thank you. Uh, I hope you do, too. Um, um, Cinema will try to split the ticket to avoid being primary and attempting to make it a choice between her and a Republican. I hope it fucking goes the way she deserves. Um, also, hi, Dang Nabbit. Yeah, I saw that this morning. Uh, Kristen Cinema is an absolute piece of shit. Uh, and uh, hell is too good for her. Um, yada yada does a yada yada does a give me a break. Stun locks you? No, no, no. You, you uh, well, dang habit tried. Um, um, um. Also, hi Hexat. Hello, Slug. Did you see the end of the game awards? I saw the fucking. Are you talking about the weirdo who went on stage and like disrupted it? I didn't see it, but I saw all the fucking like memes and posts about it. And then like immediately after, it was like within a matter of two minutes, it was like, hey, this kid interrupted the game awards. Hey, wait, this kid was on InfoWars. Hey, this kid might be a Nazi. <laughs> it was within the span of like fucking two minutes. And a hard drive did a, a article about it where they were like, he speed ran being a racist, uh, uh, being like outing himself as a racist for uh, uh, which which was, you know, like as most gamers, I'm gonna send you an, a, the, a clip. It was extremely weird. Okay, pasta. Um, um, milkshake duck speed run any percent. It was fucking wild. Uh, yeah, I figured it would come up today, so we'll, we'll we'll talk about it. Your mere existence is a criminal offense. Also, hi hi. I hope you're having a great stream today. Hi Ben, thank you. I'm doing my best. I'm 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 just a little criminal. Wait, what? Yeah, we'll go over it. Hey slug, I have a request for the trailers. When the one for Crime Boss comes up, do not skip it. It's the wildest shit I've ever seen. Okay, I'll try and remember that. Slug stole my kneecaps in sleep? True. They both have a G and L in them. They're basically the same word. Yeah, exactly. Um, 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 recreation of a slug crime. Go fast instead of do it right. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. <laughs> the, uh, <laughs> today's, what, what is it? I, 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 I've been, I, I can't remember the shadow rant, the, the Jordan Peterson shadow rant. I can't remember it. That was fucking nuts. That kid is terrible. Yeah. So like. There's two ways I feel about this. Um, 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 one, it's funny that Jeff Cayley's little awards show got interrupted because I hate the fucking game awards. Um, two, uh, it's funny that that kid immediately got arrested for deciding to be an edgy little weirdo on 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 the game awards. You know what I mean? We'll see who cancels who. Yeah, uh, in a Peter Peter in a Peter Sonian sense. We'll see who cancels who. Uh, yo, he got Yippy with the maid dress. Hi, Zuchi. Yeah, we got a maid dress. I'm so surprised they just lit him up. I noticed it and commented on it. The second I saw him, looked out of Soto Place. Nobody did anything. I feel like everybody was like too stunlocked to fucking like determine, like like know what to do about him. Going to work and lurk. I know I say this all the time, but let me know if you want anything added or changed to the model. Um, um, I'm sure chat wants the Amoga size removed, but I don't. So I'm happy with it. Um, I love it so much, Glottal, and, and enjoy your slurkin work. Um, 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 and thank you for making this for me. I love it a lot. He was in a backstab of distance of Miyazaki, and that's the thing. Like, I'm not even like a fucking uh, Souls Andy. 
I'm not a fucking Elden Ring Andy, but like for him to undermine that was pretty fucking uh, 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 cringe. Jeff is apparently a pretty good guy. Eh, wrong. Like he's literally the only reason Kojima is still in the industry because he brought him to the Game Awards and Konami was like, hey, don't put Kojima on or we'll blacklist you. No, he's uh, he's an absolute fucking dork. Uh, uh, I don't give it one. I don't really give a fuck about Kojima for starters. Uh, two, uh, Jeff Cayley has always been a uh, 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 a fucking weirdo and uh, uh, um, like fucking platform people who don't deserve platforms. Um, um, and and continues to fucking uh, perpetuate the issues with the game industry. Also, his award show is fucking cringe. Uh, I fucking hate Jeff Cayley, and I fucking hated Jeff Cayley since he was on fucking G4. So it's funny to me that his little award show got ruined. That said, the little fucking uh, Nazi weirdo, uh, I'm glad got arrested. Um, 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 fair, fair, fair. Um, Jeff Cayley just wants to be Mads Mickelson to Kojima so bad. It's pathetic. Um, 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 hi, little being. Hi, Carnage. Good morning. Um, hi, slut. Can't stick around because I promised friends I would watch trailers tonight, but I'm a schlurk. Hope you have a very good day. <gasps> hi, um, thank you. Um, um, and I hope you have fun hanging out with friends. Um, hi, Samantha. We stunning, locking, and possibly popping. Yeah, watch this. Look at my butt. Look at my butt. My butt can pop and lock now. Um, in my opinion, Elden Ring is what AAA games should be instead of overmarketed DLC fests. Loot box sims and watching the devs get so disrespected sucks. I can agree with that sentiment, yeah. Like, I can agree with that sentiment because I don't even fucking like Elden Ring. I don't care about it. I don't care about Souls game. Um, hold on. Somebody's being a, a crimer. Hold on. What are you doing? What are you doing, huh? What are you doing? Whoa. Whoa! Okay, I'm back. Cringe Awards just adds fast. Yeah. Slug, I meant to call I meant to call you slug, not slut, I promise. Listen, I'm so used to getting called slut on this stream. I just figured M was like I, I just figured you you would like caught the vibes and you're like, okay, I feel comfortable enough calling him slut now. That's what I I took it as. I was just like, okay, let's go. Fuck it, we ball. <laughs> slut and deering, yeah. Um um can't stop looking at the eyes. They're super cute, even if I know what they truly are. Ah, <gasps> uh, pasta. Um, 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 let's see. That's a good butt. Hi, Samantha. Um, 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 apparently the kid had connections to InfoWars and was wearing Yeezys. Yeah, and a bunch of people are like, uh, oh, yeah, he's a, he's a, he's a weird little anti-Semite. Prove it. And I'm like, mm, yeah, okay, dude. Um, let's see. Yeah, I don't even really give a shit about Elden Ring, but like, uh, if, if in terms of like, that's what a AAA game should be, I agree. I, I do agree because it, it feels like there's a lot of effort put into it. Um, my favorite part of the Game Awards was seeing how dripped the fuck out Christopher Judge and the, his whole speech, the literally playing music to try and get him off the stage. Yeah, I don't even know what that's like, what was going on there, but slut derogatory positive. True. Sluggy, slutty, slut, 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 sluggy, slut. Yeah. Um, um, I like a little idol ring in Souls as a treat. I, I, Pasta, I already told you, I'm too stupid to play Souls games. I'm too dumb. I'll just get upset. Um, 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 let's see, let's see, let's see, let's see, let's see. Cat crime, yeah, he was like fucking with the door. He kept like, he was acting like it was, um, like it was stuck and it wasn't. He was just being annoying. Um, um, he was just like pulling on it and making noise. Uh, Christopher Judge was very funny and kind of cute. He thanked his mama. Aww, but upset slug cute. What do you mean? What do you mean upset slug cute? Um, clearly you weren't here for my Metal Gear attempt pasta. <laughs> uh, Christopher Judge is an absolute sweetheart. Aww. Um, Elden Ring is not a perfect game and definitely not for everyone, but from an objective standpoint, it's really well made and it knows what it is and what it wants to do. Yeah, and I can, even I can acknowledge that. Like, even I can acknowledge that. As somebody who's, like, never gonna play it, like, uh, I, I I can acknowledge that. Also, hi, one bean and one potato. Thank you for the shrimp. Here, let me see. Oh. One to this side, too. And then over here again. I like that I can, like, spider around my log now. Um, What the heck? Christopher Judge has the Giga Chad chaw line, does he? Here, let's go over here. Let's go over here. Let's go over here. Let's go over to the browser screen. Play Darkest Dungeon? No! Um, 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 where's my YouTube? Over here, and then do this. Do this. <gasps> where am I? Where am I? Hi, there I am. Hi. Hello. 
Um, 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 I'm low. Hi, Jelly. Hi. Oh, boy. Time for playlist. Well, yeah, yeah. But, Pasta, did you have the link of the weirdo so I can, like, dunk on him? So I can fucking tear him apart? It was whack that God of War got so many awards. Recency bias. That's why I don't care about the game awards. That's the thing. Like, yeah, recency bias is, is fucking real. Enter the gungeon. She entered my gungeon till I... Eh. Yeah, um, 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 um. Hi, no pretzel. Hello. Uh, my god, Slug would hate Unter the Gungeon? Probably. Um, 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 Slug, please click the enters, gets sturdy, and hits the gritty. Okay. It was not whack. That game deserves any award it got, and LD got game of the year, so question mark? I, yeah, I don't know. I didn't watch it, so I don't care. <laughs> but also, hi, Bean. I don't have an actual link, but I can make one set, one, one in a sec. I mean, it's fine. Uh, uh like, I, I, I didn't really see him going up there or him saying what he said. I just saw everybody reacting to it and then immediately saw that he was a little reactionary weirdo. And I was like, okay, well, that's cool. That's cool, I guess. Um, God of War absolutely deserves accessibility. TBH, like the accessibility features are really good. Oh, yeah. I know a lot of people really liked God of War, but um, I don't know. I, I haven't I haven't I haven't even played the old new one. Yeah, he said some anti-Semitic shit on stage. Yeah, which is why I'm, like, annoyed that, like, that's why I wanted to talk about it today. I'm annoyed that people are, like, memeing it and, like, haha, funny. And I'm like, no. What's funny is Jeff Cayley getting his show ruined. What What isn't funny is him going up there and 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 being uh, uh being a little cringe lord and doing um, 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 uh, anti-Semitism. That's that's not funny. Um, Like, I can I can I can acknowledge both these things. Um, Also, here, let's watch the at the gritty. Let's watch Neon hit the gritty. <laughs> Just like me. <gasps> Killer Teddy. Teddy! Yeah, I'll catch up on chat in a second. Because y'all are making good points. And I want to address them. I love that she's just like doing like full body face cam now with that stupid fucking cat mask. Kick. Whoa! She hit the gritty. <gasps> that yoinky splunky. The song to get sturdy to. Whoa. She doing the hoedown? True. <laughs> this is so cursed. <laughs> this is so fucking cursed. <laughs> fucking bingus. Right. Left. Whoa. My streamer. White. True. White woman dancing. It's so funny. True. Banned from the club. Wait, I didn't know Tobbs was in her background. That's cute. Oh. <laughs> The power of editing. The power of editing to make her lo not look embarrassing. Well, um, 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 Your wiggles are so great like this. Thank you, Xavier. Yeah, I'm very wiggly in this version. Um, uh, here, let me catch up a little bit. Uh, let's see. Hello. Slug, please click. And hits gritty. I did. Enter the gungeon. Uh, it was not wap. Uh, ba -ba. Yeah, he said anti-Semitic shit on stage, which is cringe. It's really scary because, like, he could have said anything he wanted, and also he could have had a weapon. He just fucking walked up there, and no one questioned it. Yeah, which I think, again, so 
like understand my like I think it's funny that it happened to Jeff Kaylee is I wanted like what I like about it is it undermines the like how unprofessional the game awards is and what a fucking joke it is. And my hope is that maybe he like fucking learns from this uh, cuz he wants it to be such like he wants it to be a true event, a real event so goddamn bad. Um and this proves just like how disorganized and how terrible it is and how it's always been. Um um that said, like I'm glad it wasn't fucking worse. Like it's fucking it's it's good that he's like a fucking like clearly a little weirdo and he fucking flubbed his little anti-Semitic line that he was going to try and drop. So he just made himself kind of look stupid and then got arrested for it, which is uh, uh, funny in its own right. But like, yeah, I'm glad it wasn't fucking worse. But uh, yeah, it was scary. We're out of the World Cup. What does that mean? Does that mean you won? <laughs> Wait, what does that mean? Oh, you're sad about it. I guess you didn't win. Morning, everyone. Hi, Pickle. Um, yeah, while Yi is normalized saying literal fash language too. Yeah, it's really fucking scary. I'm happy it wasn't much worse. Yeah, exactly. Um, let's see. Hi, Johnny. That yoinky spoinky should do in the hoedown. Why did Twitch censor a hoedown? <gasps> what do you mean Twitch censored hoedown? Dancing white woman. Uh, dancing is so funny. Everyone has at least a few empty Amazon boxes sitting on the floor, especially if you have a cat. Um, hey, Slug, can you play this game? What game? It's a Twitter link, by the way. Uh, yeah, go ahead. You can send it. Wigglefied. Um, um, your wiggles are so great. Thank you. Hi, Yoko. Good morning. What the Game Awards? The Game Awards is a cringe celebration of, of games and applying awards to uh, games that have come out throughout the year on arbitrary basis is, is, is to determine who's the best. And it's something I don't really give a shit about. But normally it's a uh, it's an excuse to drop a bunch of exclusive trailers. No slug, we lost you himbo. Oh, I'm sorry. Oh, I'm sorry. I didn't. I don't know how to sports. What's this? I don't know what sports are. Oh, yeah, I've seen this. You want me to play it? It looked kind of cringe. I'm not going to lie. Like, it looked like it might be scary, but also kind of cringe. I'll watch the trailer in a second. Also, as bad as it is, one of the worst things fascists can do for their communities is be embarrassing because they worship being cool. It's like when the fascist leader shits himself and got ousted from his organization. Yeah, again, it's why, like, as much as I hate fucking Nick Fuentes and, and like, all those groipers, like, I don't know if you ever saw that fucking video of them, like, wandering through the Capitol Hall and, like, like, like shouting but it was one of the most embarrassing things i've ever seen in my life and they constantly like trip over their own dicks and like make themselves look really stupid um which i'm grateful for to some degree uh it's the same where it's like with all the dipshits who like raided the capital um like just making complete asses of themselves and you know proving that they really backed the blue by murdering a cop um like yeah it's it's a it's a it's a it's a net benefit to them not being able to recruit better um Super excited for Hades Girl Edition. I haven't watched the trailer, but I saw everybody talking about it, and I was like, what, Hades 2? So I'm really I'm really excited to see the trailer. Uh, I watch the trailers and memeing on the shit with friends, but eh, yeah, it's cringe. Um, 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 also, as bad as thing, yeah, 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 exactly, Frosty. Uh, Game Awards feels like, we're look, we're cool too, but at the same time, I'm glad it exists because seeing games get recognized for, like, accessibility. Uh, a lot of the awards are dumb, but the accessibility one is nice. I don't even, like... I don't even know when the accessibility award got added, so that's very recent. Like, even if it did get, like, like I guess it's good, but that's very recent. Um, thank you for the the neophyte sippy. Um, the neophyte sippy. Hi, neophyte. Thank you for the spippy. I don't know why I said it like that. And again, it feels uh, like uh, do they even spend time on it, or do they like breeze right over it? Like, y you know what I mean? Um, um, um. Hi. Good morning. Um, uh, a lot of the awards are dumb, but the accessibility one is nice. Hades 2, Demily Edition. True. Hi, Slug and Chat. Have you seen the new SF6 trailer? I haven't seen any of the trailers. I haven't seen any. But Ash, thankfully, made me this big playlist so we can watch all the trailers that were shown yesterday. Uh, I think it got added very recently. They did spend, they do spend time on it. Well, that was good. It was actually a bigger award. That's good. I'm glad. Uh, I, I guess I'm, I'm glad then. Um, 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 nice, nice. Yeah, I think it got added very recently. I think it was added in the last few years. Mm -hmm. We also confirmed the gal who accepted the accessibility award was trans. Oh, that's poggers. Um, 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 accessibility got its own segment. It was not one of the rapid fire ones. Gotcha. Because that was what I was expecting. So I'm glad it got a little bit of attention. Um, let's watch this. Let's watch this. Uh, let's see. Like, I I saw this forever ago. It's the same trailer that they showed when it was, like, teasing. I think Dupe's going to play it tonight. 
I think Duper's playing it tonight. Choo Choo Charles. Like, I feel like... I feel like it'll be fun for about, like, 20 minutes, and then it'll just start to be annoying. You know what I mean? Like, do you, you, you know what I mean? Like, does that make sense? Does that... I don't know. Maybe my assessment of the game is not valid. Agreed? Yeah. Like, I feel like it'll be fun for, like, 20 minutes. It'll be like, ooh, scary! And then, like, after about 20 minutes, I'll be like, all right, I, I'm over it. Like, I don't care anymore. Gives me bad rise vibes for some reason. Right? Yeah, I don't know what that is either, Frosty. There's nothing inherently, like, bad about it beyond, like, obviously creepy spider train, but, like, something about it gives me bad vibes, yeah. Who's the best little slug on Twitch? Who's a good slug? Who's a good slug? Is it me? Is it me? Am I a good slug? Hi, Professor Q. Whoa. Yeah. I feel like it'll, like, this too. Like, you gotta use the bombs and stuff. I feel like it'll very quickly devolve into a slender type. You know what I mean? Oh, Train Game came out? That's cool. I don't know if I'd ever play it, but I'd definitely watch a playthrough. Yeah, that's kind of how I feel about it. <laughs> also, hi, Chugga. Um, um, I think this would have been a better without the Thomas theme. You have, you could have made a game with a ton of different creepy monsters. Yeah. Or like a bunch of different creepy variations of like vehicles and stuff. Like, yeah, I, yeah, I think so. It's definitely not my thing, but I watched the dev make it and he streamed it a bunch. Huh? Uh, maybe it's because I never saw it as a scary game. Oh, really? This, this, this would make me uncomfortable and scare me at least for a little bit. Then I'd get annoyed, but. Yeah. Yeah. Uh we watched wholesome games yesterday. We did. Um 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 and I liked it. I think this would have Oh, that's true. We did watch those trailers yesterday. The uh I know you act as you're probably not gonna see a lot of gameplay in the main game awards when the wholesome game stuff has gameplay, but don't expect Yeah, we watched the wholesome games yesterday. Um, which was fun. Um 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 it kind of makes me think of that as a Bigfoot game. <gasps> yeah, I forgot all about that. Hassan played that back when it came out. I watched Hassan, Will Neff, and Daft play that. Uh, it makes me think of the, the Bigfoot game. It's gonna have tons of HP and it's just gonna hop in every now and then you shoot it and it runs away and you get uh you get away or die every five minutes. Yeah, exactly. One hundred percent. Saw it as a fun survival game. Eh. Um, but I do know that, uh, here, let's see, shout out, it's Duper, I think is, I think they have an underscore, but I know Duper's playing it tonight, uh, I saw on Twitter that he, he posted that he was gonna do it, uh, I didn't realize y'all watched it yesterday, you could skip those then, okay, it gives me the vibes of someone who found a Thomas to train creepy pasta image from 2003 and thought, whoa, that's so funny and scary, yeah, same, um, shout out failed, what the fuck, what the fuck, shout out Duper, is this is this do? Is this do? I don't know. Yeah, okay. They they changed their name. Skill issue. Listen here, you. Listen here, you. Yeah, that's there. You go. That's if you don't follow Dupe, he's funny. He's funny llama. Um um um. Skill issue. I don't think it's working. I don't think it's working. I'm gonna pause him for now. Actually, here I'm gonna refund you and then. Pause scrambled and pause skill issue. I don't know why they're not working, but funny haunts creature. Yeah, I'm happy my friends can't spell either. True. All right, let's watch some of these uh, game trailers. Let's let's go. We watched this one. We watched this one. We watched this one. Uh, I really I'm excited for Way to the Woods. Like this was one of the ones where I was like, oh, soy pog. Like I want to play that one. Slug your eyes make me want to do a violence. Why? What's wrong with them? What's wrong with them, Vean? What about them? Why do you want to do a violence? What's wrong? Uh, Duper is mad funny. He's on the same stream team as a lot of my other favorite streamers. Yeah, I love... <laughs> Fuck you. <laughs> I love Duper. They're really funny. Um, um, uh, valid response. Understandable. Um, but no, I was... I'm. Ooh, why am I inflating? Um, um, I'm really... Uh, I'm, I'm really excited for Way to the Woods. I asked Bonker if he wants to do the Slonker stream as this game. Um, and he said he might be down. Um, I think this would be a good slonker stream. I think this would be a good slonker stream. Blonker. Here, let me... There we go. Are slugs I sus guy, not Germa? Yeah, they're, they're, they're Amoguses. They're Amoguses. Hi, Lieutenant Havoc! Yum. We watched this yesterday, but it was cute. And I feel like the game is, like, really cute and peaceful. And me and Bonker would make it like a nightmare. 
Not Amogus's Among Guy. True. I feel like me and Bonker would turn this into an absolute shit show. A dog and a hunt. That game looks very cute. True. Among Guy. True, Glottal. Definitely I'm triple A pilled in the game. The biggest game I'm excited for is one of those. Oh no, Jelly, we won't hold it against you. Can I link a funny tweet? Oh, uh, sure. Yeah, sure. Uh, let's see. Sanctus. This is new for me. Okay. Yeah, let me see what this tweet is real quick. Whoa. Let me see what this tweet is real quick. What is this? What is this? I googled porn of you. You're a pervert. The furry community claimed that sexual element is small. A Google search for furry porn. <laughs> okay, dude. Like, at common, common paid for Twitter L. Like, the fuck? <laughs> what do you mean? The furry community claimed that the sexual element is small. A Google search for furry porn because I put porn into the fucking Google link. Suggests otherwise. Of course adults could do what they want and wish for other consenting adults, but no one should be compelled to offer praise or admiration. Why are, why are the police doing this? Wait, what do you mean, why are the police doing this? Wait, what? What? There is no hidden messaging or political statement being made in art. Is a design created by... What is this? What? Look at this amazing you know, one of our rag car... Talented by a 14 year old. Why are the police making furry porn? They don't know about rule 34. So it's a police group. We are fair cop. The only fair cop is never mind. I'm not going to finish that because it'll get me banned. Uh, the do not, they do not exist to promote niche sexual fetish or help dress. Hand. There's no hidden messaging. Please ask that people respect talent. Okay. Gender critical. Yeah. Wait, let's, 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 let's. Hold on, I want to go to their pet profile. 14-year-old made furry art of a cop? <laughs> hold on. <laughs> hold on, hold on. I can't say this out loud, so I'm going to find the image. Now, this might seem harsh, but I think that... <laughs> Here. Here's how I feel. My brain is breaking. Yeah, here's how I feel about this. <laughs> true <laughs> norm said it not me uh kind of kind of base norm rip rest in peace uh rip legend <laughs> uh i hate this i hate everything about this i hate everything about this uh especially the cop aspect of it um all right we're done 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 what what a nightmare it looks like the art was non-sexual furry art of a cop and people are trying to make it into a sexual fetish thing yeah i think what fucking threw me the most is like we googled furry porn and the results will surprise you <laughs> yeah basically trying to say furries are like a sexual thing inherently which is wrong and stupid and bad and their justification was like we googled furry porn you're never gonna believe what we found yeah a cab includes furry cops. That too. That's why. Uh, that's why I think Norm felt the way he did. You know what I mean? That's why I think Norm felt the the way he did about that that the entire segment. I could Google cop porn and give the same argument. True. I googled porn and found porn. Checkmate, atheist. That's the most insane rabbit hole I've ever seen, especially with the gender critical and the fair cops account that paid for Twitter. Common paid for Twitter. L block everybody who paid for Twitter, uh, or at least mute them. Um, how dare porn come up when I Google porn? It's your fault because of the the uh, the moral degradation of society or something. Common gender critical L, yeah. Um, um, we Google X porn and found porn of X. Therefore, X is a fetish. Yeah, shrimp lads. The fact that they saw art from a child and thought, is this a fetish oh, no. is wild. Yeah, again, like, says a lot that the cops immediately, or the, like, not the cops, but like the cop bootlickers, I guess, is what that account is for, is like, uh, uh, for sucking off cops like that they saw that and their immediate thought was like is this is this should we sexualize this child like uh maybe not maybe you uh shouldn't do that have you considered not doing that um let's see uh cops are perverts because handcuffs are used in zorn true 
Uh, apparently, Bolsonaro wanted to travel to Qatar to celebrate if we won the World Cup. Never mind, I'm not sad anymore. Rip Bozo. Wait, can he even go anywhere with his, like, rotting flesh and broken legs and, like, like isn't he, like, a fucking rotting vampire at this point? If they Googled furry art and it was all porn, that would maybe prove some kind of point. It would be like they're going for, but like, yeah, and I guarantee that if I, like, I'm going to do it in the off, like, the other browser, but, like, furry art. Like, I'm sure maybe some porn will come up, but, like, uh, let's see. Yeah, none of this is porn. Like, yeah, at least in, like, the very, like, initial, yeah, the initial, if you go to Google Images and put furry art, like, okay, there's some porn. But, like, it, it, it takes a minute. Well, I guess the four counts as porn, but... Most of this is not porn. By the way, Slug Bozo is what we call Bolsonaro here. That's pretty funny. Um, uh, let's see. Even then, is this a porn? Are cops a fetish because of cop porn? Yeah. I think he's literally got a flesh-eating virus. I hope so. So in theory, he can move. He's going to military graduations and events, huh? Why are we spending so much uh, on these disgusting sex perverts? Defund the police? True! Uh, ACAB. Um, 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 Google Sonic Inflation TBH, but yeah, his son posted a pic of his leg and yeah, he's rotting. Yeah. Uh, that's what fascism does to you, baby. I mean, if you scroll down enough after searching anything, you get some lewd stuff. Yeah, exactly. Um, Google Sonic Inflation. Yeah. Uh, Brandon, Joe Brandon pressed the inflation button and that's why toilet paper costs more. Google Sonic Inflation to learn more. Slug, do note your search results on Google are based on your Google profile. Huh? <laughs> but I don't look for Vor. I don't actually like Vor. Vor actually really freaks me out. I'm not I'm not a Vor handy. Thank you for the spippy and the scrimge. Owned. Hence the front page Vor. No, I don't like Vor. It actually like really freaks me out. It's a really like uh, listen, I have like I have claustrophobia and 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 and, and like like thassalophobia. Um, um, like it makes me really, <clears throat> the concept of like being in a small space like that, sorry, I'm stretching the concept of being in a small space like that makes me really fucking uncomfortable. So I never really got the appeal, but, um, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. Maybe Google thinks it knows me better. Uh, slug, blah, blah. So you might get more or less images due to this. Uh, leftists might have brain rot, but the right is literally rotting. <laughs> True. Um, 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 I, when I used to troll Second Life back in the day, they had an entire sim dedicated to the four. It was, uh, wild. Yeah, it's scary. Uh, hope my gif was okay. It was just me being silly. What gif? What do you mean? Whoa, whoa, whoa. not understand how Google works? What, what, what? Are you okay, Mons? You're, you, you should be fine. I don't see anything. True story. A friend that was in prison was told by a correctional officer that the only difference between them was that he got caught. Yeah, hundred percent. Um, um, uh, fucking er, like again, like serious message. All cops are bastards. Every single cop is a bastard. Um, also high max level. Uh, return to Schlug. <gasps> you don't want the Omoga size anymore? Okay, hold on. <gasps> um, Sluggy. True. It's true. It's true. Whoa. Hi. Hi. I want to make sure it wasn't breaking. Hi. Hello. I'm here. I'm here. Hello. Uh, I didn't realize there's a chibi redeem. A chibi redeem. Well, it's broken right now. The chibi redeem's broken, so I have it paused and turned off. It should be paused and turned off. Oh no! Um, oh no! Um, 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 um. No, I don't like four chat. No, I don't like vor. Oh, the ugly cry. Yeah. Uh, Fungi made that forever ago. Uh, go to chibi regular slug. Uh, it's broken right now. Hopefully, this is okay. Is this okay? Or do you want me to refund you? Uh, Slug has more juice to squeeze out in this form compared to Slippy. <gasps> True. Okay, here, let me play the trailer. I actually was able... Yeah, it's fine. Okay, gotcha. I was actually able to convince someone of ACAB this morning by explaining it's the result of the system and not individuals of more failing individuals. Let's fucking go! And that's what it is. It's... Uh, I mean, y'all know this. We've talked about it a million times, but, like, ACAB is because uh, the institution is uh, founded on white supremacy and reinforces the tenets of white supremacy and capitalism. Uh, so even if somebody has good intentions... Um, um, it doesn't matter because they're part of a broken system and they're enforcing the aspects of that broken system. And as a result, they will either fall in line or, 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 um, 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 be ousted or killed. Um, that is how, uh, uh, cops operate, uh, which is why it's a cab, uh, only good cop quits. Yeah. One way or another. Um, um, what do you mean? Predatory people create predatory systems. Yeah, exactly. What about ASAG? All slugs are, all slugs are gay. 
Well, I guess that's true. <laughs> If we're using me as the model, um, only good cop quits. Also, hi, Johan. Good morning. Um, 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 true. Um, uh, a big if true. <laughs> Try not to get too distracted, Sluggy. I know you'll pause like 50 times anyway. I'll do my best here. Let me, um, let me, let me, let me. All right, I'm going to let it rip. Let's go. You think the only slug I know and you're gay? Therefore, yeah, shrimp as. Have you ever wondered how far? Only good. <laughs> Yeah, an Animal Crossing, obviously. Also, okay, yeah. Actually, before we move on from this topic, sorry, sorry. Um, um, uh, some of you might be wondering to yourselves, well, if all cops are bastards and I'm in a position where I'm in trouble, what do I do? Like, do I call the do I call the the cops? Like, what do I need to do when I should be able to call the cops and I'm in trouble and I need help? Well, I'm glad you asked. Um, a five second pause, Andy, shut up. Um, I'm glad you asked. Exclamation point A cab in chat will bring you to a link that shows you to all sorts of policing resources and alternatives, al alternative policing resources, rather, where um, these are all um, 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 way better alternatives that you can reach out to if you find yourself in a position where, where uh, you need help. Um, and it should have listings for uh, 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 every city. There's a couple uh, of, 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 what do you call them? Provinces, I think, and, and, and Canada as well included on there. But it's a very useful resource. Um, 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 yeah, like in most situations, if you can avoid calling the cops, you're better off because they don't help. They just escalate. Uh, they'll probably throw up, show up three hours later and shoot your dog. They, they don't, they're not going to help the situation. So that's a good uh, alternative resource if you're looking for one. Uh, we keep us safe. Exactly. Yeah. Find community, build community, um, and don't talk to cops. And, and if you absolutely have to talk to cops, don't fucking don't tell them as much information as you can. Um, okay. Anyway, there we go. Trailer time. Oh, hi. Birdcage. Movie time. Oh, what is this? Sanctus. Why does this look like a, a PS2 game? Hot nuns in your area? Why does this look like the Diablo uh, cutscenes? It's a YouTube video slug? Oh. The only thing you should tell cops is I want a lawyer? Exactly. Also, hi, gamer girly. Looks more like PS3 to me. Oh, booba. Borpa. Oh. What? What? All right, it's working. So there are a few situations that are requiring me to... Other than that, I'm not going to call them if I can avoid it. Yep. Whoa. Toronto is on the list. Let's go. Hi, Alantrax. Booba. Wow, censorship. So much for the tolerant left. What is happening? I don't know what's happening in this trailer. Why are they naked? Oh. I'm off work today and unhinged. I'm so sorry. It's okay. It's a good day to be unhinged. What is happening? This wasn't at the Game Awards, was it? Where did you find this? I don't know what to make of that. It didn't tell me enough to know what I should make of it. This gives me bad vibes. I agree. Oh, wait. What the fuck? Wait. Why is it... Where's the playlist? Okay, here we go. <gasps> Cringe. Stop. Okay. Hi, Shluggu. Hi, brother man. Hi, um... Will, 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 Valiant Hearts? I thought that was Will Neff Hearts. My brain's broken. Netflix made a game? Oh, God. And it's Ubisoft? Oh, God. So I go play with, so keep playing the videos. I didn't see him on the side. Uh-huh. Kring. Valiant Hearts is good? Whoa. <laughs> Don't make fun of me for being old. What's Valiant Hearts? Oh, you should stay. Your penance is listening to Slug's bad opinions, Drew. 
Great little World War One game. Hmm. Hmm. Old Ubi game? Oh, oh, worm? Really? Like an old, old Ubi game before Ubisoft is cringe. Heard this game is really good. If it's old Ubisoft, I could see that. Point and click? Oh, the art style's cute. Doggy. No, I'm old Slug as a youngin. Oh, I'm a youngin. I like the art style, me too. The Gloom of the Wounded. 2014? Oh, that's not that old. But, I mean, I guess it's better than old modern Ubisoft. You're not old. You're max level. Exactly. Side scroller game about World War One, where you play different characters and gives you backgrounds on the war. Uh, where they started milking the rabbits. And that's the thing. Like, the rabbits aren't even... Like, I've been watching Roz play um, the new rabid Mario game. It's actually really good. It's, like, actually a really good, competent game. Like, I can't even be mad at it. Uh, Last of Us Part... Nope. I don't care. Nope. Don't give a shit. Uh, to mobile, that eight, that's eight-year slug. Good God. Good God. Yeah, I guess so. Hi, Z-Man. Um, um, the Mario Rabbits is inexplicably good. I have no fucking, like... I can't even be mad at it. She loves the she loves the rabbits and 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 she loves uh those games and they're really really good. They're like they're really really good. Um um now get off my lawn. Yeah, exactly. Came out when World War 1 was 100 years ago. Oh. There are hot women in this one. Oh. I could never get into the Last of Us either. I did not like the first Last of Us. Like just 100 I I don't know if I've talked about this before, but the first Last of Us I I did not like. I did not like it at all. Um, um, like so much so that I like kind of like quit because it was clunky as fuck. And then when they just kept fucking rehashing it, I grew to hate it. At first, I was like, okay, maybe it's a good game, and it's not just it's just not for me. But like after it kept getting fucking made, I was like, I I I I I actually fucking hate this franchise at this point. I want JRPGs and VNs. True. Does Roz also like Minions? Not as much, but she doesn't like dislike them. You know what I mean? We're almost three years into the decade. Yeah, it's kind of fucked. Uh, problem with UB is 50% of their games are bad. 50% of their games are good. 100% of their games are made under crunch. True. Um, let's see. Rabbit stream win. Oh, my God. I wanted to get a PlayStation just because I wanted to get The Last of Us, but never got it. Yeah, you, you didn't miss much. Has Ross played Luigi's Mansion? Yes, yeah, she did. I bought that for her, actually. Uh, um, um, two? Years ago, whenever whenever the new one came out, I, I got that for her, and she loved it. She liked it a lot. What is this? Sonic? The Gloom. Okay. I figured if she liked Rabbit, she would like that. Uh, nice, I'm glad. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's a very fun... I don't know if I ever actually played that myself. I don't think I ever played the new Luigi's Mansion. I think the last one I played was Dark Moon. The Joe Mad game? What's Joe Mad? <gasps> Joe Many Liberals! I like The Last of Us one story, but the game is clunky as hell. Two was bad because it was dark, gritty with zero hope at all. Which the point of the game was to be dark, show that things get better. Yeah, exactly. Comics artists. Oh. That's credibility in my theory that rabbits are the video game equivalent to minions. Essentially, yeah. This isn't Diablo. It looks more like Paladins or like Overwatch. Buff Woman. I'm going to be real. This, uh, this, uh, this art style is incredibly, uh, unappealing to me. It's like an MMO looter game slug. Oh, so like Borderlands. But an MMO. He worked on another game that I got never gonna run playing. The one Kyria was excited for. It's very Tarchlight. Yeah, I'm not really into it. Um, I can't lie, I've got an aversion to the rabbit games. They aren't cute. You could time me out. No, 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 no. I don't I I don't disagree, Pasta. I like Roz loves them. I fucking I can't stand them. I think they're ugly as fuck. I hate them. That said, they yassified some of them in the newest game. And uh uh would Dune? Yeah, I don't care. I don't give a shit. Dune Poggies? Oh, sorry. <laughs> I don't care. 
I don't care. Yeah, it's a fight rabbit would. Yeah. Tekken. Urewa. I'm not going to play it, but I used to be a Tekken Andy. Look very much like Orcs Must Die. Hmm. Lily? Or not? Wait, what's her name? Is it Lily? Probably end up playing the Dune game with my brother and our mutual friends. Oh. Hi, Derpy. Of course you were. I love Tekken. What do you mean? Back in the day, anyways. It's been a long time since I've given a shit about Tekken, but... I, I like the uh, peripheral enjoyment of this. It's so pretty. It does look really good. I haven't played Tekken since 2. I think the last one I played was Tag 2. The Slotchy Slumchy, hello? <gasps> Hi, VT White. I want to play Brisket? True. Oh, that's not Lily. Who the fuck is that? Is that a new character? <gasps> Eight, but it's also a chain? But it also could be the infinity symbol? <gasps> wow. Fist meets fate. Whoa. Wow. Hi, Crepe. Um, I can say from experience. Anyone who grew up on Tekken is deranged? True. <laughs> they should put Kiryu Ka Yakuza into Tekken, in my opinion. The the it's actually cringe. The whole reason this looks interesting. Oh, it's Hellboy? Never mind, I don't care. Um, um, I'll watch it though. Um, um, Dragon of ba Baby. Um, 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 the, uh, the, the whole reason Kiryu can't be in fighting games, um, even though he would very much fit in them, is because the director's like, he would never hit a woman, so they won't put him in, which I'm like, eh, okay. Wait, what's wrong with Hay Hellboy? I just, I just, I just, I just, it feels very soy pog to make, uh, fucking, to make fucking, like, I have no issue with Hellboy. My issue is, like, making... Uh, fucking, uh, uh, what do you call it? Like, 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 like adaptations of media that already exists. It's very soy pog and bat chats to me. You know what I mean? It's kind of cring, but I'll give it a chance. We'll see. I know I'm being unfair. Soy point video game for sure. Yeah. I like Mike McNo McNola. I don't know what that means. Put in Dragon Ball Fighters. Let him play hit 14 different Gokus. Yeah. And so I'm pointing at Hades too. I probably will too. Half has reason that doesn't want to go FF's Noctis is in. He doesn't hit women. Yeah, exactly. He's the artist for Hellbow. Oh. Has never gotten anything inside of the movies. It's gotten comics. It's gotten television adaptation. I think there was a cartoon. I think it's had a, f a handful of games, too. Now nah, I'm going to disagree with you. He's like, that's fine. I have this aversion at this point to, like, adapted versions of properties that already exist, which I know isn't fair. Like, it's it's like a knee-jerk reaction. So for me, like, this is like seeing a Funko Pop, and it just makes my hackles raise, even if that's not fair. Like, I understand that's not necessarily a valid assumption. It's just, It's just how... It's just uh, how um, I react. Also, this looks pretty mid. So <laughs> that that looked pretty mid. I understand the fight or flight reaction. Yeah, exactly. That's what it is. It's fight or flight, but it's it's not the case. I will say it looks incredibly mid. Um, 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 uh, uh, all about the comics, toss everything else. Mm, I thought this game was going to be another Telltale game until they start fighting. Director retired. And they added Kiryu Rainbow Six Siege, so there's a chance. It could be a fighting game now. Interesting. Uh, but that's because I grew up in an era when comic adaptations were almost entirely shit. Maybe that's what it is, Matt. Maybe it's because we're too boomer. Also, hi, Matt. Speaking of fight or flight. Yeah, flight. Fuck Bayonetta. Final Fantasy. Fuck Bayonetta. Comic book games can be good now. Yeah, I think, yeah. I think it's just like, I'm so fucking... Broken from being a boomer. Which is not true in the 90s. Yeah, or even the early 2000s. Good comic book games are a very recent thing. Yeah. What? No, don't fuck Bayonetta? Well, I would fuck Bayonetta, but... But I won't play another Bayonetta game. I'm done with Platinum. Me and Platinum, the breakup. It's over. F Bayonetta, I probably would. Same. This actually looks pretty fun. 
I'm not even a Final Fantasy Andy. I feel like she would fuck you. Yeah, exactly. Get the strap. Let's go. Turtles in Time, though? Turtles in Time fucking ruled. True. The rare exception. It's not even a normal Bayo style game, which I thought was cool. I don't care. I'm not giving Platinum money. I don't give a fuck. Couldn't care less. Couldn't care less. Now in the game, you win Slug Bayonetta is like eight years old in that game? Wait, what do you mean? What? Why is she eight years old? Oh, it's hi, Kusa. Hi, Kusa. It's been a while. I hope you're doing well. Play the trailer? No! <laughs> no! I am, in fact, an FF Andy because it's an origin game. Oh, I don't care. They brought on... They brought on the combat designers from DMC5 to do the combat for FS16, which is hype as hell. Yeah, which is why I'm actually really excited about it. It explains how she got her demon. Oh, uh, okay. If you watch the trailer, you would know why, baby man. No! No! 2023. It's not that Hellboy is bad, but when a company digs up almost all forgotten piece of media that for a game, it rings the warning bells. Yeah, exactly. It's like, it's like, like, like Higgs said, I think fight or flight rendered like a storybook, which is really cool. What? Bayonetta. I don't care. The last good FF game time besides them of those on PS2, but DMCA guy, DMC guy might be good. That's a hot take, Archmage. I'm not really even an FF Andy, but that's that's a pretty hot take. I think um uh I think 15 had a lot of potential. 15 had a lot of potential and it was good until the second half of the game and then it falls apart. The gameplay of FS is a shame the devs have been super cringe about not having POC in their setting. Yeah, I forgot about that. That's also really cringe. Uh just because an IP is in the hot in, in the hot met doesn't mean it's forgotten. Hot met. Hot met? Hot met. Star Trek is a forgotten series? What's a hot met? What's a hot met? Still sucks that Yoshi P is kind of a scumbag of POC in his games. Yeah, which that alone might make me not get the game. I'm not going to lie. Hot meta. Oh, uh, is it? I don't remember hearing a lot of good about 15 and 13 and 12 was PS2. 15 was actually really good for the first half of the game, and then it falls apart in the second half because it was rushed. Um, because they fucking restarted it like 12 times. But um, uh, it was actually really good in the first half. After that, it falls apart. Um, I gotta get to Worm. Good luck getting to Hades 2, y'all. 15 is kind of a mess, but nice. Yeah, I like 15, but it's definitely unfinished. Yeah, I honestly like the combat in 15. Yeah, exactly. It had a lot of good in it. And again, like I stand by the first half being good. After that, it falls apart. Bye, Traves. Good luck at Worm. Realism in games is horseshit. All the fantastical stuff having black people is where we draw the line. Yeah, exactly. Exactly, Chugga. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, like fuck off, dude. What is this? Crime boss. Oh. Why is um why is Chris Pratt's dad from Guardians being mean to us? Say hi to Michael Rooker. Oh. What the? Three interesting prototypes stitched together into a mess? Yeah, that's a good way to put it, Glottal. Oh. Oh, is this like Muppy Player? Danny Trejo. After 13, people shit on it because they don't like the game was more linear. Yeah, I don't think 13 was bad, but... I had no idea what this game was supposed to be. Mike Madsen from Reservoir Dogs in video games. Red flag. Red flag. Red flag. Red flag. Red flag. Eh. Rut row. Rut row. Vanilla Ice is like a racist piece of shit, dude. Gets worse. This dude sucks. Yep. No. Eh. She vanilla on my ice till I don't play the game. Linear doesn't equal bad. I love having a certain talking to whoever came up with that shit. Yeah. Sh oh. <laughs> Get out of here. Get the fuck out of here. <laughs> Villainize the self for Jojo Kai. Yeah. True. Ah! Chuck Norris. What is it? Fucking 2002. What is this fucking Iron Maiden ass music? 
Game looks cool as hell, but it runs like liquid ass. True. <laughs> Buck Chorus, true. It looks like um it looks like Bioshock, kind of. A little bit. They sold me on the idea before the last two guys. Okay, calm down. Jesus Christ. Chuck Norris joke, guys? True. Yeah, uh, same pickle, actually. I would have been on board until they fucking showed uh, uh, the last two. You're the worst boomer? Why? <laughs> Why? What did I do? People always compare it to Bioshock. <laughs> Why? <laughs> Why? What did I do? <laughs> what did I do? That was not Iron Maiden? What was it? It sounded like Iron Maiden. Returnal. Whoa. This looks like Scuffed Risk of Rain. It was made by the people who made Bioshock? Yippee! Did not? It sounded like Iced Earth or, or, or Iron Maiden. Probably more like Iced Earth. I like Returnal, but for a rogue, like, it takes way too fucking long. This just looks like not good. Not as good. I guess not not good, but not as good Risk of Rain. To me, anyways. As somebody who's never played either. Just from, like, uh, me standing outside of their house watching it through their window. It was a PS5 title that's finally coming off that console. Uh, gonna get hay-rated by Iron Maiden fan slug. Why? <laughs> like Iron Maiden that much. Also, hi, Matt. I don't know if I said hi. Another PS5 exclusive going to PC. Oh, a PS5 exclusive. It feels surreal. The PS5 came out like a year ago now, huh? <gasps> Anime! In their 70s, our boomers, by the definition I'm genic slacker, damn it. True. You what? 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 What did I do? Genshin? Oh, I don't care. I don't give a shit. It's Genshin Slug? Never mind. So like play Raw 2 with me and you'll get angry? <gasps> okay. Genshin cringe? Yeah, I don't care. Whoa. Wild Hearts? What's this? You don't like Iron Maiden? I don't dislike Iron Maiden. They're just not like one of my favorites. I like Iron Maiden uh, enough. It's not my favorite like metal band or favorite metal band of the era even. 39 years on this planet. Let's go. It's like Monster Hunter, but you can tame the beasts. Wait, you can make them your your friends? Oh. That's not what you do to friends. I love Risky Rain, and I'm good at dying in it. I've never played it. I want to try it, though. I meant Roar. Don't get mad at me, too. I get mad at me? Rawr. Rawr. Favorite slug 80s metal band. 80s metal. See, I'm really... I'm a Black Sabbath Andy. Which isn't really 80s. 80s metal. 80s metal. Because I consider Iron Maiden 70s too. We call it Tough Love Slug. That's Doom. Rawr. Okay, based. Yeah, I love Black Sabbath. I like the 70s era of metal, personally. 80s is okay. It's hard to think of one off the top of my head though right now. Slug, it's Destiny? Oh, thank you. I don't care. Skip. Thank you. <laughs> thank you. <laughs> Do you hear of Black Sabbath ain't bad? It's not it's not terrible. I prefer Ozzy, even though he's cringe, but company I don't care. I don't give a shit. This isn't even game. This is this is like this is like live action bullshit. Fuck off, dude. I don't care. Get out of my house. Street Fighter. She had the skip function of multiple parts of the live event. True. <laughs> Blending trashier stuff with metal and influence symphonic metal, so I gotta love them. That's valid. I really like the vibe of Street Fighter VI. I have no real intention of playing it, but uh, I can tell you are barely paying attention because chat has to tell you. True. But I really like the aesthetic. Is that Hagar? Wait, was that Hagar? Hold on. It is Hagar. Buffed women and cake alert. Wait. Oh, these are like creative characters? The buff woman, also the pink hair. Mm. 
Yep, yep. I was like, why is he doing a sonic boom? Is he like uh, Guile's like apprentice or something? Italy. <gasps> Awooga. Whoa! You can create your own character. Mm -mm. Who? Whoa. Bipson? DJ? Manon. I like Manon. Hello, hello, Slug Lord. Hi, Bass. I like Manon a lot. <laughs> oh my god. She got the spats. Let's go. That's a good look. That's a good look. Whoa. Marissa, is that the big lady? They're cute too. So you miss Buff Woman? No, I saw them. I'm just not like super into them. I'm going to be real. They have kind of a JoJo design. Not super into it. They're fine though. Man in the French one? Yeah, the one with the spats. Buff Woman's fine. She's got she's got uh she's got Bruno's hair though from from JoJo and it's off-putting to me. I'm glad there's Buff Woman, but I like the pink one more. Me too. Bruno Mars? No, uh, 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 what's Bruno's last name? Spats equals very good. True. Yeah, Bruno Mars. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> True. She got the He-Man hair. I have no intention of playing Strunt fodder. Me either. I don't think I'll fucking get this, but I'm happy for it. It looks cool. Wait. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Stop. Go back. There was something I saw at the end. Oh my god, I'm gonna I'm gonna fucking shit. Go back, go back, go back, go back. Thank you. It's refreshing to see Capcom fighting game with an actual budget. Yeah, maybe Darkstalkers soon. Smile. Is that supposed to be Dante? Is this Dante? Is this supposed to be Dante for Ken? Yeah? <laughs> Is that Dante? <laughs> yeah, I think so. Okay. Uh, that's all. That's that's what I wanted to go back. Oh, and I think that's supposed to be Rose's outfit on the new character. That's Ken in a Dante skin. Well, yeah, I know, I know that, but like, I meant, is it supposed to be Dante? Um, um, like Dante skin, Dante from Nocturne in a fighting game. True. Banishers, Ghosts of New Eden. Okay, I can't wait to see no gameplay. Can't wait. Love a love a good trailer that has no gameplay. Whoa. What's with all the What's with all the Norse aesthetic lately? Not gonna lie, it kinda irks me out. From the Shin Megami Tensei series, yeah. At the end? Uh Whoa. Another game, I have no idea what this is. It's unfortunate. Yeah. People want to um, watch Vikings one time and make a, make games around it now? I guess so. Don't mind it if the reveal trailer doesn't have gameplay because a lot of times it's really rough gameplay because it's still in dev. I'd like to have an idea of what type of game it is. You know what I mean, though? Norse aesthetic is very easy to sell to men. That's true. I mean, if they're in a European studio, for example, I don't mind. Mm. I think everyone wants to make Skyrim. Eh, it could be. Those kinds of people, yeah. Inherently bad, but the aesthetic is easy to sell. Yeah, I'm not saying it's inherently bad, but it does irk me out. Because I never know what the vibes are, you know what I mean? Because of those types of people. I never know what the vibes are. <laughs> Man has beard, I guess Norse is like, shut the fuck up, Deckard. <laughs> shut the fuck up. Listen. No, stuff is very much used by fascists too. It's scary. Yeah, I know. That's why it irks me. That's that's what I'm getting at. Okay. I don't know what any of this is. I love this lady's voice though. <gasps> Gameplay. Wow. Wait. So his aesthetic is more. He looks more like post World War One. Japanese military outfit than he does Norse. A bone walker. <laughs> yeah, a skeleton. 
<laughs> I'm a bone walker in the morning. True. Like he actually his outfit and his his drip looked like uh uh um 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 golden kamui guy. The main book used to teach Norse mythology is owned by a full on fash org. Yeah. It's called online brain rot. I mean it doesn't matter what the vibes are, fast, you're going to try and co-opt it either way. Yeah, this looked cute. Morning Woodwalker. A Japanese dude that goes to Norseland. Someone who likes Vikings uh, can either be super leftist or super fast. Yeah, I think so. And you never know what the vibes are. You never know. I watched this already. Ash sent me this trailer. It looked pretty good. I think I want to play this. It reminds me of Stray. A little bit, but with like combat. I don't know. I gotta see more. I appreciate that there's gameplay, or at least like pre-rendered gameplay in the trailer. It's not a doomer of me. I just meant that it sucks because pre-Christian religions are cool. Yeah, no, you're good. I got you. I know what you meant. Made you think of you immediately? Aw. Remind me of Journey? Yeah, like it reminds me a little bit of Stray. Platforming? I know, Manka. Movement makes me think of Journey? Yeah, but there's actual combat in it. I mean, you can absolutely know the vibe. Just ask about brown people. True. <laughs> this is giving me a lot of journey feel. Yeah, but it has a combat. Like, hold on for a sec. Like, that's what I felt at first, too. I was like, oh, it's a walking sim. And then it, like, pops off. And you're like, oh. Wait. Just kidding. I lied. I guess there's no in this one. Well, there is combat in the game. So. I guess this is a different trailer, but. Oh, Slug Lion? Yeah, I told a lie. Cyberpunk? <sighs> skip? Alright. <laughs> One like and I skip. <laughs> Idris Elba is in it? I don't give a fuck. I don't care. Something, something, you can come. One like and I skip. Remnant 2. I was going to watch it because I saw the new United States of America or whatever, and I figured, like, it'd be fun to get Stunlocked on, but, yeah, well, all it took was being skipped. Fuck a transphobic game, for real, for real. Haunts. What is this? This looks pretty cool. Pew, pew, pew. Oh. Can be excited for anything yet? Me either. First time, have a completed game before you decide to throw celebrities into it? Yeah. This looks neat. Looks very Bloodborne. I don't care. I'm not going to be nuanced or fair about it. The dev team decided to be transphobic and doubled down on it. I refuse to care about their games. Incredibly valid. I agree. Remnant was basically a Souls-like with guns. This is sequel. Oh. No, well, never mind. Aesthetically, I like it, though. Well, I like the aesthetic. Even if I'm not allowed to play it. It's a Souls game. Well, can't win them all. <laughs> we can't win them all now, can we? Oh, never play the first one. Yeah, I think the big difference is this game wants you to play in co-op, so it might be more fun. Oh, so I would hate Remnant One. Can't say anything about the sequel. I trust your assessment, Glottal. But yeah, maybe maybe the sequel will be fun. These attack patterns don't look fun. I'm not gonna lie. Where Souls Co-op was an afterthought. Gonna beat up Slug though. Gonna bite? No. These attack patterns looking like like again. It looks like the wait for them to fucking attack, bait out the dodge, dodge them, then swing. I I I, I like again. If you like that, it's fine. I just it's not for me. Souls like seems to be one of the on the rise. Rip Slonky. Damn. That's fine. There's plenty of baby games for me to play. Into the FE DLC trailer. Fire Emblem? There's DLC. Meet your maker. I feel like we watched this before. Whoa. I don't know how to explain it, but every single one of these games looks identical. <laughs> Because they all fucking bloom and brown and bloom, Frosty. That's why. Oh. Story Andy seemed to be on the rise, too. Thinks Lonk's okay. Oh, true. Fortress Builder? Oh. 
Uh, hold on, 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 hold on. Uh, for the game that's coming out. Oh. Holy shit, it worked. I taped the HRT informed consent paperwork on my wall in hopes that my mom would see it. And it would kind of force me to come out because I needed to. It worked. Saw my mom yesterday, and I guess they spent the day thinking about it. And she even apologized if anything she said was hurtful. Ah, <gasps> Abby, that fucking rules. I'm so happy for you. Um, that's so. Ha I'm. That's so good. I hope it goes well going forward too. Yeah, we have. It's basically the same trailer as the old one. There are three things I was interested in. FF16 was one of them. Yeah, seems like a dungeon. I'm waiting to get to Hades at this point. <laughs> seems like a dungeon keeper. I think. Yeah, not really my thing. Huge poggers, yes, very fucking cool. Uh, I'm skipping. I don't care. Blue protocol. Anime. Yeah, where all the weeb shit at? No. Oh no, Bandai. Amazon Games. Oh, good. Good. It's like another Genshin. True. There's two trailers in this for Slug. TBH? Yeah. I thought this was Tails at first. Yeah. Amazon Skip? I want to see what it is. I like her doggy. There's probably no gameplay in it, is there? Oh, it's an MMO? It's a Genshin? Oh, okay, then never mind. I don't care. It looks very Tails-like, but if it's Genshin, I don't give a fuck. It's gonna be another killer MMO localization by Amazon. True. The WoW Killer. This time's the charm. Never mind, Amazon can't do shit. Blood Bowl? Wait, there were there were two other Blood Bowls up to this point? Huh. This is news to me. I do. Okay, never mind. This looks boring. I don't care. Well, I was already dead by its own hand, true. Crash Team Rumble. Come on, England. Coco. This is cursed, but I like Coco. Skip. Why? What's wrong with it? Crash MOBA? Man. <laughs> Thanks, chat. <laughs> Thanks. <laughs> Whoa. Tree. Okay. This one is going to be like a Smash clone. Me too. That's why I was like, what's wrong with this? But yeah, whenever he was like MOBA. I'm like, okay, never mind. I don't care. <gasps> Spicy stick. What? I don't know how to feel about it. I couldn't fucking care less about MOBAs. The only one that I would be willing to give a chance is Pokemon. And that's the only, that's only if I got to make somebody else like mad while I was playing it. The live action part of Crash Mobile was painful. Oh my God. There was a live action part. Sorry for putting so many cursed games. It's not your fault that that's what the game trailer is. That's what the game awards is. This is why I was complaining about it earlier. This is why I hate the game awards. Pokemon was actually good. Really? You played it? Pokemon Unite is good. The MTX one is, is shit though. What's MTX? Yeah, a guy in a crash costume was there to announce it. I mean, that's very 90s. That's probably what they were trying to do. It's harking back to the uh the ancient 90s when 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 there would be a guy in a crash costume just kind of like yelling at you in front of a pizza hut. That was the kind of commercials we used to get. Pokemon Mobile was pretty good, but it didn't keep my interest. Microtransactions. Oh. Mary Poppins looking ass, yeah. Huh. I don't know if I hate this or not. I can't decide. How come they can't make a single game worth looking at? No hate to the devs, but oh my god, please. It's the it, it really is the presentation style of these fucking trailers. Like, I'm so fucking tired of cinematic trailers, dude. They fucking they do not do anything justice. Maybe because of the colonial aesthetic? Yeah, it's valid. Steampunk with magic. I, I like, please fucking make gameplay trailers. Is that Hassan? Is that Hassan? Skip the next one? But it's, but it's Hassan. <laughs> it's Hassanavi. 
Uh, this is the Hasanabi broadcast. It is Friday, uh, December 9th. All right, I'm skipping. I'm going to end you. It's the sun. What do you mean? Plug it's COD. I'm skipping it. Wait, LMAO. Did you see it, Matt? Hold on. Matt, watch. <laughs> it's a sun. <laughs> I'll actually sim for the Pokemon and say it's extremely well made. The microtransactions sound worse than they feel in game, and the Pokemon are good. Interesting. Maybe I'll give it a shot someday. It's a sun. A sun real. What the hell is this? This is a good clip. <laughs> oh, oh, true. What the hell is this? Head to shoulder ratio too small? I know. But. So one time you're kind of right, but you're still cringe. Look at these creatures. Is this gang beasts? Oh, this is really cringe. VTuber game. Please skip this one. Why? It looks like gang beasts. Okay. The trailer is cring. Okay. That's pretty cring. Party Animals is a fun party game. I've never even heard of it. Gang beasts too. But furry. Oh, God. All right. All right, chat. When you're right, you're right. When you're right, you're right. I, I put up with it as much as I could. Gang humans. Among us! Ouch, that hurt. Yeah, that's where I draw the line. It looked okay, the game. Game looked fun, but the trailer is cring. True. Among us. Wait, Amogus Hide and Seek? What does this mean? Going for hyper-realistic textures of boring shaders. There's some games that are interesting in concepts with no real art direction. Yeah, I agree, Glottal. Stylization will always be better. So much Amogus at the Game Awards. I mean, they're leaning into the meme. Quickly slug, change models. <gasps> True. Hold on. It means you're gay? Why? Why am I gay? The Amogus hide and seek genuinely looks like a fun time. I don't get it. You better change it back. I will after the trailer. <laughs> ow, ow, ow. <laughs> I will after the trailer. Yippee! Hi, Kirby. Also, hi, Do9. Hello. I saw you sneak in here. Gang humans. Hell yeah. Oh, I don't get it. Why is it hide and seek? I don't really understand. Isn't, isn't, well, isn't the original hide and seek? Sluggo arc. Okay, hold on. Isn't the original hide and seek? Kind of, sort of. There's no voting. Oh, doody, doody, doody. But in ya. Wait, hold on. I want my, I want, because, because we're getting hurt right now. I want my hurt me shirt. <laughs> Original is a game. Figure out who's the odd one out. Yeah, okay, I gotcha. Oh, my hurt me shirt because we're getting fucking hurt right now. I can't lie, I wouldn't be less. I couldn't be less interested in any game. Yeah. Well, let me make sure I'm not covering up too much of the screen. Go over here like that. Wait, why were you so wobbly, slug? What do you mean wobbly? What do you mean? Why was I? Am I wobbly? I fucked with the physics a little bit. Am I wobbly? Well, am I? Did you end up getting any of the Jack shirts from Jackbox? Like, I actually got like three or four of them. The other model was a different Yippee. Yeah, we got an updated Yippee. We got an updated Yippee. Um, EA Originals Immortals of Avium. This sounds like nothing, nothing stands out. Yeah. Yeah, I ended up actually getting like four of the Jackbox shirts. I'll take pictures when they get in. They should, I think they shipped actually. But, 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 but. Yeah, the, the Yippee is um uh is new. Glottal made me a new Yippee. Well. Yeah, no, I agree, Frosty. Like none of this. It's all just like fucking buzzwords and boring. Oh, it's wobbly. What do you mean it's oh like he, he wiggles a lot? Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's all just like it's all just yeah, it just feels like noise. 
Hero of Yolthium Flits? Just a reveal and it gives nothing? Okay, I don't care. Wrap it up. Dead Cells. Huh. Whoa. Like, what is it? Yeah, exactly. I never played Dead Cells. And y'all said I would hate it, so... This looks sick. I'll let it play. Bow, 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 bow. Monster, 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 monster. You don't don't belong in. The oh, right, it's Castlevania. I think I saw this. So whatever the current and biggest number of buzzwords is. But -na 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 -na. I think I actually saw this while I was like still lurking in Pasta's chat. Are those chain frying pans? God, fucking. Fucking Castlevania is so hot. Wait, that was Richter and Alucard. I, when I was watching uh, Pasta Stream, I thought it was Trevor and Alucard, but it's not. It's Richter and Darkula. The only one needed an update to be Vibridger friendly, and I had a what lot of a people man, ask me to teach them Vibridger basics. It was a, a miserable little a pile of secrets, secrets, secrets. secrets. Gamer. But it's Gamer. Enough talk. Die, monster. Fuck. Make a new slipping model, yeah. God, Alucard is so hot. Sets. True. What is a man? Man, man. I like Richter, but Trevor's hotter. For real, for real. Trevor's hotter. The Castlevania anime was really, really good. A bisexual nightmare. Oh, no! Squambled. Transformers. Those aren't Transformers. I want to kiss Castlevania on the lips. Me too. Those are humans. You are not a Transformers. I have some friends who are really excited for this. I'm giving it a chance. This game looked really interesting until they revealed it was Transformers. What the fuck is that? You telling me these formers are trans? <laughs> I think it's VR. Oh no. This is just a cutscene that there was a new Transformers is wild. It looks so interesting. These games, why do they look like nothing? No gameplay or anything? Exactly. It's cinematic trailers. That's what they are. Not actually angry, though. No, I, I'm with you, though. This is why when 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 y'all asked me yesterday, like, are you going to watch the game trailer? Game Awards log? Like, no. <laughs> I don't care. I'll watch the trailer rounds up because it's a little bit more tolerable and I can skip through them. But yeah, it's, it's, it's fucking... It's it's a minute and a half at most of like a bunch of fucking boom, 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 psh, 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 flashing lights and then like some sort of some sort of fucking uh, 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 fucking like this, like a fucking uh, uh, bastardized version of a song put over it. So Luke doesn't care about games, only stun locks in this house. Exactly. It's so cute and wobbly. I think I got a glimpse of you working on it. <gasps> oh, I'm glad you like it. It's very cute. Yeah. I mean, I know that sounds cynical, but I mean, that's that's just how I feel about fucking games at this point. Star War. I hate. Oh, my God. I hate that. I knew that this was Star Wars just from this. I thought that this was I th I knew this was Star Wars just from this because I thought this was Vader's chamber. I hate that. I, I man, I hate that. I know so much about the series still. Fuck me, dude. Um, Let's see. Oh, okay, no, I misremember. Really interesting is wrong. My feeling on it is that the time was like, oh, what is this? This is cool. Looks like kind of neat. And then it was like Transformers. And I was like, oh, yeah. Oh, my fucking God. I just noticed the DKO shirt. Yeah, Glottal and Uni set it up. <laughs> um, um, I'm confused. Why, though? Well, this can't make games sell, right? It's for investors. That's, that's that's who this is for. This is not for us. This is for investors to, to, to fucking, uh, to like, to fucking hype it up and be like, look, 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 look. I'm right there with you. So it's like a Star Wars nerd. Wow, wow, wow. No, I was a Star Wars nerd. I hate Star Wars. But I was a Star Wars nerd. <laughs> Jedi Survivor. What the hell is this? Star Sum Wars. Okay. Corpos jerk off thinking they're appealing to people with the big glitzy glam shit. Yeah, exactly. That's who it's for. It's not for us. I wasn't a Star Wars nerd, but I was a casual Star Wars enjoyer, and now I just don't give any fucks. 
I was a big Star Wars nerd, and then I grew to absolutely hate it. That was cute. Is this like Fallen Order, the sequel? Sequel to the last Star Wars Souls game. Gotcha. Gotcha. Force Unleashed? I'll play Force Unleashed before I play this. I love Force Unleashed. I want more in the style of Force Unleashed where you get to like while out and do whatever you want instead of fucking soul shit. I'm excited for it. Oh, I'm valid. Oh, is that a Wampa? Wait, where are we? Where are we? Why is there a Wampa here? This doesn't look like a snow planet. Okay. Only watched the original three in the TV edits with commercials. Oh, I was I was so fucking obsessed with this series. To the degree that I like I hated it and I was still fucking consuming it. And then my uh they're appealing to your background knowledge, don't fall for it. Yeah, I won't. And my final line, my my the last straw for me was The Force Awakens. Why are there battle droids? Oh, is this like really is this like right after the post uh, Republic Fall area? So there's like a handful of battle droids that are left. I mean, I just want to say because I'm a dumb consumer at the end of the day and I can't help getting appealed to. Wampa trafficking? Yeah, I hate to see it. So like my my final straw was Force Awakens where I watched it and I was like, it wasn't bad, but it was incredibly fucking mid and it was just rehashed garbage. Um, ruined fucking uh, Han's character. And then everything that came in the aftermath of that was like uh, uh, horrendous, like actually bad. Um, the only thing after that that I liked was Mandalorian the first season because it had nothing to do with the original canon, and then they connected it to the canon, and now I just don't care. I didn't bother watching Obi-Wan. I didn't bother watching fucking uh, 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 Boba Fett. I'm not going to watch fucking Andor. I just don't care anymore. I'm just, I'm broken. This is between movies three and four. Ten years after Order 66. Gotcha. There's battle droids to appeal to your background knowledge. Didn't even bother watching the last movie and consume spoilers. Do I regret it? Nope. Oh, I watched it. I watched a cam of it, and it was fucking terrible. Force Awakens was made. Last Jedi was bad. I didn't care enough. Third one because I didn't care enough. Yeah. Um, um, uh, I'll, I'll spoil it for you. The third one was even fucking worse than the second one. Joy Star Wars because I see it as junk food movies now. Yeah, but it used to fucking mean something to me. I don't know. I, w I wish this franchise would have stayed dead, to be honest. Not a spoiler. I'm well aware. True. Oh, come on. Oh, God. We already did this. We already did this. We already did this. And it was dumb then, and it's dumb now. Ugh. 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 Great sword saber, yeah. It doesn't make sense. It doesn't make sense. A great sword saber doesn't make any sense because it doesn't have weight to it like a great sword in a Souls game would. It doesn't make any fucking sense! It would make more sense if it was like a great sword vibro blade. Slug Slug, you're a boober. What did you think about the Bounty Hunter game for PS2? I enjoyed playing the first level of that when I was a baby. Bounty Hunter game was fun. My favorite Star Wars game is Force Unleashed. The Dark Forces games were fun. Oh no, my laser is heavy. Oh God. I'm not gonna buy it because fuck Blizzard, but I wanna see. I gotta see, I gotta see. Slug, you know what a vibro blade is? Yeah, skip. No, I want to see. I want to see. I'm not going to get it, but I want to see. I'm so sorry for you. Yeah, I used to read the Star Wars books. Of course I know what a fucking viral blade is. It doesn't reach, then why aren't all lightsabers great sabers? Yeah. It doesn't make sense. You can increase the weight on a, a lightsaber, but not to the degree that it would swing like a greatsword. Slug, I'm going to get forced to buy it. Don't give Blizzard money, pasta. Why? Trailer does look good, but fuck Blizzard. Yeah, I'm not giving Blizzard my money. Now I'm the consumer being appealed to. I'm not getting Diablo 4, but also looks cool. I care. Because I'm a Diablo Andy. Or I was. But yeah, I'm not going to get it. At least one novel you can increase the length of the lightsaber. You can always increase the length of the lightsaber. You can increase the length of it, and you can kind of increase the weight of the hill. But not to the degree that it would be uh, like a greatsword. I love Diablo. I would have played this. It looks cool. I will not give Blizzard a cent. Same. Same. Stick to PoE. Blizzard does not get my time, and it does not get my money. Yep. I got better things to do. Stupider things to spend money on. 
Talk about how they're long, they're as long as fuck their spears are. Why are their spears so fucking long? I like the demons. I don't really like the armored dudes' designs, but I like the demons. I would enjoy giving them money, but I own all the others, and friends want to play it. Yeah, just steal it, pasta. But you gotta ruin everything. There's plenty of other games in this genre that are great. Yeah, I like Tyrael. True. Oh. True. I just can't get jaded and cynical enough about it because I'm a big sci-fi nerd. No matter how bad it gets, there's still stuff I enjoy. Hold on, because I'm not paying attention to this. Uh, I am also a big Star Trek fan. I know people who load the new Trek, they hate Picard, and I just can't. There's just too much to hate already. I mean, I'm not going to tell you you're supposed to hate it. You're valid. If you don't hate it, you don't hate it. It is what it is. But, like, for me, like, there's not much to like about it. And even when it comes to, like, new Star Wars, it's the same for me for, like, new Dragon Ball, where I'm like, oh, cool. And at least, like, with new Dragon Ball, there's more for me to like than there is with fucking Star Wars. Or I'm like, oh, that's a cool thing. Oh, because then you remember what it's a bigger part of, and you're like, okay. Like, I fucking hate Dragon Ball Super. There's aspects of Super that I think are neat. There's characters that I think are neat, like Kefla. But, like, when you remember what it's a bigger part of, you're like, eh, okay. Uh, anyone else tune out when they see Big Lord of Rings army battle shit? It's over done in fantasy. I don't care anymore. No, I'm the same way. Like, I like some of the, I like, that's why I was like, I like the demon designs, but I just couldn't care less about this shit. Also, if you increase the weight of the hilt, it would work like a great sword because of the center of mass. Exactly. That's 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 what I was trying to get at. Diablo 2 is one of the first games I got into, and I'm sad there's nothing really... There's not really anything in the genre that appeals to me now. Yeah, it's valid. I really wanted to play the uh, Diablo 2 remake. That's all I'd wanted for like a decade was a Diablo 2 uh, port. And then it was like, well, we drink breast milk uh, uh, for, and force our employees to kill themselves. So it's like, well, I guess I can't fucking play that now, can I? I love the way Tyrael's wings act almost like limbs. So I simply don't let it get to me. And what I enjoy, what I enjoy, I don't care what others say about it. I mean, that's valid. Uh, it's not going to make me hate it any less. But uh, Matt is definitely overdone. We all have our things we don't get jaded cynical over uh, about. And I think that's valid. Yeah, like as much as like Digimon has had its problems. Uh, uh, I'm very, I'm very, I'm very, I'm very, um, I'm very forgiving of it. So I, I think I understand what you mean. Jermano wearing one of the fucking Jackbox shirts. It is because we're getting hurt right now. Um, also high quipted time for silly sports ball. Um, um, uh, you could always yar it, but then how do you play it online? If you yar it, I liked about a lot of games in this, but I know a lot of people hate certain things I like and enjoy. Yeah, it is what it is. It's not a big deal. It do be what it do. It be what it is. You know what I mean? Like, I was very, very mean to Pokemon leading up to it. And I'm loving the game. That's just how I am. I love his wings. Tyrael's wings have always been cool. Him, our angle, and our debit. True. Oh, is he bad guy now? That's right. Online multiplayer probably has DRM, and I don't know if you're will work. That's what I figured. That's why I didn't even bother trying. Also, because it's illegal, and I would never do that. I would never steal Diablo. I would I would never. Specifically Diablo 2. Not nine times from Walmart. I would never do that. Death Stranding 2. Oh my god, I don't care. Dodi Dodi Dodi. Slagunya. Never stealing, stealing is wrong, Yar. I'm gonna be real. A new strand type game. I'm gonna be real. This I'm gonna play the trailer because I'm curious. But skip my opinion. But uh, to you, I'm gonna play it. But I'm I'm gonna be real. I I feel like I feel like Kojima without people around him to tell them this is bad is one of the most fucking patronizing developers <laughs> in the industry. And I thought Death Stranding was incredibly fucking mid and obnoxious and definitely resting on its laurels of wow, it's so weird. An innovative, wow. Very cynical take, I know. But uh, I'm happy you have a good opinion. Like, Mind Slug, I'm not interested. Yeah. Just could not fucking care less. But I will watch the trailer. Steal, pilfer, if you will. Plunder, perhaps. Correct opinion. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you for the validation. I don't like this word, but I will use it. Death Stranding was pretentious garbage. Yeah, I don't use that lightly. And I agree wholeheartedly 
Does Death Stranding 2 have Norman Reedus being 2, or is this, like, is this the only thing I want to know? Yeah. I assume that's the baby from the tube. Kojima has the power to make anything, and he chooses to debut a sequel before his next original IP. Yeah. So Walking Sim 2 is coming out? I guess so. Hi, Ancom. I guess so. I didn't even know it was getting made. Hi, Cybe. Hi. Um, um, um. I feel like Kojima can either have good ideas or terrible ones. Death Stranding has good parts. That's what I mean, is I think that, uh, Kojima needs to have people around him to tell him no. It's like a George Lucas. You know what I mean? He can have good ideas, but he needs somebody to fucking focus them. I thought this was Warhammer at first. Then I saw the Red Rome's carrying the coffin. And it looked like Tech Priest. <gasps> True. <gasps> Hi, Kane. Good morning. This Yard Talker, I mean, really uh, show that had a wonderful line. A good pirate's pro pirate never takes another person's property. Yeah. What does your shirt say? I'm on phone and I have bad eyes. It's the crying. Here, I'll, I'll, in I'll increase it because I don't care what's happening in this. It's the crying chopper, but it's me. And it says, hurt me. And 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 boy, howdy, are these game trailers doing so. I feel like the walking sim stuff in Death Stranding was kind of interesting, but it didn't have enough variety to it. Yeah. There's potential there. Again, I will always be mad we didn't get fucking PT. And we got this instead. <laughs> Someone looks needs to look Kojima in the eyes and say, do not name the character Die Hard Man True. How silly and goofy of you, Slug. Thanks. Just doesn't really have any substance to it. Yeah, that's how I feel about it. Also, Cryptid, I don't know if it said hi, but hi. Hi, Cryptid. So I didn't watch the trailers. Oh, it's Norman. Okay. Okay. It's time for the best Kojima trend. Faking out the ending trailer multiple times. I'm going to be real. I haven't given a shit about a Kojima game during the trailer uh, since Survive. Or not Survive. Um, 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 not Survive. Uh, Metal Gear 5. Cryptic bullshit. Yeah, okay, we're done. We're done. We're done. We're, we're done. We're done. We're done. Fucking wrap it up, dude. Jesus. Fire Emblem. Kisses a giant creature. It's symbolic to the human nature. Yeah. Whoa. Oh. Bow, 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 bow. Look at those two VTubers. The time has come for the VTuber game. Would you know be cool if you didn't want everyone to think he's so smart? Yeah, it's very... God, just thank God he never met Kanye. I'll leave it at that. Not even fucking out yet, and there's already DLC. Don't like where Nintendo is headed, and it's catching up with the, uh, with the understanding the internet trend. And they're, and they're, and they're, uh, and they're slow catch up with the, uh, with how the internet, uh, uh, works. They're like, oh, we can cut out half our game and sell it back. Wow. Please, Nintendo, keep not understanding. Yeah. Yeah, they're like, they're catching on to the thing that all the other game devs learned like 10 years ago. You know what I mean? Uh, I love Fire Emblem, but don't love the hair of the characters. What do you mean? They're VTubers, pasta. <laughs> yeah, I'm not a big fan of their character designs. Whoa. Why'd you have to die, Iwana? Yeah, I miss Iwana. They did that back in the 90s? What, Nintendo? What, with trailer? With DLC? What are you talking about? What are you talking about? They still don't understand the internet, but they understand selling the same game twice? Yeah. Yeah, if you're talking about that, you might like the game. Nintendo Switch hair. Uh -huh. You might like this game? Okay, hold on. I wasn't paying attention. All right, I'm paying attention now. Shut up, chat. <laughs> I'm, I'm, I'm watching. <laughs> Yeah, of course you weren't. Whoa, moon. Okay, I'm watching. I'm paying attention. I'm not looking at chat. Chat, be quiet. Yeah. Shh. Don't say anything. Whoa.
Well, we're being silenced. Yeah. I'll read your comment in a second, Ancom. <laughs> Stop! Stop! <laughs> that one? <laughs> Thank you for the Vitalis pickle. That one? Oh. Dinner. What kind of game is this? Like, I'm kind of interested, but it's not showing me enough. Why did you make what is clearly like a 2D type game a fucking cinematic trailer? I love the aesthetic too, but they made it a fucking point and click. Okay, it's a side scroller. I think. Cinematic trailers, dude. I swear to Christ. I swear to God, dude. Yeah, it looks like a side scroller platformer shoot shoot game. Could be good. Trailer isn't done yet, dude. <laughs> Just the goddamn gameplay. Probably a Metroidvania. Maybe. I'm going to slug a CG trailer right now. No! Drinking up your anger. Red and blue, you could only get all the Pokemon if you had both games or a friend with the other one. I mean, I guess. But that's a, like, you're not wrong, but that's a different vibe than being like, hey, look, this game isn't even out yet. You're going to have to buy a $15 DLC to access the rest of it. Okay, now you can bitch. Yeah, okay. Thank you. Uh, wait, is this the art director for Red Strings Club and Gods Will Be Watching? I don't know. Sad Cat Studios Goat Sync? That's extremely different. Yeah, I think, I mean, it's still questionable, but I think it's incredibly different. It's questionable game development, but VR, I don't care. I don't care. Oh. Snoy. Cute. That's a cute design. Oh. Here's a description of a place. It's a 2.5D sci-fi retro futurist action platformer. You play as Reach, an artificial intelligence trapped in a human body against its own will. Replaced combines the cinematic platformer, pixel art, and free flow action combat with a deep, engaging dystopian story set in an alternative 1980s. Yeah, okay. Sounds pretty neat. Look at this CG trailer that no hardware can run in real time, but you will think our game looks like this? Yeah. Wasn't Pokemon Yellow just blue red with some game fix patches? Sort of, but also it was like kind of through the lens of the anime. You were more like Ash than you were Red, and like Team Rocket was actually Team Rocket from the anime in it, and you actually started with a Pikachu, um, and you were able to get all the starters. But other than that, it was mostly the same game. You? Yeah, you. How many buzzwords can you fit in one description? Yeah. <laughs> I, the game still looks cool, though. I'm, 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 I'm still a little bit on board with it. This looks cute. They're also the game, but with somewhat different features that is still different from DLC. Yeah, exactly. I, I agree. Not defending it, but it's different. Bun Ketchum, true. Journey vibes. This looks cute. I, I, I have to see more of it, but... Oh, wait, is it out already? Concert premieres? What? Okay, never mind. I'm not defending it either. Yeah. Earthblade, why is the audio mixing so fucked on this one? Loud. Celeste. Trans game? Whoa. See, stylization will always look better, dude, than fucking hyperrealism. This is the other one I'm interested in. This is good. It looks cute. This guy has been out for years on mobile. Uh, oh, so that's all it was. It was just like a event. Trans 2, let's go. Oh, it's a Metroidvania, isn't it? Nice horns. This is probably one of my top games shown. But slug stylization <laughs> means paying the artist, Corpa. True. Transgender 2, the sequel to Transgender. I do like the creatures, though. I'm getting Hollow Knight vibes? Yeah. Yeah, it looks like a Metroidvania. Well, I hope you all have fun with it. <laughs> 
Because it's not for Slonky. <laughs> I wish I could play Metroidvanias, but I can't. I will, thanks. I wish I could. Whoa. Nyom. Nyom. Whoa. Whoa. Earthblade. The Borderlands art style would probably also look good. For what? The for the 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 nineteen eighties one? Yeah. Slug can't play it, which means I'll enjoy it. True. What is this? Forspoken. I have so much fun with this and just I, think, I wish Slug was here. Yeah. Metroid is already trans, true. I like Metro Fenians, but I have to be in a certain mood to play them. They're not bad. I, I love the idea of, of Metroidvanias. I get way too overwhelmed by them because I get confused. I'm very bad at, at directions and understanding like like uh uh placement. You know what I mean? So it's 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 uh, uh they're not games that I can play. We know? Okay, dude. <laughs> Also, supposedly the game's dialogue isn't all like one trailer, but I don't believe it. Ow, ow, ow. Sorry, I love you. <laughs> it's okay. <laughs> it's funny. <laughs> Thank you, this Pippi. Metroidvania is too break brain genre for slug. You have to keep track of too much. I'm not good at it. Thank you, this Pippi and the Strumch. What about Symphony of the Night? I had a map. Is that not enough? I Symphony of the Symphony Symphony of the Night was the only one I was able to play. Slodoru. Okay, hold on. Cynthia of the Night was the only one I was able to play. I could tell that dealt critical damage. Yeah, 10 HP. Minus 10 HP. Hi. Creature. Behemoth? This looks just like the last game. Yeah, I do think Cynthia of the Night did it best. I think it was the most accessible. So I mentioned a single thing from the last trailer. Couldn't fucking tell you. Couldn't, couldn't tell you. Orange? Orange? So you might want to consider Bloodstained. It has a good map like Symphony of the Night. Well, see, that's the thing. Even with Symphony of the Night, I struggled. So I don't know that I would ever want to put myself through that again. Um, slug, slug talking about Metroidvania sounds to me like talking about open world. Yeah, and even me, I get overwhelmed by open worlds, too. Couldn't see anything through the particle. I like the realism looks good for that world, but I think a cell shaded style would probably look good on that world. Uh, I I didn't I didn't play Cyberpunk twenty seventy seven. And I, honestly, I think the aesthetic was one of the turnoffs for me. I hundred percent at Bloodstain. Pasta, you're so cracked. Pasta's good at games. Pasta's like a gamer TM. I just I just bitch and whine about everything, but Pasta's like an actual gamer. I ever played something tonight. The only Castlevania ones were the ones I played were the GBA ones. I like those ones too. The one with Soma. Uh, couldn't see anything through the particles. Yeah. Uh, the only open world games I like are Elden Ring and Cyberpunk. Being out to my mom takes a huge weight off my chest, and hopefully it frees up room for some other weights. Let's go. Bitch and wine don't pay attention to things. Oh, listen, if they're not gonna grab my attention. A game would never be the fifth pantheon of Hollow Knight. Well, what is this? See, like now I'm vaguely interested because it's not just brown and bloom. Bioshock type? A video game? True. Haunts! It is a Bioshock type. Like, is this Bioshock devs? Because it looks just like Bioshock. This game was made by the Bioshock devs? Okay, gotcha. Um, to what end, though? Uh... 
Okay. I'm honestly hyped for this. It looks like it'll be fun. I mean... Maybe if they gave us a real trailer. <laughs> I might be excited. There's enough in there to, like, have made me interested. But... Doesn't activate my neurons, yeah. Like, I was kind of like, oh, okay. It's gone from being the sea to being racist to the clouds to space. Let's go. <laughs> Armored core? Really? thought this franchise was dead. I think open world can be good, but don't work on all games. I think so, too. And I hate that it's become, like, the new standard. I thought this franchise was fucking dead. Armored Core. I wonder if this one will be more accessible. Because the old Armored Core games were like super technical. That's a two, yeah. Stuff is losing a shit over this trailer. Oh, really? Have you seen High on Life? Uh uh. I don't know what that is. They add souls like mechanics to Armored Core. I will shit. Whoa. Shit good or shit bad? It won't be. This is from Soft. What, accessible? Yeah, damn. Probably won't play this game, but man, this trailer just nailed the horrifying, imposing feelings. Yeah, shit good. Oh, really? Oh, worm? From soft, ringing at the core again? Oh, let the last cinders burn. Oh. It was like post apocalyptia? From software. I mean, they did make a. Uh Metal Wolf Chaos, so. If you get invaded during a mission, that is that be a PvP mechanic? Oh, maybe. Be so cool. I want to see what kind how like how technical this fucking game is. And how souls it is, you know what I mean? PvP armor core could be interesting, TBH. I, I could I could see it working like um some of the Gundam. Uh, uh, games. Choo -choo. I don't want to be invaded by sweats. I want to nerd out. Yeah. Like, the old armor cores were incredibly fucking technical. So, like, that, if it, if they, if they, if they maintain that technicality with, like, the Souls combat style, it'll be very interesting. Okay, Fosby. Yeah, I'm guessing we'll be getting gameplay at some point, but I doubt they have much already to show. Yeah. Zaku look at mech, it's making me want to buy increase so much. It's I it activated my neurons a little bit. Been waiting a super death mech sim for ages. Metro Games, damn three did a good hybrid open world system. I played one of the first ones. You don't have to at me with every uh uh message too. I, I read everything in chat, so. Power is off. What is this? Post trauma? Is this like a silent hill? I played the first Metro, but I don't know. I'm not, I'm not really an open world, Andy. Old guy with a dumpy. Let's go. post up divide makes you think there's going to be like scavenging. Uh, I see you reading chat, you queen. Thank you. To the degree that I miss things on screen. Survival horror. That's what it looks like. It looks like a Silent Hill or Resident Evil. Soundtrack is very Silent Hill. Don't look at me. Oh, sorry. 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 Well, this is Silent Hill inspired. Don't read the slug. Sorry. Okay. I need to see more, but this looks. Oh, that looked very PT. That looked very PT. Uh... Wait, hold on. Witness me. All right. Very PT. You're talking my language game. I want to see more of this. I was watching Kyria while she watched these and she pointed out that one of these animations straight up. One she's used before, which had her worried. Wait, what do you mean? It's named Post Trauma? Huh. Wait, who's the dev, though? PT is PT? So if you're reading this, you have to kiss me? Aw, oh, shit. Damn. Classic. Like, it was a canned animation that you can buy? Oh, no. Okay. PT has three letters! True! I wish I wouldn't have... I burned myself out on this game so fucking hard, dude. I I don't think I'll ever go back to it. 
I burned myself out on it so hard. Vampire Mobile is really smart. Sure. Personally, I would like open world. Uh, I like open world if it works as open world, like GTA and games. But Assassin's Creed should be closed areas. Yeah, I kind of agree with the sentiment. Okay, hold on. Hades. Okay. All right. Paying attention. Shut the fuck up. Okay, I'm, I'm watching. Super Giant. I'm watching. I'm watching. Stop. Whoa! Witch. Fog. Whoa. No, look at me. Sorry. Whoa. I like her weapons. But I guess they'll probably change if it's anything like Hades. Super guy online? Yeah. Bam, 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 bam. Those are the recognizable Hades guitar riff. So looks like me? Uh, no. <gasps> she got she got Zagreus's little head thingy. Oh no! Huh? Bam! <gasps> Death to Kronos! Oh! Moros. Animation is fucking beautiful. Apollo! Oh. Glass. I think you have the site for Hades confirmed your Zag sister? Dora? What? She's so fucking cute. Chat, she's so fucking cute. She's so fucking cute. She's so fucking cute. Oh my god. So like, did you see Nemesis? I did. Yeah, we'll, we'll go back and look again. Wait, actually, yeah, I feel like I need to... It's like Nyx in armor. Oh my god. <laughs> oh my fucking god. Fuck, 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 fuck. I do like the gremlin ghost girl, though. Whoa. So many cute girls. Wait, so are you her sister or, or his sister or is his, his daughter? Isn't she Nix's kid? Go ahead and explain it. I'm very excited to play this. I loved, I loved the first Hades. I'll probably never go back to it either. It's been so long. Oh! Whoa. Interesting. So you are Zag's sister. Unless that was Zag, who became Hades. Huh. She was fathered by Zeus, but they considered Hades and Zeus the same in mythos. So I'm curious how this works. Melanie is the daughter of Persephone and was fathered by Zeus. Interesting. Interesting. Either way, I'm excited as hell for this game. Because I loved the first Hades, and it's been so long since I've played it. I, like, when we're so far into the game now, like, I probably, it would be a very much like a, a neon white situation. So I'm glad that I kind of, like, get to pick it up again with, with the new game. If she's Zag's kid, the real question is whom? With whom? Then Meg or both? I just hope we get to see Zag again. This game is weird but cool. Money I'll be gone once this is out. What is this? Viewfinder? She's not Zach's kid. Yeah, no, I think it's his sister. Because I'm pretty sure that was Hades. What is this? Is this cool? <gasps> oh, what the? This looks trippy. What the? I'd like to see you try again for entertainment regardless. They confirmed her as his sister on the website. Gotcha. Whoa. I like that style. Very old school Windows computer. Super liminal esque. Oh, with Dusa, clearly, obviously, yeah. Looks cool. Oh. Interesting. 
This looks like it would break my brain. Ah! I don't care. Lords of Fallen. Oh. So I was trying to watch that. I'm oh, sorry. Souls like, yeah. Bum, 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 bum. Garbo souls like, by the way. I don't care. I don't give a shit. Reboot of an okay souls like. Yeah, I don't care. Not something I'll play. No, I won't. I won't. Eight Souls games of the awards event. Yeah. <gasps> Space Marine. Whoa. Tyranids. Whoa. <gasps> Space Marines. I love Tyranids. I don't play Girl Hades right now. Me too. I love Tyranid. Slug dwells in the darkness? True. I'm a Tyranid. Whoa. Another Warhammer game so soon. This did get announced um, a couple years ago, didn't it? Space Marines. I love Tyranids. I miss this one. Looks great. Yeah, I'm excited for this. They're doing the early access thing again, this time simultaneous release on Epic and Steam. What, for this? Or what, for Hades? Wait, really? For Hades? That's awesome. Space Marine 1 was 10 years ago. This is not so soon. I think they're talking about like how Dark Tide just came out. Hades 2, sorry. Gotcha, gotcha. Batman! Soy Pog! Bat Chest! Oh, it's Suicide Squad. Yeah, I'll probably do early access for Hades. Harley. I mean, different studios. Yeah, no, no, for sure. So that's the only thing that I'll be talking about now, thanks. Yeah. Welcome to my new hyper fixation. Don't skip this, by the way. Why? Why? You'll see why. I'm very bored. Us to you? Yeah. Hit me with a sharp piece of metal. Skip forward a little, you silly man. Well, then I'm going to miss whatever I'm supposed to see. Look, like slowly going insane, not trying to skip. Yeah. That's not Tara Strong, is it? Oh, but I do. Cops aren't people, so. Can I go back and watch the cop get hit again? Yeah. I don't think so. It doesn't sound like. Uh... This is Conroy's last role as Batman. Uh -huh. And I'm the Joker. <laughs> they turned him into a good cop. Yeah. Okay. That's cool, I guess. Rip Gomroy, yeah. Vampire Batman. Why is he killing though? Why is he killing? Why is he doing a kill? Burning Shores reveal trailer. I don't know what this is. I've always been kind of vaguely interested in this game though. Kind of bummer he's a bad guy in it. Is he a bad guy? Oh. Yum. Is that the Batman who laughs? Oh, maybe. 
Justice League turns evil, number 267148. Yeah. Super good and pretty game. Yeah, I've always been vaguely interested in it. I've never played it. Probably an all-world with Batman kills to keep the peace. Uh, brainwash, that's right, yeah. Justice League is bad guys in the game. Uh, gotcha. Holly weird. What the? I didn't think this had any connection to our world, or at least not a significant connection. Brain cleaned and smooth. Oh, no. But that was a big reveal, dude. You ruined it. Horizon is fun to me, but almost all the side content is checklist busy work. That sucks. Oh. It's, is that the end? Oh, shit. That's all. Horizon is set a post-apocalyptic earth. I, yeah, I just thought it was a lot further into the future. I was like, man, what are we watching? A bird. Glass. It's a bell. Hi, Chris. Glass. Glasses? <laughs> um, I'm gonna be honest. Uh, I think I cared about like maybe one of those. Wash up slug? What do you mean wash up? What do you mean wash up? Hi Nemo. Um, 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 um. Yeah, I think I cared about like maybe one of those. W one of like Space Marine. Oh, and Hades. Uh, that's about it. <laughs> She's right, wash up. What do you mean wash up? No! No! Um, let's see. Bow, now, now. Hades 2, Celeste Ev. See, I didn't even, like, yeah, it was it was Hades 2 and Space Brain. Like, that was it. That was, like, all I really cared about. X-Band, boom, boom, yeah. Nemo, turn yourself into a haunt. Stinky? No, Sniffa. Bow, 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 bow. I want a robot game. Oh, yeah, and, um, 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 um. Two trailers, yeah. Uh, uh, Armored Core looked potentially interesting. Uh, Armored Core looked like it might be cool. Uh, let's see. Um, is there new Fisks? There new Fisks? Give me trouble, you get in the bubble. Armored Core and the anime Mech Warrior going to be PC looks great. Mm. There's haunts emotes, of course there are. Oh. Creature. Sad face. Once again, us to you. Yeah. Weird dog. <laughs> Cast British. True. Yeah. Uh, thank you for organizing them for me, Ash. Sorry I hated all of them. But. I mean, I feel like that was expected. Have you seen the failed karaoke role in Disco Slug? Uh-uh. Because we, we succeeded yesterday. <gasps> Soft baby. Are you going to bacon pine soon, you think? Yeah, I think I'll bacon pine after this. Rubsoft could do all wrong in my eyes, so armor core is going to be great, or it's my fault for personal skill issue. That's valid. If I liked Souls games, I'd probably feel the same, but... Cats are probably so annoying to work with. Not all of them. Cute. We can just like a lot of them to be fair. Just wanted to make it easier for you. Well, I appreciate it. Poor cat. Cats don't like water. Some cats like water. From soft is pushing arm recording. Never mind. I retract everything. It's going to be awful. From soft is physically incapable of good PC ports. The two genders. Well, cat suffering deeply. Oh no! He don't like the the blow thingy. Oh, poor baby. Poor baby. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Do you know, like the brand? Yeah. <gasps> Spicy. My cat thinks he likes water, waiting for him to jump into my bath one day. Bruce always tries to go in the tub, but he doesn't like water. <gasps> Trouble bubble. Big Madge. Ready for space. Fishbowl. Yeah. Doggy. She got fishbowled. Fishbowl head ass. Um. 
Do I want like one more? Is there a new Apollo? If there's a new Apollo, we'll watch an Apollo and then we'll go play the game. Yeah. Oh, why is this nine minutes? All right, we'll watch this five minute one. Wait, hold on. I want to see the thumbnail on that. <laughs> landlords hate him. Find out why. Well, I hate landlords. Find out why. Oh, glass. Yeah, we'll play. Uh, we'll play bacon pan after this. The fuck base bird. True. Oh, for stick. I never did ever. I never really understood how to use those like wall things where they're like supposed to expand in the wall. I was never really good at it. Oh. Oh, the anchors, that's what they're called. So, like, stop pooping on the floor. This is why landlords hate you. Listen, maybe they should get a real job then. And I'll stop shitting on their floors. Oh. For real, for real. Wait, is Apollo even in this? Apollo's not even in this. Fucking, I want an aminal. I want a funny aminal. I want a funny aminal video. I want a funny aminal video. This isn't funny aminals. I've been fucking had. I've been rused. I've been deceived. Slug, what are you literally, what are you doing? You're literally absorbing the floorboards? Yeah. There's no new funny animal. Oh shit. I guess we're gonna go fucking play. I'm already watching a funny animal. Yeah, the funny slime animal. Big ounce ate 14 tons of steel. True. Let's see. Oh. Snoot. All right. Kitty. Oh, ducks. Meow. Oh. Scritches. Oh, cute kitty. Oh. Oh. Sit. Meow. <gasps> what a baby. <laughs> oh, my God. Whoa! So, have you seen the guy that rides around on a bike with a cat? Those are pretty cute. Are you talking about June? Yeah, he uploads very rarely. I love June, though. And his cats. June's so handsome. The fuck? Oh, they're so cute. <gasps> Snoot. <laughs> I love when, when cats, like, look at you directly on. They look so silly. They've got such a big snoot. Cat. Oh, lick. Lick. Yeah, when they look at you like head on, they look so goofy. Oh, <gasps> spicy boy. Groomies. Oh. Buster did this to me the other night. Buster likes to sit in my I've showed y'all before. Buster likes to sit in my lap when I'm I'm working on the computer after stream. Um um so, like, I'll be working, and then sometimes he does the tippy taps, which I finally figured out was his way of telling me, put your legs up so I can sit in your lap. And that's what I do. And then he jumps up in my lap, and he makes me cuddle him. And then sometimes he gets, like, uh, like he'll get, like, he'll start grooming himself while he's sitting in my lap. And the other day he was grooming himself, and then he started grooming me. He started licking my chest. And I, like, it made me laugh because it surprised me. I was like, what are you doing? And he got embarrassed, and he, like, ran off. <laughs> But he uh, he likes to watch streams with me. He likes to watch streams with me. I think Fang, I think Fang is his favorite. He really likes when there's like lots of like little things happening on the screen because he like he like fixate like he stares really hard. But like I think Fang is his favorite. But he liked he liked pasta. He likes um 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 um. Who else have I watched? He liked puddles. He like he liked watching Glottal. 
Yeah, he's Buster. Buster likes watching streamers. He gets very, he gets very, he's like, he looks very intently when I have him on. All right. Anyway, let's go over here. Um, gliming. Gay couple. True. <gasps> Hi. Hi. Uh, let me go down here. Buster likes you? Yeah, Buster likes watching you. Buster likes watching you work. Game. He likes he likes watching like technical stuff like when 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 like stuff's moving around on the screen. Yeah, he liked watching Fisk too. He liked watching Fisk. Um 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 he liked watching Uni. He liked watching Uni uh work. Um uh he likes watching art. He gets very like fixated when when, when I'm watching like an art stream. Hi. Um 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 Steam. Sent you a link for a cute cat on bike for later slug. Oh, thank you, Pasta. Thank you. Oh, Pasta, I was telling you about Beacon Pines, right? And you were interested in it, right? Oh. We, I think, are very close to the end of the game. I think we're very close, but let me see. Uh, open that. Yeah, it looks super cute. It's very, very cute. Um, Beacon Pan. Bacon Pans. Beacon Pines. Ba ba ba. Where's my controller? Bum bum. Open this. Okay. Do a spip so I can do all these silly voices. And start. No, tab in. Start. 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 Okay. Bow, bow, bow. bow. Pow, pow. Enlist the help of Iggy and Tish. Why? What were we doing? What were we doing? Making pancakes? Making, making pancakes? Making, making pancakes. Right, right, right. We're doing, um... It kind of reminds me of the cute game with the cat and the goth alligator. Yeah, it's very night in the woods. It's very, very night in the woods. Uh... Wait, how do I see what my my objective is? Our heights, that's right. Um Enlist the help of Iggy and Tish, enlist the help of Jeff. Okay. Whoa! I can't in interact with you? Okay. Bye. Iggy and Tish. Okay. Which one's Iggy? Tish is, Tish is his older sister, but which one's Iggy? I don't remember Iggy. Which which one is where or where the fuck are they too? The one we scrambled. <gasps> True! Well, that's so cool, Jeff Kaylee, to help you with a heist. Yeah. Very true. Wait, where are they? The half scrambled face kid. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Jeff! Uh <clears throat> I gotta remember how to do these. Hey, Jeff! Ah. What voice did I give Jeff? I think I gave him Nappa. Hey, Vegeta! Hey, Vegeta! Oh, I don't remember. I didn't see what he said. Well, I know how much you hate perennial harvest. Ah. Hate's a strong word! Oh, sorry. I mean... Ah. I didn't say it was the wrong word. What can I do for you? <laughs> gotcha. So, we're gonna break into their headquarters, and I thought you might be able to help. Jeff wheezed out a long snicker. <laughs> you see, I knew your kids were all right. Imagine wanting to be a history teacher and then find out you're living in a historical moment. True! And then you do silly voices as a cartoon slug on the internet. Hate's a strong word, but it's not strong enough! <laughs> Great, so you'll help? The joy in Jeff's face drained instantly. Oh. Not a chance! But... Give me one good reason I should risk my hide aiding and abetting you rascals! Looking into the sullen eyes of his would-be accomplice, hmm. Luca blurted out the first word that came to mind. Whoa. <gasps> hide, junk, shit, fight. Junk. Jeff likes junk. Junk. Junk! Yeah, what of it? 
Sonny, I got more junk than a king ass copper. I ain't interested. Oh. Luca wasn't ready to give. He shouted out again. Any shitters? Shit. Shit. Yeah, it's all shit. I still ain't helping. Ain't that some shit? <laughs> Come on. Fight. Fight! I've done enough fighting for one lifetime. And more than my share of losing. Time comes. Time's come to hang up the gloves. No. Hide? Hide! Jeff's brow perked up. Oh. What you say? Go ahead and hide then. Sensing some traction. <gasps> Luca carried on with vigor. Oh. Little bunch of kids do what needs to be done. We're not afraid. Jeff's scowl faded with a sigh. Whoa. <laughs> Goof on him. Say what you will about old Jeff, and they all do. But you'll never hear him say I hit from nothing. One good stomp of the foot was all Jeff needed to drive his point home. Whoa. What was it you kids needed? Some sort of disguise. I've got just the thing. And while we're at it, that crate should come in handy. This ain't gonna be free, you know. I'm thinking five bags of sour gob should cover it. Put it on my tab. Luca offered out his open hand to seal the deal. <laughs> With a firm and dusty grip, Jeff reciprocated. Oh. Done! Swing by first thing in the morning. Whoa, we got Jeff. Okay, now we gotta find Tish. Nyom. 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 Oh, and Iggy. I like this old coot. He's pretty funny. I like him. <gasps> Iggy. Yeah, 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 yeah. Hey, Tish. Look at who it is. Yeah, 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 yeah. Luca, are you here to try to tickle us to death again? Look, just hear me out. The room. Mm -hmm. Biden arrived. <gasps> Hi, Vaughn. Iggy raised an eyebrow suspiciously. pre scrambled He's not scrambled in this version. Oh, and I'm also covering him a little bit. Hold on. He's not scrambled in this timeline. This is the timeline where where uh where uh where uh Beck got scrambled a little bit. Her hair. Also, what's this about a new yippee? We got a new yippee. Glad I made a new yippee. A new yippee. Here, let me make myself smaller. Whoa. Like that. Okay. Yeah, that's what I mean. Yeah, this is a different timeline. He raised an eyebrow suspiciously. We're listening. Iggy, I know we've both been giant bags of malice. <laughs> Shit. To each other. Iggy gave a reluctant shrug. Eh. Yippee! <laughs> Yippee! Thank you for the Bitolis pickle. You're not wrong. Does the Slippy Redeem work for it? It does. Here, I'll give you a free one, though. I'll give you free. I'll give you free because it's new. Bow, 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 bow. Whoa, I should have shooped, but... I'm all scrambled today. Yippee! Hi. Hi. Hi, I'm Yippee. Also, I can get Madge. <laughs> Whoa. Thank you for the Slippy! Madge. Yeah, we got we got a new yippee. We got a new yippee. Oh, all my requests are Oh uh, I haven't seen these in a minute. Mm -hmm. Yeah, we got a new yippee. And 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 too bad I paid anyway. Oh we'll put on the maid dress. As you wish. As you wish. That's cute. Hey Vaughn, look at the eyes. Yeah, do you notice anything interesting about them? You are naked, get dressed. I uh, sorry. I forgore. I forgore. Do you know anything interesting about the eyes? Mm -mm -mm. No, 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 no. <laughs> what do you mean? Also, it's still wiggly. Look how wiggly it is. God damn it. <laughs> Look how wiggly I am. <laughs> Can you leave? No. Uh, let me see. Get in Smalland down here. Maybe I can go like right here. Oh my god, this mod the model is very cute. It is very cute. I like it a lot. Swoosh and wiggly. Also, it's got 
It's got a little bit of cheek meat back there, see? I do not like the eyes, but I can deal with it. Swooshy and wiggly. It's got cheek meat. It's got cheek meat in the maid dress. Very, very caked up. Very thick yippy. Thick yippy. Um, whoa, well, down here. Yeah, we should be able to make this work. It's so wiggly. It's so wiggly. Okay, 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 okay. I think we're good. I think we are good. Wait, let me in. There we go. It's so cute that you can forgive the cursed eyes. <laughs> you look so vulnerable and wobbly. What do you mean vulnerable? Like a baby deer. Like a baby deer. A baby forest puppy. Mm -hmm. But lately, life has been kind of... Oh. Strange. That one's so cute. <laughs> hmm. Those are the eyes he gives you when you find what he did to your pie. Mm -mm -mm. I like the eyes. Oh, the strange is really cute. Are the eyes a serious problem? Can I change? I can change them to something else or make a toggle. Nah, I don't care that much. Okay. Yeah, I was gonna say if y'all care that much, I like them. Thank you, though, Glottal. You're a sweetie. Yeah, I like them. <laughs> Easy to coax into the blender. Oh <gasps> no! I like the eyes. I'm obligated to be angry. Yeah. I'm gonna go with strange. Strange, you know. He considered the point. Mm -hmm. Things have been weird around here. So I'm offering for a truce and asking for your help. What do you say we? Oh, break, hide, pull. Um. Huh. Pull? Pull our hostilities for now. Pull? We don't pull away from nothing. Buzz off. Ah, fuck. Luca knew they'd he tried again. Yeah. I know we've both been giant bags of shit to each a other. The art in this game goes so hard. It's so fucking cute. You're not wrong. But lately, life has been kind of... Those are the eyes of a deer staring into your headlights. There's just no thought behind them. Just awe. Yeah. Not a single thought. <laughs> the cute yippee high silver. That's why I like this one. Because especially when I'm just like, when I was testing it last night, and when I just stare, and I'm not like talking, I just kind of stare forward. Like, there's not a single thought. There's not a single thought. Completely head empty. When I'm talking, it's got a little bit more life to it. But when I'm just... It's just completely head empty, and I love it for that. Um, those are the eyes of a slonky right before train. True! Yeah, train hit slonky. Hard! Hard, you know? Hard! Yeah, well, life's always hard. Get over it. We ain't interested. Oh, wait. I fucked that up. Love that for you. Shit. Uh-huh. Too bad you're never quiet. True. You're not wrong, strange. Things happen weird around here, so I'm offering. What do you say we break? Whoa. We stand a brainless king. True. Break our hostilities, at least for now. We do like breaking things. Even if a truce means less. Breaking things. What if I told you there was a way to have a truce and break stuff? <gasps> Go on. I need you to cause a distraction so I can sneak into Perennial Harvest HQ. A wild eyed grin spread across Iggy's face. Oh, he's on board. <laughs> my, my, Luca Van Horn. I'm impressed. And after all this is done, maybe you and Tish can come hang out at the treehouse sometime. Iggy glanced over to Tish. Who nodded in agreement. Oh, <gasps> cute! That was all he really wanted. Remember in the timeline where he sacrificed himself? That was all he ever wanted, was to hang out with us. Fine. But not because I want to see your crappy tree house. We just like to cause chaos. With a quick nod, Luca was Yeah, off. yeah. Whatever, dork. He make friends. Oh. This has such Craig of the Creep vibes. True! 
Oh, cute! Did you hear that, Tish? He gazed up at Tish with a smile. He invited us to hang out at the treehouse. A single tear ran down Tish's cheek. Cute! Oh my god! <gasps> I never expected this day to come. How wonderful! Cute! Oh my god, they're so cute. Chapter seven. <gasps> Into the hive. But we didn't get. Oh wait, that was Tish. I thought Tish was um. The older sister, but yeah, that was Iggy and Tish. That's right. Um, 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 Rolo was gonna go talk to his sister. That's right. A good okay. heist requires preparation. Mm, mm mm True. And thorough preparation takes time. Something they had precious little of. True. So far, everything was in order. Jeff, Iggy, and Tish all agreed to do their part. Oh. Beck radioed Luca that night with a simple and covert message. We are locked and loaded on my end. Is Rolo old in this timeline? Yeah, Rolo, Rolo's big Rolo in this timeline. And Rolo, after a lengthy confession, managed to persuade Roxy and Fitz to help. Let's go! He stowed away in mission control for the night to avoid attracting attention. Mm -hmm. Rolo, being uniquely suited for the role, would be the first to breach perennial harvest. He's Rolo, which means he's suited for the, the role. The outfit provided by Jeff wasn't perfect, but a convincing oh. disguise is 10% wardrobe. 90% confidence. That's right. Oh, God. It's going to be goofy, took a isn't few it? Vigorous breaths and shook out his arms. <gasps> Just stay calm, Rolo. You can do this. <laughs> he got a box. Got your delivery here. Look at his tool belt. He's so goofy. <laughs> He's such a fucking dork. Look at his little tool belt. His mustache. A delivery? Hmm, I don't have anything in my notes about a delivery. One moment. Whoa. Mustache. I'm so sorry, but there's no delivery scheduled for this morning. He's become Luigi. Yeah, which is funny because my voice for him is kind of a variation of Luigi. Uh, right. He had to think quick. That's because this goes directly to the founder. He asked that it be kept secret. Rollo sighed, adjusting his tool belt. Oh, you know how the founder can be. I suppose we can leave this one off the records. Owned. Let's go. Wait, are we in that box? A harvest awaits and such. With a stroke of his mustache, we proceeded <laughs> into the perennial harvest headquarters. <laughs> we did it. Let's go. Our harvest awaits. Package here for the founder. Oh, I didn't hear anything about. Yeah, this is a need to know kind of thing. Um, I'll just check. He stammered and flipped through the pages of his clipboard. Mm hmm. This goes directly to the founder. I don't have time to fill you in. Oh, I see. If you could just, uh, complete this form. Blue interrupted with urgency in his voice. Every time with the forms. Look, if you want to explain to the founder why I'm late, well, it's your funeral. Uh, I'm sorry. Uh, what did you say your name was again? I'm, uh... Rolo panicked. A harvest awaits! <laughs> sir? That's a restricted area. Excuse me, sir! A harvest awaits! <laughs> Ready to light this candle, Tish? Yep. Suck on this perennial ham fist! Yum. Whoa. What was that? The distraction was enough for Rollo to regain his confidence. Oh. Just open the damn door. I've got a job to do. The clipboard fumbled around in a frenzy. Oh. Hi, yeah. Hi, Fosby. You're just in time. We're, we're, we have disguised Rollo sneaking us into the building. I, I... I should check on that noise. Oh, come on. Just buzz me in already. Okay, okay. 
Whoa, a run! <laughs> <laughs> Phew! That was close. Whoa, Luca! <gasps> uh, Beck's voice. Our harvest awaits. Hey, I figure! When in doubt, stick with the classics. Social engineering champion, true. Well, that was a close one. But you pulled it off. Nice work, Rolo. Alright, everyone knows what to do? Oh. Yep, deep engineering is in the north. I'll go with Beck. In case she needs some muscle. I'll head east to the founder's office. Don't split up. You two be safe. Oh, God. Locate the founder's office. Oh, no. Box. Box. Bow, bow, bow. Oh, gosh, these characters are so adorable. They're so cute. Perennial harvest reception. Better not head that way. Oh, I thought that was this. Oh, water cooler. That's odd. Time to do all the crimes. There's not even any cups for the water. Oh, that is odd. Well, it's not that odd, Luca. You just put your mouth up to the nozzle. The CDC said it's okay to kiss your coworkers now. Oh. Oh, this place is a maze. A hallway to nowhere? What's going on here? Is this some sort of mind game? You can do it. You can do it. Oh. Oh. Nyrum. Whoa! What the? Nyrum. What the? <gasps> Solomon? Solomon stopped in his tracks. We found out Solomon's the baby baby founder too. What voice did I give him? Wait, are we technically co-worker slug? <gasps> hey yo! <laughs> yeah, the CDC said it's chill. <laughs> Yeah, we're colleagues. Luca? What are you doing here? It's a long story. Are you okay? A veneer of confusion flashed across Solomon's face. Oh. His words rushed out dramatically. No, I am most certainly not okay. Someone, some strange people grabbed me and... Were they in hazmat suits? Yes, how did you know? They brought me here and locked me up, and when they were distracted, I ran. Dang, okay. You should stick with me. We got a plan. Solomon's facade briefly faltered. Oh. <gasps> we? Yeah, Rolo and Beck are headed to deep engineering. Thank heavens you found me. We've got to get out of here. We can't leave just yet. But they'll catch us again. I gotta do something first. When you were running, did you happen to see a door marked Founder? Founder? Why are you looking for him? I'm not. I just need to get into the office. Uh-oh. Now that you mention it, I do think I saw a door that said Founder. It was just down this Luke way. to notice a plaque above the door. Oh. Office of the Founder? Knocking comes with consequence. Something I like about how this game works is that it's not actual time travel, so characters don't keep the meta knowledge. Yeah, it's just like, come fun little, fun little, like, um, um, like, nods where, like, when, when, um, when um when uh he was like if you want to come hang out at our treehouse before um um like that was really cute that's like a nice little nod cuz like we know but they don't know it's very sweet yeah flower moment true just don't knock easy peasy knocking comes with consequence oh here it is oh, we did it oh so it is Pretty lucky that I ran into you, or else I might have missed it. Truly fortunate. Exactly. The player still uses the meta knowledge, but the characters don't have it. It's good. Yeah. I'm kind of tired of meta stories. Yeah, I really like the way this is done. Luca tried the handle. Whoa. Lock. Solomon 
leaned forward to examine the mechanism. Oh. Regrettably, it seems to be some sort of electric lock. I don't see how you or how we could possibly defeat a lock like that. Is Doggy going to double cross us? So in one of the timelines, Pickle, we found out that this is actually the founder. And and what they're making is like a Mogus potion that makes them like uh, uh, age rapidly, which is how the like the the fertilizer is gonna be like like super beneficial to everybody. So like he actually drinks this potion that makes him like age up again, um um um, and he becomes the founder. Um, and that was one of the bad timelines where 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 we lose. But so we don't know that in this timeline. Luca doesn't know that, but we as the as the player know that. Thank you for the stretch and the spippy. Hi, Nikarian. Thank you. Wow. Stretch. Stretching in this form is so cute. Oh my gosh. Evil Fisk. Yeah, Dark Fisk. Not one of the good ones. Luca smiled and looked at his watch. Whoa. Let's just wait a minute. <gasps> Mink Mommy. That wasn't a fist violence. What? <laughs> Let's go. I don't know what sort of funny business you're up to, but I like it. I think it's more time magic potion if you can old either oldify you or youthify you, depending, yeah, on what it's supposed to do. She mimed a quick hat tip and ambled off with a whistle. <laughs> She do a crime. <laughs> then why did the counter go up? That's true. Can't argue with that. The light <laughs> on the hat changed from red to green. <gasps> How did you do that? It's good to have friends. Quick, let's get inside before someone spots us. We love a lesbian criminal. True. <sighs> she be gay. Do she? She do crime. True. Walkie-talkie. Rolo, I'm in. As expected, there's a control panel. Great timing. We're stuck at locked door mark number 24601. Need you to get through. If crime bad, why crime lady hot? True. You're so right for this. Yeah, a, a lot of people are saying this. I'm always saying this. But if someone catches us, we should get out of here. I'm not leaving my friend Solomon. On the computer screen, a green cursor blinked in a password field. Oh. Surely you don't have any way to get around the password. I've been saying this, yeah. Hmm. He pecked out his best guess. Underground secrets. True. The screen blinked to life. <laughs> Columns of green numbers glowed on a black background. Homie put fucking password in his password. Mm -hmm. I remember Bean wrote an opinion piece in the news about this. True. How? How did you guess that? Oh, it's this absurd password Rolo heard when he was down here before. It's funny how someone arrogant enough to call themselves the founder uses such a basic password. Whoa. Or they were thinking several moves ahead, not expecting anyone to guess something so simple. Real slug IQ moment. So true. Solomon, you, you're a real one for that. N not gonna lie. These villain types always end up outsmarting themselves. Or they're just dumb. Yeah. Solomon's <laughs> jaw clenched into a half smile. <laughs> He's so fucking mad. <laughs> your powers of deduction are as impressive as your luck. Luca quickly scanned the columns for number 24601. <laughs> He's so smug and he's so mad. <laughs> Get Cobb, you dumb jerk. I love him just shitting on him. Yeah, it's so good. Cause, Cause Luca doesn't know. That's what makes it so much fun. Rolo, I think they should do it. Bingo, bango. Doors open. Luca, you never fail to impress. Oh. What is that slippery lout even doing down here? We have a friend whose mom is in trouble. We're here to get her out. I see. Okay, Luca, I think we're close to the door. The well, I think we're close. The next door's marked 13806. Once again, Luca scrutinized the numbers on the screen. Oh. In that moment of distraction, Solomon reached forward and pressed a large red button. <gasps> Maybe this one opens the lock. 
No. Red button is never a good button. Bro, he fucking, he called an emergency meeting with the Amoguses. Crap, we've got company. Luca must go faster. One sec, I can't think with all this noise. He quickly skimmed the screen with his finger. Oh, uh, 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 here it is, 1386. Go, 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 go. Curse these fumbling hands. My apologies, Luca. Solomon self-report for real, for real. Don't beat yourself up. I knew you were just trying to help. No, we should beat him up uh, ourselves. There's a self-report, yeah. More like Susso, man. Exactly. Oh! Book it! <laughs> Vex's little walk cycle is so cute. Oh, man! No water cups. Rollo! <laughs> Rolo, are you okay? Rolo, come in! Oh. <gasps> Mr. Kerr! Mr. Kerr. With a sneer and spoke Solomon's eyebrows are adorable. Every character, even the evil ones of this game, are fucking cute as hell. Oh. Oh. Why this game gotta be too intense for the art, for real? Himbo moment. You can turn off the alarms. <laughs> They're trapped. With self satisfaction, he called into the hallway. Oh. That, my dears, is a dead end. Nowhere to run. Rut row. Rolo, where are you? Are you okay? Slug, you're pretty dang cute. What do you mean? Hi, Index. Wait, is this him? Monka. Yeah, I think we lost him. Making our way back to Nelly's office. <gasps> Pranked! Pranked! <gasps> it is them! Yeah, uh, uh, a sister and, 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 and squirrel friend helped. Page detected. True. Untitled goose game. Mm -mm -mm. Okay, new two rabble razzles are coming with us. Nope. <laughs> she went right for the scroat. No! <laughs> she went right for the scroat. Make a break for it. Oh wait, maybe it was his shin. It looked like his scroat though. <laughs> Not shot. I think it was his shin, but <laughs> you went real high there cuz it really caught me off guard. Yeah. I squeaked a little bit. I did a, I did a dolly squeak. I did a dolly squeak. It's nuts or nothing, baby. No, nope. kicks you in the balls cutely. Yeah. Did that little shit just kick me? Squeak, yeah. Hi, Mama Hen. Hi, Mama Hen. Yeah, squeak counter. Don't just stand there after them. He's got one thing on his mind, and it's just this cute man scrow. True. True. I'm always thinking about him. Okay, I think that worked. Roxy and Fitz have them on a wild goose chase. An untitled goose game chase. That's my purse. I don't know you. Yeah. I'm having trouble following what just happened. You got pranked, dude. Like I said, it's good to have friends. Do you think Mr. Kerr is... You know. <laughs> you know. <laughs> you know, limp <laughs> Rolo, how long do you think Roxy can distract them? Did you know that if you fall a slug, you earn a natural plus two charisma? It's true. A, a lot of people are saying this. Uh, a lot of people are also saying that, Mama Hen. Mama Hen said, uh, trans breakdance hamster. How long can Roxy keep someone so pissed off they can't see straight? Let's just say we got time. Following is free, true. Entering Nelly's office now. <gasps> Mom! Oh, honey, what did you do to your hair? Oh, I thought you'd be happy. I finally used the Young Chemist Labs kit. A stat bonus to Charisma, my lowest stat. Wait, no, that's Dex. I figured you'd have high dexterity, Mama Hen. You sure have a knack for making me incredibly proud in the most frustrating ways. True. We need to get you out of here. We? Who is your adult friend? <laughs> True. 
Oh, I'm not an adult. I'm not an adult adult. Ever heard of a growth spurt? <laughs> Welcome back, Ace. I had more of a growth spew. True. No, that's not possible. Slugging game. True. I love this. I love this game so much. Whoa. Substantial banding on the enamel of the molars? Consistent with Tempest Liquamine exposure? Is that what you call the gunk they forced me to drink? You drank it? Oh, oh no. They told me it was only being tested on plants! <laughs> this mustache is a part of my disguise. Looks like me in high school. Oh, Beck, sweetie, I promise I didn't know. Mom, what the hell is going on in this place? I was brought here to work on the discovery of a lifetime. A novel chemical compound was discovered under Beacon Pines in a wellspring they call the Source. They named it Tempest Liquamine. It pulls energy from its surroundings in order to fundamentally alter matter's relationship to time. It was the secret to Valentine's fertilizer. They harvested the Source infusing small amounts of Tempest Liquamine into the product. It worked wonders, drastically accelerating plant, plant growth. Crops would be ready to harvest in a fraction of the time. But it led to complications. Mm -hmm. The fell harvest! Perennial harvest came in to clean up the mess. To succeed where Valentine failed. But Tempest Liquamine is rebellious. Mm -hmm. Rebellious? You can think of it as a manifestation of change itself. It's volatile by its very nature. So the more you try to force it to do a specific thing, the more it resists, yes. I can relate to that. <gasps> Rebellion, let's go. My role was to finish the work of my predecessor, Dr. Prescott. Harnessing Tempest Liquid mean to re reliably manipulate an organism's age. Just imagine how many people we could feed. Mr. Kerr was very insistent that we achieve a successful result before today's festival. The wellspring is real! But you didn't, right? Sighed. You know how much I love a good puzzle. I poured myself into the problem. It wasn't long until I discovered oddities in Dr. Prescott's, 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 Prescott's notes. This new TBH slug is model is giving me life. It's so good. Glottal did such a good job. Also, Mama Hen, when I'm not talking, I just no thoughts, head empty. Just when I'm when I'm not running my mouth, it's so fucking. <laughs> he's so fucking brainless. <laughs> it's just. Also, it can get mad. It can get mad. Perfect. I love when you are silent. Listen here, you yippee no thoughts. Glottal's cracked. Hey, this is way too over the top evil to be realistic. It's not like this would happen in real life, right? Right? Yeah, did you see the eyes, Mama Hen? Do you notice anything interesting about them? The eyes are important. Mm -hmm. Do you so notice anything potentially suspicious about them? Look into my eyes. Can we buy your silence? For $8,000 a month. <laughs> Slonky was meant to be seen, not heard. True. True. Yeah. But then you wouldn't get all my silly voices. It wasn't long until I discovered oddities in Dr. Prescott's notes. Oddities? They contain obvious errors, mistakes that someone of his reputation would never make. <gasps> he was sabotaging it. That's <gasps> a big game, man. That's a big game, man. True. <laughs> That's a big game, man. Thank you for the, the Bitoli's pickle. Um, um, um. <gasps> he was sabotaging it because he didn't want the other Amoguses to use it. Oh, the timing. That's a big gay, man. He's being a little sus. Being a little bit sussy. So I fixed them and... And now I get to replace my entire wardrobe. I really am truly sorry. Eh, those clothes were all hand-me-downs anyway. Sounds like Dr. Prescott figured it out. Got cold feet and intentionally sabotaged his own work. I considered that possibility. I've sent a letter asking him to clarify his thinking. Mom, Dr. Prescott is dead. Kerr had him killed. What? I overheard, them, I overheard them talking about it on the radio. It's why we gotta get you out of here. I just... Like, now! 
Wait, the vial! I finally solved the chemical equation allowing direct control of aging. Mr. Kerr picked it up just before you came. All the more reason we gotta hightail it. Luca, we got Dr. Modwill. Heading your way now. Roger that, be careful. Whoa. All right, everything's on track. And what is your plan for escape? We'll go over everything when they get here. In the meantime, maybe we can dig up some more info. People run. <gasps> Malice 80 proof whiskey. A hard drink for a hard man. Wow, even his alcohol is arrogant. Solomon muttered inaudibly. <laughs> I should just smother you right now. What's that? I said I shouldn't bother you right now. Don't be silly, you're no bother at all. Yeah, a hard man, gotcha hyper. Oh, he's throwing darts at his son. Aw, mean to him. What's the, he's mean to him? Let's see what else this bad boy has on it. Security system. Time card logs. Payroll. You know, for being so evil, this guy sure is boring. Solomon once again muttered under his breath. <laughs> Just you wait. Huh? Oh, uh, nothing. Don't think we forgot you still have to fix the sun. I know. Yeah, but he... Kane, were you here when we had the reveal in the other timeline that Solomon was the founder? And and the, <laughs> and the son? Son just, Daddy! <laughs> I just, ah, uh, shit. I think he's beyond repair even for myself. Luca tugged on each of the cabinets, but payroll is very important. True. Whoa. Dang, this must be the good stuff. They're all locked! Oh, is this why I'm reminding you? Damn. No, I don't want to. I don't want him anymore. He's got daddy issues. Perhaps he's not as careless as you suspected. I don't know, he broke in. He's pretty careless. Whoa. Looks like the founder was helping Curl plan the festival. Why would such a secretive leader be obsessed with a party? Only time will tell. He held his hand up to the ashtray. Oh. Still warm. He must have been in here recently. Oh my god, this little kid's smoking. <laughs> That's kind of terrifying. The founder watching this five-year-old look through all his shit and roast him. This is probably my most humiliating moment, yeah. He's coping, he's molding, he's seething. Alright. The kid's just smoking? Yeah, this kid's smoking. I'm really sorry you got dragged into this mess, Solomon. You needn't worry about me. Well, I feel bad either way. We're gonna get you out of this, I promise. Average capitalist, moment, true. A smile crawled across Solomon's face. Smogus. They heard the trampling of frantic footsteps from the hallway. <gasps> Beck! Lucky, lucky, lucky! What? That was close. We left when we left Ellie's office. It was swarming with clipboards. We barely got away. Did they follow you? Uh oh. <laughs> Rollo. <laughs> this is my favorite face and my favorite line. The two of these together, Rollo. <laughs> it's the way. It's how I picture y'all when y'all are like slug. <laughs> Slug. Slug. Rollo. <laughs> Before we start tossing around blame. <laughs> this is also accurate. Slug. <laughs> Someone screenshot his face. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> it is possible someone ordered a pizza. This is true. Someone could have ordered a pizza. We'd love to hear your thoughts. Definitely not a pizza. What now? Don't look at me. I'm officially retiring from the heisting business. We're so sorry for the inconvenience. We just have a few quick questions. Just let me think. Can someone watch the door? Uh-oh. No, don't let him watch the door. Of course. 
Rolo Smilu. <laughs> Rolo Smilu. <laughs> Rolo Smilu. <laughs> Thank you for the penalties, Pickle. <laughs> Everyone else, huddle up. Oops. I think this little caper has gone on long enough. Solomon, no! Hush now, child. The adults are speaking. Dr. Modwell, a brief reintroduction is in order. I hate this fucking dog. Yeah. Worst Fisk. We've never met in person, but we have corresponded. You see, it was I who hired you. Solomon, the pathetic orphan child. The powerful and enigmatic founder. He saw up his own ass, dude. Sharper, the fallen progenitor who created this town. Perennial Harvest, Valentine Fertilizer. All connected by a single thread. Yours truly. Any violence against him doesn't count. <gasps> a free pass for dog violence. <laughs> Mouth pats. As long as you're allowed to fist violence once, I'll do my best. <laughs> Solomon, like, you can't hurt me in a way that matters. And chat's like, yeah, but he can. Letting me out of a cage. <laughs> He's the he's the most violent fi thing I've ever seen to dogs. You you won't you don't stand a chance. You have one free fist grumbling. I'll use it wisely. But that's Her eyes search the floor in thought. Slug running out violently kicking the air. I hate fists. I hate fists. Solomon watched <laughs> eagerly, waiting for the flicker of epiphany. <gasps> With a sickened look, she peered into his soul. Oh no. Ha! Yes! Now you've got it! Hi, Error! Tempest Liquamine. You discovered how to reverse the process. Doggo and Dolly. Whoa, true! <gasps> she is an otter. She is an otter. I didn't realize. AI yeah, for Gore. The kick of 87. True. Solomon clapped with genuine delight. <laughs> It's like after escaping the peptol, <laughs> the pet play, the VR chamber, yeah. Yeah. Very good, Dr. Modwill. Very good. Though the discovery wasn't intentional. Solomon glanced down, Dr. Moe Devil. <gasps> She's the Moe Devil. <gasps> that also explains a lot. Moe's three letters! Oh my god. Then the effects went a little. Too far for my tastes. Whoa, aware, yeah. That's why you needed me to finish Dr. Prescott's work. Whoa. Which you did admirably. Mr. Kerr, the file, please. Kerr presented it with a theatrical twirl of the hand. Oh. Thank you for this, Pippi. Yeah, my, my tummy's kind of hurting. Thank you, thank you. I probably need to eat lunch. Oh, may I present to you the eighth Before wonder of the? Rollo snatched the vial from Kerr's palm. <gasps> we need to cr the scrope kicker again. True. Quick drop kick him while you can. <gasps> Hi Pyrox, let's go. Mm -hmm. Well, this stuff sounds pretty valuable. <laughs> Be careful, you fool. You have no idea what you have in your hands. Rollo the goat, let's go! Rollo MVP. Actually, we do. You just did a whole evil villain monologue y thing about it. Rollo casually sure. tossed the vial to Luca. <laughs> he fucking. That was so cute. He's wiping his nose and then went into catching it. Gosh, maybe I'll have a taste. <gasps> do we get older? <gasps> Are we gonna get older, Luca? Luca jiggled the vial mockingly. Sees him. Luca, over here. Oh, they're playing keep away. Move another inch and I smash it. She held it tightly behind her back. Oh. Solomon sighed, speaking oh. in crisp, measured syllables. Oh. You have no plan. I'll smash it, I swear. Fine. Risk killing us all. Or, if you're lucky, nothing happens. Then what? We capture you and grant you much less leniency. He pursed his lips with feigned sincerity. 
But I give you my word. If you hand it over now, none of you will be harmed. A That's deep Cap. Uncertainty washed over Beck. That's fucking Cap. No shot. You're a smart girl, Beck. But there's no shame in being outwitted by someone smarter than you. We both know there is only one way this ends. She looked to Nellie shakily. Oh. With a dispirited nod, Nellie sighed in defeat. No shot. Beck Don't. Nellie approached Solomon. That's a good girl. Beck, no, don't do it! We can't trust that jerk. I'm sorry, he's right. With apprehension, Beck conceded. After all the shit Lucas said about him, there's no way he will let that go. Yeah, no shot! Solomon pocketed the vial and brushed off his shoulder with a sharp flick. Wait. I think she did a switcheroo. I think she did a switcheroo chat. I think she had a separate vial full of full of nonsense. I think this is all planned. Hmm, we'll see. Mr. Kerr, you have allowed yourself to be humiliated by a group of children. Report to my office tomorrow for a performance review. Gave him the piss vial, yeah. I think so, that feels like her, yeah. She did a little trolling. She's the type to do a little trolling. The blood drained from Kerr's face. The other vials Mountain Dew, yeah. Gave him the piss jar. The slug Gatorade jar. Hmm. Of course, sir. He's gonna get fucking scrambled. But first, you have a speech to make. Turn out there and give me the introduction I deserve. Dear God, Mountain Dew, hot toxic? True. And don't forget to smile. Yes, sir. Oh. And to think, all of this is thanks to the efforts of Mr. Van Horn. I don't understand. How is this all because of me? Huh. I said Mr. Van Horn, silly child. Dr. Walt Van Horn. Your father was always a thorn in my side. I offered him an opportunity. To be a part of something great. Oh, it's the juice that makes him even younger? Gonna turn him into a fucking babu. Evil dad? No, no, I think dad, dad was good. Dad was good. But the fool was blinded by righteousness. Do we know that already? Kind of, vaguely. But I think this is like our confirmation, especially for Luca. He even broke into my laboratory in an attempt to sabotage my work. Solomon shook his head with gratification. But the universe has a funny way of correcting course. By meddling with a force he didn't understand, Walt showed me its true potential. As fate would have it, Luca, your father's dying act was to grant me eternal life. A muffled applause resonated faintly through the walls. Whoa. Pachi, 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 pachi. Well, that's my cue. After the festivities and my subsequent ascension, I will return to deal with you all. Until then, I suggest you use this time to reflect on the magnitude of your failure. You three keep post outside this door. <gasps> well, crap. <laughs> Rot row. I can't believe Beck sold us out like that. I'm not sure she had any other choice. So what now? What's the plan? We don't have one. Have the clones been explained yet? No. They're just kind of there. They haven't given us like an actual explanation for why they all look the same. Of course you do. You always have a plan. Rolo. You just need some time. Rolo, it's over. We lost. Oh. Nellie was staring at the floor, deep in thought. Is that old Rolo or Rolo's dad? It's old Rolo. Rolo got, got fed the Amogus potion in this timeline. They're quadruplets. Yeah, they're just, they, yeah, they're all just like uh, sex tuplets or whatever. Sorry, Luca. Give me a minute to calm my mind. Beck, what the fuck, dude? Hey. I'm sorry, Luca. I did what I had to do. I know, it's just, we were so close. I've got a feeling that eventually Solomon will get with will get. Blah, blah, I've got a I've got a feeling that eventually Solomon will get so get what. Blah, blah, why can't I read this? I've got a feeling that eventually 
Solomon will get what's coming to him. Time wounds all heals. Whoa, oh, I've never heard that expression, but I like it. Well, this time seems like less of an issue for him now. Slug stroke? Yeah, for real. Luca, there's something you should know. After Mr. Kerr locked me in that office, I had nothing but time and curiosity. She first time heals all wounds? Yeah, but 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 she made it to be uh time wounds all heals, like a heal. Like a like not a like a healing them, but like a like a heal, like like a like a bad actor, like a uh, a sussy baka. Mm -hmm. I've never heard that the expression, but I like it. I had nothing but time and curiosity. I poked around a bit, hoping to find a means of escape, but I found something else. A note hidden in a false drawer. What sort of note? I didn't know heel could mean a bad actor. Yeah, a heel like a. Oh, you're such a heel. It's a very... It's a... It, I assumed it meant foothill. It does, but it's like... I don't know where the expression started. It's a very dated expression, like, from the... From, like, the 50s. Like, you... Oh, you're such a heel. I only know heel from wrestling. Yeah. Um, um... So, it's a very dated expression, but... Dr. Prescott must have sensed his time at Perennial Harvest was growing short. Never heard of it. Yeah, yeah. A uh, heel is a wrestling terminology as a villain character used to make someone else more relatable. Oh, well, then there you go. Heel is wrestling, as far as I know. Well, I, th I think it predates that, but... Well, there you go. But that would make sense why it's used in wrestling. So he left behind a letter, with the hope it would be found by his successor. It was a confession of, shorts, of sorts. He left it for me, but its contents... Luca, I, I think they were meant for you. Why? What did it say? It was about an incident with your mother. Dr. Prescott found her in his lab with a stolen key card. That's boomer language. Yeah, exactly. It was an accident. She had been exposed to extreme amounts of Tempest Liquamine. The color dropped from Luca's face. Did, did she? Is she? She survived. Dr. Prescott decided to help her recover. Which the player, wrestler playing a villain role is called the heel, and a wrestler playing the heroic role is called the face. Yeah. It's probably... Yeah, actually, now that I'm thinking about it, it might actually be from, like, classic dramatization. Is Grandma actually her mom? Yeah, she is. We found that out in one of the timelines, too. Not in this one yet, though. Now we get to know how she became Granny, yeah. He no longer trusted Perennial Harvest, so he kept her whereabouts a secret. Over time, your mother led him to reconsider the purpose of scientific discovery. Science is often the vanguard of change, but that doesn't mean it's always right. He realized that no one should have control over something as powerful as time itself. I now believe that's why he began to intentionally sabotage his own work. And it cost him his life! That's a reasonable conclusion. Luca was overwhelmed with emotion. But if she's alive, where's she been? Where's she now? A sudden explosion sounded from the hull. Whoa. Chapter 8. Comeuppance. Whoa. Ears still ringing, Gran picked herself up off the ground. Through the dust and smoke, she looked over to see Mrs. Fratelli helping Hiram Tolliver to his feet. <gasps> She'd had to beg, borrow, and steal to acquire those explosives. The three goobers. How many nights had she spent visualizing how she'd use them to make things right? Yeah, because they were always going to blow up the, the source, and that oh, that's what causes the freeze. And now, her one shot at destroying the source, that damned hole that swallowed so much of her life, was gone. What happened to them? Traded for this jagged hole in a wall and a foolhardy shot at rescuing Rollo. <laughs> With Fratelli and Tolliver at her side, she stepped through. It was a strange feeling. The last time she'd stalked this maze of hallways, it was in a different body. Mm, they quickly true. rounded a corner to find a group of clipboards guarding a door. Something worth guarding is probably something worth seeing. True. She leapt forward, brandishing her cane. If her last chance at vengeance for things lost was truly gone, she would just have to fight to keep what she still had. Mm -hmm. Whoa! Thwack! Yeah, get him, Gran! 
Bark, 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 Gran, what are you doing here? Luca, what are you doing here? We're here to save Nelly. We're here to save Rolo. Hi, Mrs. Luca's Gran. <laughs> That's awful nice of you. But I'm fine. Oh, no. What did they... Gran, there's no time to explain. We have to go now. Come on, everyone. We've got a party to crash. Let's go! Way out from deep within perennial harvest, just as Solomon finished up his speech. Oh. Thankfully, we can dispense with the formalities from here on out. Bro looks, looks so extremely dad. He really does. Solomon pulled a glass vial from his pocket. Come on. We gotta stop him! In one smooth motion, he downed its contents. A triumphant smile grew across Solomon's Go lips. get your man slug? No! <laughs> no! Well, I guess that's it. We lost. <gasps> I knew it! I wouldn't be so sure about that. Let's fucking go! With a mischievous look. Back mischievous. Luca. Remember when I had the vial behind my back? Mischievous. I might have tweaked this wonder potion with a little junk change. Beck trolled us too. Malice. Oh, little junk, a little change. Malice. You think malice? Hmm. A little bit of junk. Oh. I think it's junk. Change? I think it's junk. I might have tweaked his wonder potion with a little junk. Whoa. <laughs> Camp to wait. <laughs> Two of these are jokes and one is the real? Yeah. Can't wait to see the look on his face when he realizes he drank his own cigar ash. Gross. I feel me. Real ending, yeah. Whoa. How did ashes get into the vial? It's pretty easy to mess with the vial when it was behind my back. We put ash in the vial! Oh, that's sneaky. Well, it's a bad habit anyways. Paul always says bad habits are like 50-yard field goals. Huh. Hard to kick. Someone who drank something like that, I am retching? Oh, no. Let me out. You can all call me Shopper Valentine. His body and face began to contort and expand as he disappeared into a belching green mist. Wait, is it still gonna work? Or is it gonna scramble him? <laughs> Get fucking owned, dude! Reduced to fucking smitharoons! Smitharoons! Oh my god. Whoa. Uh Aw, thank you, Albert. That's very sweet. Thanos snap. We fucking got his ass. Hi also hi Albert and hi Lobber. Get fucked. Get fucked, dude. Rip Bozo. Any rip bozos in chat? Get fucking clowned on, idiot. There's your one free fisk violence. And boy. Howdy, what a fisk violence it was. What a fisk violence it was. Well, that's one way to kick a bad habit. Whoa. <laughs> Hold on, I tabbed out. There we go. What's with this ending? Whoa. As I think this is the true ending. Once sharper Valentine Damn, you're so angry. <laughs> Get fucked. Still numb from what they had just observed. <gasps> this is a freebie. Valentine was gone for good. Owned. This end would be a new beginning for Beacon Pines. Let's go! A new chance to let go of the things they had lost and grab hold of a new future. Let's go! And <gasps> Well, I'd be lying if I said that wasn't a bit gratifying. True. If that feels to you like a good note to end on, I won't stand in your way. Hmm. Hmm. Well, we gotta see. We gotta see what the other endings are like. Might have tweaked his wonder potion with a little change. I might have tweaked his wonder potion with oh, a Malice? little Oh, Malice? I'll do all change. of them. 
Like pocket change? Your unlucky penny! Yeah, I plopped it in the vial when no one was looking. What's that going to do? No idea. That's the beauty of science. Now we observe. You can call me Sharper Valentine. His body and face began to contort and expand as he disappeared into a belching green mist. Whoa. Yeah, you love fucking capital so much, become it. Whoa. Whoa. Holy crap, he's a baby. Yeah, but he's still sharper, right? What he was no longer matters. The baby? Whoa, look at his look at his fucking grotesque little face. What a horrible little beast. This is an innocent child. I apologize for all the harm my father has caused you. Very late theme abortion, yeah, let's go. Little baby man, little baby, little baby man. Awkward, cradly, awkwardly cradled the squirming child. A stretch and a spiffy, thank you, Doppel. Mm -mm. Punt him, yeah. Yeet. Mm -hmm. And a spippy. Thank you, thank you. Augustus, what do we... What we Valentines always do. What must be done. I'll hurry home and prepare a crib for... Father. Er, uh, young Sharper. That'd be a great help. Thank you. She looked back down at the infant with equal parts kindness and terror in her eyes. Whoa. With a shake of her head, Eris addressed the crowd with a stern scowl. Okay, everyone. The show is over. You may leave now. Eris is bark, yeah. She's she's a, a very attractive borzoi. Huh. Epilogue. Oh! This is the true ending? Beacon Pine's coldest summer on record came and went without much fanfare. Oh. Folks shared what they had and none were left wanting. The new school year was ushered in by the falling leaves of autumn. Let me go home now? Okay, bye, Ash. After everything Luca, Rollo, and Beck had Papa Dog gonna be grounded. The school was bearable. Oh. The chill of winter didn't seem to bother people much. They kindled a hope for a better future in their hearts. When spring oh. arrived, farmers planted their crops with a sense of joy and optimism. And as the dawn of the first day of summer came again, its light slowly spread through the shallow valley. It crept over the town square, across the river, past the neglected welcome sign, and came to rest on a young boy sleeping at dawn. Did they de-age Rolo? At peace, I think so. I would imagine. For a reason. Hmm. No. 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 Gonna head out. Okay. Bye, Ace. I wanna. I wanna see Malice, and then we'll do the epilogue. No. Malice. Tweaked his wonder potion with a little malice. Malice. Malice? The whiskey from his office? Time for evil path. Yep, dude had an unfinished glass on his desk. Figured his grow juice could use a little hair of the dog. You can call me Sharper Valentine. His body and face began to contort and expand as he disappeared into a belching green mist. Oh. Whoa. <laughs> now that's what I call 80 poof whiskey. <laughs> yippee! He got yippied, Rip Bozo. Yippee! Hi, Eska. Oh, it's lunchtime. Well, good timing. Well, damn, dude. <laughs> the crowd gazed in stunned silence at the now empty stage. The quiet was broken when William Kerr sprinted off stage and into the distance. He was never seen around Beacon Pines or anywhere else for that matter again. 
Bye. Watching the silhouette of Kerr disappear over the horizon, Luca began to laugh. Owned. First, a low chuckle that became uncontrolled, heaving laughter. <laughs> Happy Harvest Festival! In his tears, he was vaguely aware that the crowd had begun to laugh with him. Fucking scrambulated. That's a good ending. I like that ending. That was... unexpected. No, it was good. Perhaps a bit of an absurd ending for my taste, but who am I to say? Mm, true. I'm only writing the damn thing. Whoa! <laughs> Alright, we'll go with the real ending. A dog died and they all just laughed? A man died and you're laughing? A man turned into confetti and you're laughing? Beacon Pine folks. Yeah, 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 before we wrap up this epilogue, let me go feed the kitties real quick. I'll grab my sandwich, and um, it seems like we're really close to the end of the game, so we might just do some videos after and then maybe play a little Pokemon, but I do gotta feed the kitties because they're going feral. So I'll be right back, okay? I'll be right back.
Hi. Sorry. One of uh one of the uh Whoa, hi, thank you, thank you. Hi. One of uh one of uh one of uh one of the kitties threw up, so I had to clean it up. Sorry that took a little bit longer than normal. One of the kitties threw up, so I had to clean it up. He awaketh. Yeah, I return. I return. Uh, let me go down here. Um, 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 game. Game. There we go. Okay. Uh, controller. Resume. Sorry, I threw up. Okay, I throw up. <gasps> oh, no, they're okay. I think so. Bruce is kind of... He's just kind of chilling. Hopefully he goes and eats soon. Um, um, but they seem okay. Let's see. Whoa. Breast, thank you. I sneeze. I sneeze. Moshi mosh. Rolo, are you up yet? He doesn't, he doesn't look like he's like in pain or anything. He's just kind of being an egg. He does that sometimes. He doesn't always immediately go for his food. So hopefully he does. Roger that. It's a beautiful day at Mission Control. You gonna swing by? Be there in a minute. Check in with Rolo at the treehouse. Okay. Nyom. Nyom. Wait, I wonder if... <gasps> they probably de-aged Rolo, but they might have also de-aged Mom. Eleanor began moving Walt's old things out of the closet and into storage. <gasps> oh. Eleanor had moved back into her bedroom. Oh. And now that she wasn't sneaking out late, she even slept there most nights. Let's go! Nyom. Is Eleanor here? Well, I one more for the road, my favorite. Where he could sit on the couch and then he <laughs> he slither off. I wonder if the faucet's still on. Go to the basement? True. I wonder if the faucet's still on. <laughs> it's been <laughs> It's been on for fucking it's been on for weeks. It's been on for weeks and multiple timelines. You love to see it. You love to see it. The water bill is gonna be horrendous. Surprised you haven't flooded the house. The water bill, yeah. Mom, I'm ready to go now. Uh you go on without me. I'll meet you there. I've got a batch of jam to finish jarring. It's funny. I only started making jam as a way to send out messages without anyone noticing. The actual true ending is you losing your house because of the water bill. True. <laughs> but now I enjoy it. Was it really jam? This like single-handedly drains an aquifer. Wait, I want to go into the basement. No basement? Damn. Okay. What about the backyard? Or weed. Yeah. Is that a weed? No. Nyom. There's nothing back here. Nyom. 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 All right, let's go. Bum, 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 bum. I like this team. Bum, 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 bum. Look, there could be jams in the drugs just related. True. Basement is where we keep all the mods. True. This isn't really our dad up here either. That's kind of... <gasps> they moved it. Whoa, Slug would never even think of smonking a weed. They moved the fake gravestone. Because this isn't the real Beacon Pines. So it's not his real grave. They removed the headstone. <gasps> he sneezed! Let's go! We got one more sneeze for the road, too. Achoo! <gasps> Whoa. Hey, you and Rolo have big plans for that little treehouse. Yeah, it started getting crowded after we revoked the max capacity one Rolo, one Luca rule. So we decided to expand. Because <gasps> of Iggy and, and, and Beck. The music is increasing in pace. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Wait, does that mean it's not the real bacon? Uh, so the real bacon pans was um, originally frozen over because of the source. And so when they told everybody to leave town for a few days, they uh, built this whole replica of the town. So we found his original... Like, his dad's actual headstone in the old town in one of the timelines. Not in this one, but I guess they moved it. Because now they know the truth. Um, at least you got some help with that. How's the internship at Nelly and Il Ilana's shop going? <gasps> the real Bacon Pines is the friends we made along the way. True. <laughs> it's been great. I'm hoping it helps me get into the School of Agriculture up at a state. Up at state. 
Also, Nellie said she'd write a letter of recommendation, which would be huge. I just can't help but worry about leaving Rolo. He's grown up so fast, but he's still my little brother. Yeah, he had a heck of a growth spurt. <gasps> I think he's still old Rolo. I don't just mean grown literally. This morning he was up and finished his chores before I even had breakfast. My account is that the sink was left running in the real bacon pine still. <laughs> True. Well, some of that might be his excitement about the treehouse renovations. Dad Rolo Art! Don't tell him this, because it'll go to his head. But I'm really proud of that little punk. <gasps> I'm sure he feels the same way, but he's just too dang proud to tell you. That's why there's so much ice, yeah. If his mom is, I'd imagine Rolo would be older still too. Yeah, they probably don't have any de-aging serum. Or probably were like, we're not gonna fuck with that shit anymore. I know. <gasps> so cute! So cute! Shovel. Where does this go? This goes out of town. Oh! I can fix you. <gasps> He's smiling! <gasps> He's happy! Hey, guys, how's the tree planting going? Could it be better? I'm so grateful to Alana and Nelly for letting me help. I just wasn't built to be a mayor. Too much bureaucracy. <gasps> the clipboard! Slug, you fixed him! I told you I could. I told you I could. Go all smiling, Gus. Why does the mayor remind me of Harry Dubois? That's why I'm so attracted to him. Gus, we finished cleaning up the sidewalks. What's when next? The perennial harvest collapsed. Most of the clipboards skipped town. Oh. But some stuck around and dedicated themselves to making things right. Maybe they're not clones. They're just... They're just little weirdos. I don't know. Anyone with a knack for art can help paint the new offices. You can count on us. Well, it looks like you really found your calling. I never really felt comfortable telling what people what to do. Now this right here. They're just little guys, yeah, they're just little weirdos. This is something I can be proud of. Aww. This is such a cute ending, I love this. I love this so much, whoa. He just likes digging holes. Yeah, cause he's a fisk. Of course he does. Typical. Okay, we post up. Okay, we post up. Let's talk to the pigoid. I'm crying. It's so sweet. How's the morning nap? How's this? Oh. How's the napping this morning? Slow and dirty harvest. Oh my god. Yeah. <gasps> That's the name of the building. Oh, <laughs> slow and dirty. I love games with endings like this. It's just, nah, it's good now. We aren't going to do sad shit. Yeah, there's nothing wrong with a happy ending. I love a happy ending. The most underrated part of a good nap is the view. And the view's getting greener every day. Nice. Even he's happy. Whoa. Wait, can we go back here? Okay. Nelly. I see you decided on a name. Yeah, we had to clear out all the old stuff before putting on the final touch. Slow and Dirty Harvest is now official. I like it. Me too, and so does Chad. It was actually Nelly's idea. There's still a lot of work to do, and the name serves as a reminder. Aren't these the two moms? Yeah, these are Beck's moms. They're gay. They're lesbians together. Just because progress is important doesn't mean change should happen fast. In fact, I've learned that the more you care about something, the more important it is to take things slow. Good for them. Our motto is go slow and fix things. Amen to that. <laughs> Lesbians. Lesbians, they're so gay. I better not dilly-dally. Gotta get to the treehouse. Okay, okay. I wanted to see the other characters too. Just wanna hug them? Everybody's so cute. Amen to that, brother. Hell yeah, K Kona. <gasps> the other fisk. Luca, get this. I managed to reel in an actual fish this morning. Seriously? Yeah, an honest to goodness, Flip flopping, swim swimming, fish! <gasps> a fisk! Whoa, give me them little beans, hi brother man! Whoa! Tun Tun Tanuki! That's a cute name, thank you for the follow. Welcome, welcome. We're right at like the end of the game. A fish, a fish, an honest to goodness Nemo. I don't think I've ever actually caught it. I don't think I've ever caught an actual fish here. 
been at least seven years since I've caught one. Thank you for the spit beat. <gasps> Tun Tun Tanuki, welcome. <sighs> welcome, welcome. I'd say it's a good omen. Oh no, a stinky Nemo. Put it back, one pog fish. What'd you do with the fish? Oh, I released it back into the pond. Hoping to catch it again tomorrow. <laughs> True! True and based and real and poggers. Bye! Meow. <gasps> A little liar! Yep. Whoa, this is so dangerous! <laughs> little lower! That's not good for a fish. Whoa. Little higher! Is dude gonna catch the same poor fish over and over? Yep. Absolutely deranged construction. I'm telling you! The angle isn't the issue. We need more power to the radio. Whoa. Luca, there you are. Whoa, Lucas, or er, Rolo's still old. What's the rhino's name? I love her. Uh, uh, Tish. Like Trish without the R. Rolo's still dad sized, yeah. Would you tell him it's not the angle? Hey, I'm not in charge of antenna redesign. Fine, fine. Iggy, just. Don't do anything drastic until we get back. Who, me? Don't worry about it. Big Rolo's here to supervise. <laughs> He's such a little goblin. Whoa. Oh, Tish, you in charge while I'm gone. Yep. Tish is my fave. She's so cute. They'll be fine, right? <laughs> It'll be fine. If we really want Mission Control to turn into something bigger and better, we have to loosen our grip a bit. <sighs> You're right. Lead the way. Check it with Beck at her house? Whoa! Let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. Iggy and Tish is you and Fisk? True. Me up in the tree. Okay, be worried. We're, Rolo is no longer there to supervise. Tish has got it. She's got it. Tish has got it handled. All right, let's go, Rolo. Let's go see Beck. <gasps> the Bay Boy. Look how, like, goblin he is. He's so evil, even as a baby. Young Mr. Van Horn. How's little Solomon, er, Sharper doing? Young Sharper seems to enjoy nature more than I. He's so angry. So we do a lot of strolling these days. Less trolling and more strolling, as I say. Fisk, Fisk, look, look, it's a bug. Do you see the bug? Do you like it? And then Fisk goes, yep. Yeah, Zoe boy. Has he, uh, you know... Attempted to crawl out of his crib in plot world domination. Yeah. Thankfully, no. Grumpy baby. <laughs> I spoke with length that with uh, I spoke at length with Dr. Modwill, and she feels that Sharper's infant mind was not developed enough to retain his previous memories. <gasps> Let's go! He got zooted! For all intents and purposes, this child is unmolded clay. Let's hope he's a little nicer the second time around. That is the objective, yes. But really, all I can do is try and hope. Scramble the Bay Boy. Two activities I am endeavor endeavoring to find less distasteful. Well, I think you're doing a great job. And the whole town is ready to help out however we can. I can't wait to teach him how to throw a baseball. Eris did her best to ignore the tears welling in her eyes. Oh, cute! That would be acceptable. It's so fucking cute! Oh my god. I guess it's fine to do a better job with them this time. Yeah. He looked thankful to his, he looked to his friends with a thankful smile. After everything that could have gone wrong, everything that did go wrong, we made it. The end. Closing her eyes, Miss Hatch took a deep, relaxing breath. <sighs> I can't see it through Rolo. Rolo, you're too big. Oh, hello, Luca. How are you? Really good, actually. That's wonderful. Did I miss anything? Nah, nothing. I think you're pretty much up to speed. Cute! That's so cute! What a stupid bit! I love that. I love that! Oh my gosh. Hi! Luca, do you want a biscotti? On the house. I don't really have time. <gasps> Zario, you gotta see this. I finally did it. I pulled the perfect espresso. Ah, Lumi. If I didn't know better, I would think you're proud of something. Pfft, as if. I know. It's too late. 
you're officially now a person that cares. Whoa, cute. Cute, bye. Bye, Nirom. <gasps> I wonder, I don't remember if they ever pronounced that character. Owned. What's today's news that needs knowing? I'll give you tomorrow's headline today. Our old friend, Patrick C. Montesquieu. They care about things, LMAO couldn't be me. That one with the flannel has bunny ears, I, it, I, it, I think it's Ash, true. AKA William Kerr just performed the stirring rendition of the Iceman Cometh at the State Correctional Facility. <laughs> oh no! <laughs> oh no, Rip Bozo. I hear there wasn't a dry eye in the house. Well, I guess he has plenty of time to work on his craft. Damn. Ah, uh, he's in his element, he's fine. The Nightman Cometh, yeah. <gasps> Creature. Wow, back for seconds. That's why we never saw him again, yeah. If it's not too much trouble, for the longest time, I didn't understand the appeal of ice cream. It serves no purpose, other than to be briefly enjoyed and then it's gone. But it's pretty tasty while it lasts. I'm inclined to agree. Cute. <gasps> hey, Luca, can you tell Roxy I'll be free in an hour? Sure thing. My dad's making me stock the shelves for summer. He said it builds character. I think he meant to say it builds calluses. Builds character! Yeah, it builds something all right. <laughs> Mr. Tolliver! Luca, can I interest you in a delicious apple? He playfully waggled an apple. No, give us the candy, old man. No thanks, just saying hello. Well, hello then. Mind telling your mom we need a new crate of jam? Already? That's the lady in disco. <gasps> True! I'm Horm, welcome home, Ash. We haven't actually hit the uh, the apex of the epilogue, so you're just in time. It's funny, I used to hide this stuff at the back. Terrified that someone would find out about our secret messages. A delicious apple kratom, yeah. Now everyone wants to get their hands on Eleanor Van Horn's famous spy jam. Whoa. Yeah, on her famous something, all right. Let's go. Oh, the tent's gone. Oh. Nyeom. We saw a character that reminded us of you. Ooh, ooh. Yeah, look. Look, look, look. Flan whoa, go back up. Flannel creature. See? It's a ash, even though it's a kitty, I think. It's a ash type. Nyeom. Nyeom. <gasps> See that? Spy Jam DVD. <laughs> Spy Kids DVD. Spy Kids DVD. <laughs> Spy Jam DVD. See that? Mm -hmm. I'm glad he's swung by. More follow-up questions for your story. Meet back at the same time, Ash Horm. Welcome, Horm. <gasps> and we get to see the sea bat. Nope, I got everything I need. Thanks again for that. I sent a draft of the story to the reporter in Capital City. And they offered me an internship. Whoa! Pachi, 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 pachi. Sea bat! <gasps> she got an internship! Of course they did. You're an amazing reporter. God, that bat is so cute. She's one of my favorite characters. I don't know all about that. A story about a phony corporation. Cool. Thank you for the biddlies, Ash. Return of Vaughn. Welcome back, Vaughn. It's Puds, yeah. A story about a phony corporation that picked up an entire town of people and moved them to cover up a massive illegal mine shaft full of incredibly hazardous chemicals. And sort of writes itself if you think about it. Just don't forget us when you become a big fancy city reporter. Capital City isn't that far away. I'm gonna have to come back from time to time to check in and see what sort of new trouble you've gotten yourself into. Sorry to disappoint, but my adventuring days are over. Huh, we both know that's not true. What makes you say that? Call it reporter's intuition. Oh, true. Wait, what do they mean? Beacon Pines too? I heckin' love the bat so much. She's so cute. <gasps> diner mommy, diner mommy, diner mommy, diner mommy. Load with a carefree smile. Whoa. Sequel confirmed. Is that your suitcase? <gasps> Is she moving out of town? Oh no. Bark, 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 bark. That. That is two weeks of unencumbered tranquility. Excuse me. Would you be so kind as to take my order? Two weeks of sand, margaritas, and forgotten obligations. Excuse me. I'd love to place an order. Mrs. 
descend like calm. <laughs> Y'all hear something? <laughs> She's ignoring the clipboard. She's going on vacation. Yeah. Y'all hear something? Just as soon as the lunch rush ends, I'll be a feather on the wind. You're going on vacation? Wow, the wind sure is loud today. For the first time in years. And I've got you and your mom to thank. I've changed this character's voice like 12 times. I've got you and your mom to thank. Why is that? She didn't tell you yet? You two are gonna fill in for me at the diner while I'm gone. Rup, bro. Mrs. Fratelli looks like the kind of woman that loves to make the old what's the difference between a man and a margarita joke. Yeah. And you know what? I'm inclined to figure out the answer to that question. The hands-on way. Just like old times. It's fine. I'll wait. <laughs> Silly clipboard. What's the difference between a man and a margarita? I don't know, but I want to find out. Wait, can we go back here? Whoa! Nyom. Nyom. Okay, there's nothing back here. Come on, Rolo. Come on, Rolo. I think the difference is that she likes margarita. It's true. Want to be hands-on with her? Same. Uh, where are we going? Oh, right. We got to go find Beck. The margarita hits the spot every time. True. True. <gasps> what the? What are all those Benoys doing? Oh, they're little babies! Look at the little Benoy babies! Hey, Mr. Nunkreed. I'm gonna go see my dad in a bit. Did you want to come with? Even after everything I did, you'd still... Mr. Nunkreed shook his head. You really are your father's son, aren't you? I don't think I'm ready for that yet. Well, you're always invited. I bet he'd love to hear from you. I'll visit Walt in my own time. You run along now. Slug, please let me see my kids. No! Yeah, all right. Nyom. Whoa. With Perez <gasps> harvest gone, the transportation <laughs> tubes were left unused. <laughs> Jeff turned it into a fucking adventure ride. That's what this is. It's Jeff's wild ride. The ride never ends. Come one, come on. No one is too big, no one is too small for Jeff's wild ride. Maybe not completely unused. That's <laughs> so good. Just one piece of candy. Whoa. Happy 13 months, Luggy. Thank you, Geek. Thank you for the resub. Thank you for the 13 months. Oh my God, literally. It's so good. For the ride of your life. Who's next? Me, 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 me. Your children are going in the tube. This game is so cute. It's so fucking good. <gasps> Jerma! He gets paid in candy. Hey, uh, uh, guess what? Yesterday, I saw Dynasty's Tidious. And that's good? Uh, it's great. Uh, I haven't spotted one of those in years. They're having fun. I'm so proud. 13 mods. Let's go into the tube. Yeet. At this rate, uh, Beacon Pines is going to become the bug capital of the county. The bug capital of the county. Can you imagine? Can you, can, can you believe that? We'll keep out. Can we go back here? God, you're, you, I hate how good your Sherma is. <laughs> Thanks, I practiced. <laughs> Yeet. 13 months into many more. Let's go. I don't think we can go back here. Uh, bug capital of the world. Can you, can, can you believe it? In bug capital of the world. Right here in our own little Beacon Pines. I'm, I'm not fibbing, Luca. Nyom. No chat, I'm not gonna go into the woods and look at bugs. Slug, do you do your most unhinged Sherma? If I uh, uh, put if, if I put you into a meat grinder and the only thing that comes out is your eye and your finger, you're probably dead. Slug, your Germa kind of crosses into Ben Shibibo. Yeah, a little bit. I can't remember, did you put Germa in your demo reel? I didn't. No, Germa's not in my demo reel. <laughs> Germa is not in my demo reel. L slug for America's Next Top Jerma, I would be honored. I have news I think you'll enjoy. This morning I unpacked my last box. That's probably for the best, yeah. You're officially moved in! That's just a box. Hi Henge, this is the epilogue. I'm late that I missed the end. You're you're just in time for the epilogue. We uh we rip Bozo the the sharper into a baby. He turned into a boy boy. We, we, we swapped the Amogus potion for a different... We, we fucking scrambled it. 
and and now he's a boy boy. You'd win a German impression competition against German himself. You think so? No, I missed it. Yeah, hi Kasara. But we're in the epilogue right now, so we're we're talking to everybody. So did we ever go back and see what the op lost option does? Yeah, I don't think you were here for it, but it it turned him into confetti. It's pretty funny. <laughs> Bot time. Yeah, it turned him into fucking confetti. He poofed into confetti, and we yippee. <laughs> we did. He explodes. Yeah. We yippied his ass. We yippied his fucking ass. So we're in the actual canon ending. I mean, I saw the one where he turned into ash. No, the other one, we turned him into actual confetti. He popped. Oh my god, yippee made other form? Yeah, we got a new yippee. We got a new yippee. And look at my eyes, Henge. They're a little sussy. They're a little sussy. Then the whole town laughs. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. He like, he yippied into confetti. He popped and then they all laughed at him. It was pretty funny. Chat, let's say hypothetically. Chat. Uh, let's say hypothetically that you're uh, uh, a little goofy with it, and that would that would mean that you're my little pog champ. Yeah, yeah, my Germa and my Ben Shibibo are pretty much the same. So cute, yippee with the dumpy. Yeah, it's got a little cheek meat back there. Let's not blow this out of proportion. It sounds like an awful lot, like putting down roots. I guess I decided this place is root worthy. You're gonna be stuck with me for the foreseeable future. I do have to warn you, most years aren't going to be as interesting as this one. I think I'll manage. Hey, yo, what that dumpy do? Uh, stare like this. With no thoughts. Shabibo is just fast Jerma. That's, yeah, yeah, that's pretty accurate. Whoa! <laughs> it farts, true. Well, oh, you scared me. Don't Gmod ragdoll me. Thank you for the bidolies. I think I'll manage. Ready? Before we go, there's a little bit of a surprise. Oh, <gasps> a surprise? Ah, sweet silence. What's this? A plant? My mom's, well, my mom's prepared this tree especially for you. They didn't have to do that. It wasn't just them. Just about the whole town pitched in. We all owe you. It should do okay in the cold of old Beacon Pines. <gasps> oh, I'm gonna cry. I'm gonna fucking cry. And thrive as things warm up. That's perfect. When you're ready, take Jeff's wild ride to old Beacon Pines. We get to ride Jeff's wild ride. Oh my god. Yeah, uh, Hench, uh, Jeff. Jeff converted the, uh, the tubes. The phone booth tubes into a fucking wild ride. He turned it into a fucking roller coaster. <laughs> ah, you got it. Ah. Also, yeah, Kasara, he turned it into a, a, a roller coaster. Now we're gonna go ride it. And look at all the baby ashes. Now that's a good looking tree. Being a special occasion and whatnot. <laughs> what? I gotta get back to Worm, have a good time on Jeff's Wild Ride. Bye, Traves. Thank you for the piddlies, Albert. Being a special occasion and whatnot, this ride's on the house. You're gonna wanna hang on tight to that little tree. Yeah, I know, Jeff. We rode this before. Oh. Oh, we went over here. I think this is it. <gasps> Could it be used as public transport? Well, it takes us back to the old time, uh, old, 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 uh, uh, town. The end I've been waiting for. <laughs> Honestly, I began to lose hope of ever finding it. We never gave up. And then you came along. Yeah, it's right. I, I don't know exactly how to thank you. Are we going to find out how the narrator is? The old town? So the old Beacon Pines got snowed over like this because of the source. So when they had everybody leave for a few days... They made a replica, and that's the new Beacon Pines that we've been in. We found that out in one of the timelines. That's why his dad's grave is here. Mm -hmm. It's hard to explain how much this means to me. It's funny, now that our time together is finally ending, I'm at a loss for words. <laughs> that's sweet. Let's just watch the end together. Okay. Done! A good little tree. Best little tree. Thank you, children. This means a lot. Yeah, thanks for everything. Shucks, I only did what any super awesome best buddy would have done. 
We should probably give you some time alone now. You good? Yeah, I, I am. I'm gonna cry. It's been a wild year. How are you feeling? Everyone keeps asking me that. I'm fine, really. Paul always says the only thing fitter than a fiddle is a cello. And I feel like a dang cello. Well, if you ever stop feeling like a cello, I'm here for you. I know, you don't even have to say it. You two make an awesome pair. Excuse me, we're a trio now. That's right. Yep. I... Thanks. Cute. I love cellos. There's just one thing missing now that you're a part of our group. Missing? Let me tell you a little story about a man named Hank Atomic. Oh, God. <laughs> eh, I won't be long. <laughs> we'll be waiting for you back at the phone booth. I found the perfect way to start our summer. The potion made me buff and over six feet. What a burden. Yeah, exactly. You've got some good friends. I'm so proud of you. Your father would be so proud. I know. Mom, can I ask you a question? Do you ever dream about Dad? Not a night goes by that I don't. Are you ever afraid that you're going to forget him? Yeah, they're crying and now I'm gonna cry. Like, I'm, I put myself, I was trying to lean into the crying tears voice and now I'm making myself cry. Forget what he looked like. Forget his voice. No, because so much of him lives on in you. He loved that old tree. But I know that he would love this one even more. Because his two favorite people planted it. I'll give you two a moment. Ugh. Ma. Hey, Dad. Dr. Modwill says that over the next few years, this place should warm up. Here, I can help. Oh. Thank you for this bit being this trench. Amogus? Yeah. Mm. Oh. So you won't have to be so cold for much longer. Oh. I think I finally understand why you left that night. There were things you believed in. Big things. Those beliefs were the things that made you, you. If you wouldn't have stood up to Sharper, stood up for what you believed in, you wouldn't have been the same person anymore. You had to go. But that didn't mean you loved us any less. I might not visit you as much as I used to. I know you understand. Oh, this fucking game. Whoa. <laughs> oh, that got me. <laughs> Fuck, it's the first time I've cried because of a game because it's in Stray. Such a good game. The achievement that popped up, y'all didn't see it. It said close the book. <laughs> I can't believe a Steam achievement made me cry. What the fuck? <sighs> Slug tears your peer, be strong, be strong, Slug. Thanks, Patch. Hi, Patch. <laughs> this is such a good game. I loved it. I loved it a lot. Ash, thank you for gifting it to me. I'm glad we played this. I'm glad we stuck it through. I'm glad it was good. I knew another game that'd make you cry, what? Whoa. Oh, 
It's a short one, too? What? Not allowed, you can't make me cry? Hmm. Too late. Uh, okay, I'll get it in a minute. No, I make it right in at the credits. Hi, Pink Puff. Yeah, you missed it. What's a what's another game? Oh, this was a Kickstarter. Cry, pee pee boy. Yeah. I knew a few games that would make him cry, just not in the good way. Yeah. I wasn't here for a lot, but it was great. I highly recommend going back and uh, uh, watching the uh, the the vods if you want to see it. It was really fun. I liked it a lot. How emotional did I get? I managed to hold it together until the end when we went to go visit. Uh, the actual grave in the old town, uh, old town, that was when it got me. And the Steam achievement was close the book, and we closed the book. Hmm. Bow, 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 bow. I'm gonna watch the VOD later, I recommend it. I had a lot of fun with this game, I loved it a lot. What did you send me? The Beginner's Guide? What the hell is this? Oh, accept gift? Okay. From the Stanley Parable? Oh. Lots of people helped make this happen. It was such a good game. Well, thank you for the gift, Ash. Mm -hmm. I think I've had enough crying for one day, though. What time is it? It's 4 o'clock. Stanley Parable? I guess it's the prequel. You know, I think Sonic 06 would make Slug cry. Yeah, not in a good way, though. Stanley Parable, fun game? I've never played it. But I think Ash sent me the, the, the prequel, I think, to whatever it is. Um, also, Swag, thank you. Uh, welcome. Hi. Thank you for the applause. Thank you. I'm a little scrambled. This game broke my brain. This is a lot of fun. It's not a prequel, just made by the same dev. Oh, true. Let's play Sonic 06 next. No, we gotta play Shadow the Hedgehog. Puddles is gonna play Sonic 06. What do you mean? Puddles is gonna play that. Oh, Moobot, now is not the time. Made me cry hard when I originally played it, and it's hard to make me cry, Slug. Oh. But different things make us cry, right? Like, I get really emotional over stories like this. And stories about change and intent. You know what I mean? That's the type of stuff that makes me cry. Boobot, stop horsing around. God, true. Eat this! Never! Yeah. Do your job, Moobot. True. Madge. I cry at heck and everything. I guess I also do, so that's probably fair. Oh. It's probably going to take us back to the title screen. I think that's it. Get a load of this! <gasps> Whoa. That's it. Yeah. We did everything. Alright, because he's held up better than Sonic 06. Uh, Shadow the Hedgehog is actually the best game from that era. In my opinion. That's it. Whoa. I wonder who the narrator was. We never really did find out. I loved this game. And I highly recommend it. If you, if you, I had a small theory, but I guess not. What, did you think it was maybe the mom? Or maybe Beck in the future? Maybe it was Beck in the future. Or the sea bat? Uh, like an hour and a half long, I think. Oh, well, I'm not going to play it today. But I'll probably play it eventually. Uh, I thought that was the dad. Thought Nat was the dad. Nat was the dad? Nat. Nat. Nat? Which one's Nat? Time for the secret boss, Sans. Uh, I didn't play the after credits bit. True. And Slug is going to prove it's the best game from that era right now. Time for the next game. No. Uh, then why don't you okay all the... All ten endings? No. That's kind of sad. What do you mean that's kind of sad? Why? What? Oh, that shadow? Yeah. The rando in the old city. Nat. Oh! Yeah, we never did find out what their deal was. Huh. Maybe they were just the spirit of old Beacon Pines. I don't know. Well, either way, I gotta eat this sandwich. And I had a lot of fun playing this. So I'm going to close this game. And I'm going to... I'm going to... That Sonic 06 is the best? No, 06 wasn't the best from that era. Shadow was the best from that era. Uh, Slug, Chuck Norris's character is just fucking game is literally just him. That doesn't surprise me. Play Shadow right now? I don't even know it's set up. I don't even think it's on Steam. I think I'd have to set up an emulator to do that. Hold on. 
I'm going to check right now, but wait, Slug, can you bring out multiple Slippy models at once? Oh, uh, I could try. Uh, Shadow. Kristen Mays is the narrator of Bacon Pines. Well, I meant like if they were a character in the game. Uh, Shadow the Hedgehog. Yeah, Shadow's not even on Steam. Love to see them all. Wait. What do you mean? Like another version of this? Load current model is a live 2D item? Tree had a theme of a family tree. Left seemed to be the mom and the right seemed to be the dad. I was guessing, though. Together? What do you mean? Like this? Like, cool. Like that? We are budding. <laughs> we are budding. Ah! <laughs> Hi, Finley. Hi, Finley. We just beat the game. We just beat Beacon Pines. Make them kiss. Okay, hold on. Hold on, hold on, hold on. I'm budding. Hi, Finley. Welcome in. Thank you for the raid. I hope you had a good stream. I love you, funny fish. What were you doing? Why he naked? Whoa, monster hunter. I hope you hunted the monsters really good. Hi, Schlub. Hi, Jack. We beat the funny little visual novel game, and then I cried, um, as I'm known to do. Uh, wait, how do I flip this? Save? I can't flip it. Okay. Okay, sounds about right. I was heavy and got carried. Whoa, you're heavy? You didn't seem like that heavy of a fish. Sounds about right. Wait, hold on. Let me see. Is he in here now? Slippy two. Okay, so now I should be able to do this, actually. So like that, select, and then flip, and then, okay. Weights in the tail? Oh my god, my face like that. <laughs> Whoa, what if we were both yippies? What if we were both yippies? And we... <gasps> And we kissed on the on the slug stream. I ain't gonna overshare, but that hit real close to home. Fucking got me good. Well, I'm I. It hit me really hard too. Being and I loved it a lot. Um, I loved that game a whole lot. Um, sorry, I'm talking to you as two yippies right now. Yowie! <gasps> Hi, Jimmy Cricket. Um, 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 um. Now I don't know what to do with myself. I really don't know what to do with myself. It was such a good game. It really was. Um, um, um. It was really good. Um, um. I guess we could play Pokemon. We could play a little Pokemon. Do you have the older version of Slippy? Uh, we can end early and raid? Well, I'm not going to stream tomorrow, so... I kind of don't want to do that. Watch the video game trailers again? Not a chance. Not a chance. Yeah, here's the old Slippy. Look, there they are. A happy family. This is sometimes a family is just three slippies, you know? Yeah. Did you watch the game awards last night? Nope. Uh, but we did watch, uh, uh, we did watch, uh, uh, the, uh, the, like we watched the roundup of the trailers and most of them were terrible, but thinking about the Jeff Kaylee Amogus mask, the what little slippy and they're two slippies. Yeah. Um, um, I kind of want to play Pokemon. I'm not going to lie. Don't speak to me, my son, or my gay husband ever again. Yeah. Go play Pokemon. Go fuck around, play Pokemon. The Jeff Kaylee, what? It's like that mouse family, but awful, slimy dogs. True. And you gave birth to all of them, Glottal. Yeah. Where's a switch cam? There we go. There we go. AC6 was my highlight. AC6. Oh, Armored Corp? Yeah. Hades 2. Hades 2 and. Um, all three options should be for us to pick in the future, TBH. They're cute. Uh, I mean, you can pick between the current two. I, I like the new one better than the old one, but um, I gave birth to Slug again. Super Giant dared to ask, what if Hades but girl? And I love that for them, true. Um, I like um, I liked, um, 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 Hades, and what was the other one I cared about? There's one other game that I liked. Oh, Space Marine. Gas can, why are you crying? Yeah. Uh, let's see. Where's my switch thing? War ham, yeah. Ham ham. Uh, let's see. Switch. Let me, wait, why is this so quiet? Hello? Why are you so quiet? Uh, ba -ba, ba -ba -ba. there we go. Thank you, Vaughn. Bisexuals have their fun. Now it's time for bisexuals. Exactly. Uh, um, 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 um
Hey, I'm gonna pull this up and eat my sandwich really quick because I'm really hungry. I'm really hungry, but I want to keep going. As a lesbian, I'm thriving. True. True. I wish I could stop. <laughs> yeah. The 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 need to give birth is too great. Let me eat this sandwich real quick. As a bicycle. Yeah. As a bicycle. I don't remember what I was doing. I think I was catching stuff off stream. Can't wait for my girl to kiss other girls. Love that for her. Here, let me one-handed this. Mean making them strong. When you go female main character doesn't mean making them strong. It's about making them strong. True. We were playing Pokemon Scarlet last time. After removing all the bot votes, the winner is Genshin Impact. Huh? What are you talking about? Simply on birth, put it back up there. Yeah. Hi, Connor. Put it back where it came from. What are you talking about? What are you talking about? Was, did, did Jeff say that? Sounds cring. Sounds kind of cring, I'm not going to lie. Oh, I went all the way down here. What the fuck was I doing? Hmm. Baby tiny COVID for a baby dum dums? Oh no. Well, I hope you feel baby tiny better. Sonic versus Genshin. Wait, hold on. Everyone knows Minesweeper 1. Hi, Conky. What is the viewer's choice award or something and it got bot swarmed? Oh. Apparently, the Sonic versus Genshin contest had a lot of bot votes. I see. Steam also gave away a shit ton of their Steam decks because what I didn't know was that Steam is super rich. Well, yeah. Of course they are. We yippee in? Yeah. I'm eating a sandwich real quick. We just beat we just beat Bacon Pan. And now I'm going to play Pokemon for a little bit. Personally, I don't think Genshin should have been in there at all. The thing with me... Is I really don't give a shit about like the game awards and giving giving like 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 doing this like self-imposed celebration of gaming and the arbiters of who do who determine like the best game from the year like it's just like who cares who fucking gives a shit about any of this proven uh, audacious and stupid by the fact that some random little neo-nazi dipshit was able to fucking blow up the whole thing you know what i mean like who fucking cares and people get like really big madge over it. And like, I don't understand why. Like there are bigger things to get around, to get mad about in, 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 in video games. You know what I mean? Than like who won best, whatever. How's Pokemon want to make sandwiches together? I think I'm going to try and go do this new, um, 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 this thing. What do you call it? I'm going to go try and do this. But also, hi, Chris. Um, this is Suicide Walker, the Flash, Batman, which doesn't make sense. Yeah, we watched it. I still love that someone ironically thought COD had an award worthy audio design. Mm, gamer class trader, true. Uh, we just booted up Pokemon, we just beat bacon pans. Then have fun, we'll make sandwich later together. Okay, let's go. Yeah, we'll do that. My game didn't win. That does it. I'm getting out my chair. Audible peeling noises of getting out of the chair. True. So I'm talking with his mouth full and it's an amazing experience. Why? I think it's pretty on brand. <laughs> my sandwich is like room temperature now too. Normally it's cold when I get it out of the fridge. Called, talked about Bill Clinton and neo-Nazi. Well, even though he botched it, his remark was supposed to be anti-Semitic. And he has he was wearing Yeezys. And he's been on InfoWars. So I'm gonna go with yeah. Yeah, I agree. <laughs> yeah, I agree, Gulp. <laughs> I really have become Hassan, huh? <laughs> yeah. It's somehow even more incoherent than usual. <laughs> yeah. The dog whistles were pretty loud. Yeah, I mean, they were, yeah, they were pretty, pretty apparent. Also, hi, Solario. I am. 
Talking while shoving tendies into my face? Yeah. L plus ratio plus easy or fake plus been on InfoWars? Yeah. What's up, mouse hold? It's slouse hold. True. So it's two neurons, but they are split between three models. It's really sad. <laughs> yeah. That's a real problem. Whoa. He caught it in snowstorm. Hold on. Almost done with the sandwich. Elden Ring 1, wait a goddamn way to log Pikachu. Is that three slippies on my screen? Yep, there's three slippies here. Okay, dude. Yeah. I didn't hear what the Sid kid said exactly at the time, but I heard Orthodox Rabbi and Bill Clinton, and I was like, oh, anti-Semitism, neat. Yeah, it, it, yeah. Like, <laughs> I don't think you need a fucking magnifying glass to figure it out. Who's going to a person in the 1930s interrupting a play to spout Nazi stuff? Yeah. I talked about it earlier. That Nebelian was robbed. Mm. Um, that that uh, uh uh what was I saying? Oh, that it's it's on the one hand, I think it's funny that Jeff Cayley's stupid little show got interrupted, and it proved how like how like how charlatan the entire event is that some little random weirdo could come and blow it up. And then on the other hand, it's funny that they, that he got fucking arrested and didn't even get to fucking deliver his stupid Nazi dog whistle. He just kind of flubbed it and made an ass of himself. Which is a net benefit, because every time a fucking fash makes an embarrassment of himself, it embarrasses the entire movement. So, I don't care about any of it, but yeah, Nebelian was robbed. I never really knew enough about Nebelian. What some organization thinks is a good game? Yeah, that, that's kind of what I was getting at. Just glad it wasn't worse than some dumb kid saying stupid shit, because it could have been a lot worse. It could have been a lot worse. Which... That alone is, like, proof that, like, again, like, if they do this again, Jeff Jeff needs to, like, step his shit up. You'd think they have at least some sort of security. Shot and fraud is beautiful. Yeah. All right. Hold on. I'm going to be right back. I got to wash my hands. I think Rod said there's a package outside and I need to grab it. My BTG videos are working for slug. All other BTG videos are fine. It's just slugs? Wait, really? They're there? Hold on, I'll be right back. You might need to reload it. Why are you all knowing? BTD, let me see the funny fanboy slug emotes. What? What is it doing? Did slug trip? No, 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 no. I was just, ah! Because I had to bend over and lift stuff. All right. You can stay. You get in the trash can. Get out of here. All right. Actually, you need to... There we go. Yep, there they are. I reloaded. Let me see if it works. Whoa. Get over here. We heard you trip. I didn't trip. I had to bend over. I had to bend over. You know what? You get in the trash, too. Get out of here. There's only one. Um, let me inflate. Slug on slug violence? True. There can only be one of us. No? Yeah. Bend over and spread it? Yeah. Spread them. We put you in the trash, too? No, I survived. <laughs> I survived. You can't get rid of me. Slug bent over? Yeah, look. Look at my cake in this fucking weird dog form. Slug is so desperate for steppies, he's trying to step on himself. True. It's sad, really. It's sad, really. Okay, there we go. Now you can see me be wiggly. Okay, let's play some Pokemon. Uh, we baconed the pan and trailered the games. The, oh my god, I can't type. Trailered the games. So now we poke them on. 
And let me update this. Tihi Pokemon. Pokemon Scarlet and Violet. There we go. I hear a wah symbols crashing, spring recoiling, rocket blasting off, rope comically unwinding, then yanking slug out. Various traffic collision and then silence. True. So how far are you into the story now? Not very, which is why I kind of want to focus on the story. For just a 25 cent donation, you can give steppies to a needy child for a month. Yeah, it's me. I'm the needy child. Uh, where's my switch controller? He's like two gyms in. Yeah, I did like two gyms and then two of them. Two of the the little the little the little Titan boys, whatever they're called. All right, let's go. Uh, let's see. Oh, I'll show you all the Pokemon's I caught. In fashion is the modern age, meant to be in fashion makes them look bad. Can't wait till Twitter rightoids and he was at like he wasn't trying to say dog whistles. Uh, I don't know about that. I think we're at a time where people like are just straight up leaning into the fascism and and, and finding value in it. Um, uh, it's a which is why it's such a problematic recruitment tool to just oh, it's all free speech. But um, anyway, um. Wait, is that Pikachu named Bastard? <laughs> yeah, he's a Bastard type. Uh, let's see. What did I catch? What did I catch while I was off stream? I caught a couple things. We caught Foreskin Balloon. Whoa. Love that, lol. Yeah, I, I can't believe it let me get away with it to be TBH. Um, hat creature. You caught what? What? What did I say? Have you found any shinies yet? I haven't. Catch this. Oh, this thing. Yeah. Foreskin balloon. Uh, here. Thrusting. Yeah. Look. Foreskin balloon. He inflates big and round. Thrusting. What? I mean, look at him. Uh. <gasps> okay, here we go. I hate. <laughs> I caught a hig. I caught a hig. Um, rip NL. NL. Oh, I caught Rage Haver. I caught Fanfi. Tell Chris about the pig. I mean, what's there to say? I caught Toe Haver because they're fucking. If you want to see Slugs Force Kid Balloon type Docky in chat, true. Do I really want to know? Oh, hold on. I'll go look at the pig in a second. I caught Dong. There's Dong. I caught Charcucci. Uh, I was pretty proud of this name. I actually forgot what I named it. No one should know about the pig. There's Charcucci. Um, I caught another Sporb because we don't have a Sporb anymore. <laughs> I forgot I named it. I was like, I caught a Pachirisu. What did I name it? <laughs> Snuffy, no! <laughs> Snuffy, no! <laughs> Leave him alone. Leave him alone! They have a pre-evolution? The weirdos? Yeah. The little, the little dudes. Yeah. Snuffy, no! I caught an Aura Haver. I caught a Riolu. Uh, I caught a Skousk. I caught the Mean Fisk. Skousk. I caught me. That me smile. It's me. I'm the Goomer. That's me. Uh, I caught a Hat Creature. The little, the little thing. <laughs> I named this... The Law 34 disc. Why does that dog have an anime greaser face? Yeah. I caught I got the Law 34 disc. Love disc. What is that? Love disc has been around since like Gen 3. It's a pretty shitty Pokemon. Uh I named this tender inside because that's what the description in its Pokedex entry said. I wanna hunt for a shiny Goomy so I can name it Pudding. Oh <gasps> Giga Pooty. Uh Scythe Haver. Bug Burner. Because his, his, his Pokedex entry talked about how he, he he burns bugs. This one talked about how it takes showers. Cool. Shower taker. Uh, and I caught another Fido. I forgot to name it something, though. Uh, I caught Seg's Lizard. Because that's what this thing does. Seg's Lizard. Uh, grass Eater. Dirt Eater. Cool. Uh, oh, there were more in here. Okay, check summary. Yoga doer, pattern haver. It fucks for real, for real. Oh, I got Dink Smasher too. I got one of the little the Tinkaton pre-evos. I didn't know it had a pre-evo. 
It's got Akko's stupid haircut, which I thought was cute. Group haver? I don't know why I named it that. I think it was something about like they stick together in groups or something. Wool haver? I cut another sheepy. <laughs> it's like, wait, why did I name it this? I caught a female Pikachu and named it Fem Bastard. Dink Smasher, I love Akko. Me too. Akko's one of my favorite characters. Little Witch is my favorite uh, trigger anime. So we got Fem Bastard. Uh, I got another Ball Haver for 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 you know for good measure. Balloon Cat. Oh, this is a flying type terrestrialization Pikachu. So I got Balloon Cat. Uh, Zoomies, because this thing was fucking running around. So I named it Zoomies. Blue Ball Mouse, the CBT Mouse. That Zangussi, what that Zangussi do? All of the main three are best girls. Why do we have a Vore episode though? Oh, Little Witch. <laughs> it's like, wait, what are we talking about? Did we finish baking game? We did. We beat it. It was really good, Hig. Rear sprayer, because it says something about um 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 spraying at its rear. You called the me out the Pikachu? Did I? Balloon cat. Did I? Who need there's a gussy eight? Zoomies, rear sprayer. Oh, and Yang, yeah, I did? Oh, my brain scrambled. Listen, be nice to me. Don't be mean to me. Um, hey, look. Hey, look. It you. It you, balloon cat. It you, Hig. Look, creature. Little, little buppy. It you. I got a spippy. And a stramsh. Absolutely not. It Hig. Mm, like creature. All right. Uh. Anyway, what were we doing? What was I doing? I don't remember. Dog. Dog. What was I doing? Tobs was on screen moments ago. Skunk. Oh, true. You can get a Galarian Meowth by becoming friends with the foreign languages teacher at school. Oh, interesting. Have fun. Thank you. You played off stream. How would we know? Well, no, I know, but like I in, in, I indicated what my plan was on screen to do now, and I forgot. I feel like I'm forgetting to do something, but okay. Well, whatever. Uh. Off we go, I suppose. Nyom. Uh, let's go. Nyom. Did you see the story? All I know? Yeah, good. Yeah, good. Easy Slug's personal FBI agent told us? Yeah, I don't I don't remember. I don't remember what I was doing or what I was talking about. But anyway. Nyom. Oh my god, dude. Get the fuck out of here. Bugoid. Get out of here. Go away. Go away. Be gone. All right, dude. Oh my God. <laughs> it's like, it's like walking through a field and stepping on every rake. It's like a sideshow Bob bit. All right, get away from me. Don't talk to me anymore, okay? Slug lock, yeah, real slug lock moments. If I win, get his ass. Whoa. Oh, it's a, it's a, it's a country western singer. If I win, you gotta buy my CD. Okay. Oh, challenged by Maria the musician because there's a donkey. Get his ass. True. Whoa. So I'm walking the tall grass. Why do I keep encountering Pokemon? Listen, I was stuck over there. What did you want me to do? Uh, Volt Switch. I'm way over leveled for everything over here too. Volt Switch. Will this kill you? Yeah. I love all the big ladies in the chat. Me too. They're really cute. Okay. Well, now I don't have to buy your CD. <laughs> what? No one buys CDs anymore? Yeah. Millennials destroyed the CD industry. Sorry. Sorry, buddy. I guess that's why I can't sell my CDs. Everybody has some kind of subscription service. Except Nintendo, because they can't figure it out. Because they're too dumb to put their music on Spotify. True. True. It's weird that she said all that in a Nintendo game, but it's true. It's true. The left doesn't want you to know this, but it's true. Hello? Yo, Slorb! So, from what I gather, it seems like the open sky titan lives somewhere up on this mountain. But there are all these crazy boulders raining down from the mountain, too. I'm still, like, stuck in, in Luca voice more than Trunk's voice. It's going to be a bit... It's a little bit tricky to stand back around and look for the Titan while dodging all those. 
I think you'll be sent flying if you get hit by a falling boulder. But maybe you could power your way through atop that brute of yours. Okay. Okay. Nyom. 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 Whoa. Hello. What the? What the? Where are we? Where are we? Oh, come here. Oh, yeah, everyone in this game is Trunks and Vegeta and Goku. Yeah. If I can't even get close. I want to get to the peak, but I can't even get close. Damn, skill issue. Challenged by Enrique the student. All right. Poggers. A pine cone. Isn't this a ground type? A pine cone. You're a ground type, aren't you? Protect. Ground normal, maybe? I can't remember. Use Volt Switch. Oh. Posing Pineco protected itself. Oh, maybe it's a rock type. The hell that didn't. Oh, you fucking piece of shit. Play rough. I, I thought it would at least let me do the Volt Switch, even though it hit the protect. Yeah, get paralyzed, idiot. Get paralyzed, dumbass. Pineco's paralyzed. Let's see. Uh, play rough. Yeah, get fucked on, dork. Oh my god, stop using protect. If you do the cookie by the book, then you'll have a cake? True. That's true. This is true. A lot of people are saying this. Whoa. Okay, can you please die? Thank you. Bow, down, 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 down. You got another one? Oh, look at that choodle. Enrique the student is about to send in Nimble. Why did the game have to think that hard about it? That's uh, pretty cool. Pretty cool that it had to think that hard. Phantom, Phantom Choodle. Go, Crepes! Obliterate them! Puppy. Puppy. Whoa. Nyom. Whoa. And Flame Wheel. Nyom. Scrambulated. I'm gonna get him, boss. Did you evolve a room? No, I put him in the box and I haven't looked at him since. I have not. Bump, bump, ba -dump, bump, ba -dump. I did like Varum though. You're even wilder than rolling boulders. What is that over there? I see something in the water. What are you? What are you? What was down here? I know what you are. Everstone? So like, why is the slippy so dang adorable? What do you mean? It's so cute. Because Gwile did a good job with it. Oh, it's a Psyduck. Hi. Okay. Um, Gumi! Gumi! Bark, 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 bark. Enjoy picnicking. Bridge troll. Nothing goes with a sandwich like a nice view. <laughs> Glad to have run into you, kiddo. Here's a gift to make sure you savor the taste of adventure. <gasps> Prosciutto? Hey, where's all the, uh, gabagool? Eating a sandwich gets you and getting pumped up with meal powers makes journeying all the better. <laughs> Care to rest those traveling feet and stop for a while since you're here? Yeah, okay. Rooms of Evolution should be in Pixar movie? Oh, yeah. Hello, Schlug. Hi, Rat in your Cage. So I don't think that's the best way to eat? Yeah, next to a bunch of falling boulders. Wait. Do they just phase out? Oh, well, good thing they phase out of existence before they get too far. I think it'll be okay. Working hard is key, but so is getting off your feet now and then. How do you get off your feet? Oh, get it. Oh, okay, never mind. Besides, you can't enjoy the scenery when you're always on the move. Ha 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 ha! Okay. Please do not get off your feet, sir. Don't do that. I will not be doing that. Bonka, bonka, bonka. Yeah, that's fair. That one's on me. Alright, so... What's the... Remove feet. What's the plan here? What is that up there? What in the world? Nyom. 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 This feels like a Sonic Adventure stage. Nyom. Whoa. Or worse, a Mario 64 stage? I'm gonna rig you that mouth just so you could talk about feet stuff? That's fair. Simply don't get hit. What the fuck are you? Whoa, what? What? What was that? The combination of that noise and- oh, 
What? Bombardier, the open sky titan. Why does it keep its flesh in its mouth? You have to give him a weapon? Now he chooses to use it, it's up to him? What? Dude, I hate that. I fucking hate that. I fucking hate that. Are you, You're a flying type probably, right? I hate that. Why does he have like a weird flesh chest thing? It's supposed to be so like, like cloth to carry babies? Oh, like a stork? Yeah, but it's like part of him. Yeah. Let me get my discharge all over you. So are the Titans Pokemon or just weird freaks of nature that exist for some ungodly reason? I don't know, actually. It's weird. Yeah, I don't I don't care for it. I do not like the flesh sack. <laughs> oh god. Highest grossing uh, franchise on the pla on the planet. Incredible. Triple A gaming. Unlike Slug, it has pants. True. I'm not. I'm. A, I'm just explaining, not excusing. That's fair. Slorb, you managed to get to the Titan somehow, huh? How did you get up here, Arvin? So that's the Open Sky Titan. Wait, is this Titan what's been dropping all those boulders? I was lucky enough to be able to sneak up here because it had all its attention on you, little buddy. Oh, cute. I like when he calls this little buddy. Looks like it's trying to power itself up. Like with some kind of mystical meal power or something. Oh, so you better get ready to go all out. Okay. Bow, 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 bow. Yeah. Looks like he's on a track. And he's going to kind of come back to here where he already was. Whoa. I love Arvin. Me too. Why does Arvin call you baby girl? We should stop talking. Yeah. Maybe we should stop talking for now. Yeah. Why does <laughs> why does Arvin call you baby girl? Trying to drop rocks on folks is dangerous. Let's give this thing a good taste of defeat. Yep. He's coming. Hi, Paul. Did the burp get bigger? It enhanced its girth, I think. To some degree. But it's no match for my discharge, so it's fine. It'll be okay. We'll be okay. Bastard type use discharge. You fucking own dipshit. Nice shades, Luke. Thanks to the Joe Byron glasses. Why, 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 why? Is that a new Yippee? Yeah, Glado made it. <gasps> Hi, Gobbler. Hi, Gobbler. Listen, it would definitely be weird if Arvin called me baby girl, but it would also be very gender affirming. Mm -hmm. Mixed feelings. Titan gets one shot, yeah, by a fucking yellow rat. Whoa. That's the power of friendships, baby. Trimple as. Oh. That's what you get for clipping through the wall. Wait, you don't capture it? Nope. I wonder where that discharge is from. True. Yes, way to go, Slorb! Rat greater than a Pokemon god. Yeah, you don't even get to capture the Titans, which is kind of like, eh, okay. Power of friendship and incredible violence. Looks like we don't have to worry about any more boulders falling on us now, huh? Not even if you want? Nope. Because I wanted the big worm or the big crab, and yeah, they're just bosses. They're like Dark Souls bosses, I guess. Usually literally has the power of God and anime on their side. Um, 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 um. Yeah, true. Okay, bye. Oh, okay. Yeah, they're just bosses. You just fight them. But then I think they usually show up the, uh, like, Pokemon that they're a bigger version of. This is the first time I've seen you in your La Creatura mode, and I love it. It's brand new. It's it's a it's a it's a improved version of my all yippee that claw made for me. It's very cute. Also, I love that it can match <laughs> like in a serious mode. But I like it a lot. I love this form a lot. Um um and also when I'm not talking, which is rare. No thoughts. Head empty. I think it looks very cute. <laughs> this is serious. Serious angry haunts. Yeah, it's serious. There has to be more of that herba mystica to aid in there. Let's hurry and find it before the Titan come back for us. Come back for another go at us. Oh, okay. Okay. Right, I forgot. We got the reveal that Arvin's dog is sicky. So cute, so puntable. True. I'm sure there's some here, too. Can we end the stream with just a few minutes of silence? No! I couldn't, I couldn't keep myself from talking. 
for more than like a few seconds. <laughs> yeah, I mean, the Titans are just regular Pokemon who ate the Herb and Mystica. You find regular Pokemon in the same type around. Yeah, but I don't think you find them until after you beat the Titan. I think that, because that's how I think it was for the worm. For the, the who up playing with the worm. Like, do you like Kronk? Like, in a general sense? Yeah, I think he's cute. He's a good himbo. We're well aware, Slug. Yeah. He's a good himbo. I love a good himbo. I love a good himbo. As a Hasanabi enjoyer, one, uh, this might not surprise you. Aha! Arvin even has a little bit of himbo energy. A little bit. Just a little teeny bit. More of a twunk, though. Oh. I knew it. I spy Herba Mystica. And voice, too? Uh, oh, the, the, the Patrick Warburton voice? Uh, uh, I knew it. I spy Herba Mystica. Yeah, I could, I could do a little bit of Kronk's voice. Not, not super well, but I could do it a little bit. The Titan ate all the other Pokemon of its type, like Kronos. When you beat them, they're released. <gasps> True. Nice. Yeah, I could do a little bit of a Kronk voice. Not, not super well, but. Hi, Peter. Sorry, I'm Light Swag. I got distracted by Sports Ball. <gasps> Hi, Steph. It's pretty good. Thank you. Hi, Steph. We beat Bacon Pans. Now I'm playing Pokemon. We beat Bacon Pans. It was very sweet. I really liked the ending. I really liked the ending. It made me cry. If you want to see a slonky cry, you can go back and watch the VOD. You look especially cute today. What a heck. <gasps> Glotto made me even cuter today. Hi, Peter. Yeah. Who won? Oh, sports ball? Oh. I knew it. I spy Herba Mystica. Any Scarlet Havers in chat want to exchange exclusives? Oh. <gasps> Kasara, I'll exchange exclusives with you. Unless somebody in chat beats me to it. But I'll do it if you want. I'll whisper so I don't spoil chat. Mm -hmm. Damn, I missed the ending, Sag. Go back and watch the VOD. It's very worth it. I loved it a lot. I'm glad so many people like it. You did an amazing job, Claudel. It's super cute. Um, 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 um. Cool. Bum, ba -da -dum, ba -da -dum. Cool. Another successful search. We're on a roll. Now let's see. What does the book have to say? Exclusive havers, true. Whoa. I'll wait till you're a little farther, Schlug. Okay. Um, um, but if you get to it before that, that's fine. If you find somebody to trade with you before, but if not, I'll trade with you, whatever you're looking for. Bitter Herba Mystic is great for your circulation. Really gets your blood flowing. That warms you right up. Nice and toasty, even boosting the immune system. Or so it says. Whoa. Whoa. This will definitely help mess Mabasta feel even better. Yeah, it'll make his his bones and his uh, organs feel better. Come on, Slorb. Let's get some food going. Feed the doggy. Feed the doggy. Feed the doggy. Oh. Yeah. Ha! Ha! Sorry to keep you waiting. Here you go. Another of your favorite old Arvin sandwiches. And it comes with a special Titan badge. The Pokemon League might not recognize it, but I hope you appreciate it all the same. I treasure it more than any Pokemon League badge, Arvin. You are the highlight of this game and the highlight of my life. Genshin Impact player is true. The highlight of this game and my life. Oh, sandwich. Bow, 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 bow. Oh, wow. Whoa. Oh. Whoa. Oh. Figured this might happen. Don't worry, I made extra this time for that brood of yours. Yummy badge. Give him sandwich. <laughs> Sniffa. Do you want to give your sandwich to Koridon? Whoa, oh, this is mine. <laughs> We feed Arvin's dog and then we feed our weird dog. Aww. Maybe you want to give it to Koridon after all? Fine. I'll share. Arvin is such a little hater. I love him. I love him. Come on out, Mabostiff. Got some for you too, bud. Cool. Be right back. Okay. Doggy. If Arvin's badges aren't recognized by the local government organization, does that make them an anarchy symbol? <gasps> Whoops, my Arvinarchy symbol. Whoa. <gasps> How he eat the Sam niche. Yummy. Whoa. That's it. Small bites. Small bites. God, Arvin, you're so fucking cute. 
<laughs> Meanwhile, our weird fucking dog <laughs> inhales it whole. <laughs> the team star badges are pretty literally that. Yeah. Whoops, my anarchy symbol. Coridon will be able to move across the water? Oh. Come on, at least bother to taste it before you swallow it right down, would you? Arvin Underground Antifa badges base true. Yeah. The, uh, the Antifa uh, Pokemon League. We got our horrible menace haunts. Just like me. Um, um, I support Arvinarchy, yeah. <laughs> Surf dog obtained. Oh. This brute seems to be befitting from from the cool. This brute seems to be benefiting from the herbs too. I guess. In its own sort of way. Oh. Oh yeah. For I forget, Slorb. That's cute. For I forget. For I forget. I like when they put slang in. If the Pokemon League is a hierarchy of power, then Team Star is Antifa? True. Well, then when we make that, what would Arvin be then? Before I forget, Slorb, take another look at this. There's always a Titan Pokemon near the Herba Mystica when we find him, right? Gay? True. B b real and true. <laughs> the Gay League. Okay, but like a Pokemon game where the current League champs are villains and kick ass? For real. I would love that. Like the book says, it's not like big old Pokemon just happen to like these herbs. It's actually something in the herbs that's making the Titans so big and strong. It inflates them big and round, Slorb. Do you think I can inflate you big and round, Slorb? So, the, so does that mean the Titan's lair isn't really some kind of treasure hoard or whatever? It's just a pantry where the Titan keeps its food? Slug, what? <laughs> Gay point. Will this upend the establishment, Nintendo? Yeah. Doggy. Oh, you done with your miss your sandwich, Mabostiff? Pokemon drugs. Oh, puppy. Grr. I bestow upon Slug the gray gay badge. Oh, I, I cherish it with honor. Grr. Rough. But Dr. Nintendo is the establishment. True. Wiggly. Wiggly. You, you heard that, right, Slorb? Mabostiff just woofed, right? Yepers. Pokemon drugs and Pokemon tax evasion. Right, I'm not just imagining things. <gasps> he get better. <laughs> See? See that? I knew it wasn't just hearing things. He borfed. Oh, Mabostiff. Who's my best bud, huh? Who's the best of boys? You are. Yes, you are. Cute. <laughs> It's been so long since I heard that wolf. Cute. I love you, Arvin. I thought Arvin was going to be a fuckboy, but then I realized he just loved his doggy. I hated him in our introductory scene, and now I'm like, you're the only thing I like about this game, mister. Uh, you're, you're my reason to finish it. I wonder what Pokemon taxes go to? Healthcare. For Pokemon centers. All dog owners in a nutshell? For real. Mabostiff is definitely getting better. Ever since I teamed up with you, good things keep happening. Well, we still got two more herbs to go. Hope you'll stick it out until we're done. Grrr. Morph. Dog-to-dog <gasps> -dog communication. They are communicating. I've only seen Armin a couple times, and I want his himbo sandwiches. Mm. Hello, Slorb. This is Sada. Dog-to-motorcycle communication. Mommy, I detect the Coridon has regained more of its original power. What the dog doing? Well, riding upon it, it seems you should now be able to move across water. Whoa. If you press the B while you're on the water, Coridon can even jump. Whoa. Please continue to take good care of Coridon. When do I get to smell you? When? When will that be my right? I'm glad Slug found a dog he doesn't hate on an instinctual level. <gasps> True, I didn't even think about that. It doesn't... You're right. Probably because it's so weak that hurting it wouldn't be a challenge at this point. So. And also because it's... 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 It's it's Arvin's and I wouldn't want to hurt his feelings. You know what I mean? Let me save. Nyrm slug? What? <laughs> what? What did I do? <laughs> what? Why are you yelling at me? Um... Where are we going? Okay, we did that. Have we been here? Alright, let's go here. Why is that fisk violence? I didn't do anything. 
This is terrifying, actually. Whoa! <laughs> you were scheming? Scheming and plotting. Because that's what you do, you slugs. Fighting types are best! I bet this is a fucking fake out, but we'll see about that, mister. Actually, I don't think I have anything that can stop a fighting type. I don't have any, I don't have any psychic powers. I don't have any fucking... Oh, shit. I don't have any flying types? Wait, is Fairy strong against fighting for real? Is that true? Real and true? All right, let's bring in the Fisca flower. Really? Oh, I had no idea. Oh, black belts just have to choose fighting type Pokemon. I mean, I guess if you're assigned black belt at birth, John the black belt. What you could always like, uh, ah, oh, you fuck. Just beat the shit out of it. Yeah. Hit it in the, oh. A bab, a bab -ba -ba? all black assigned back ba 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 ba. <laughs> I was like, wait, all 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 babs are babsters, but yeah, assigned black belt at birth. Ba -ba 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 -ba. And the best part is fist clips through the floor. Look at her. Now that was a tough fight. Yeah. Look how rough it was on my dog. Assigned black belt at birth, like that one translating in Pokemon Black and White. True. Wait, I think that was Sun and Moon, actually. All bastards are babies, true. Abba, babba, 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 babby. This game is definitely finished, very much so. I love to see a finished game. This is a finished game, and I love to see it. Alright, we're on our way to the Pokemon Center. Ah! He popped in and scared me. <laughs> he popped in and scared me. Die! <laughs> Shoutouts to Fist Clips, yeah. Die! Get out of my way. Fucking asshole. So, is the Pokemon world moral? Oh, uh, probably not, but... Us carrying a coin. But there's just a bunch of funny little guys. This is a good camera angle. This is a good camera angle. I'm trying to find a little parent Pokemon carrying a coin. Well, if I could see through the floor, I would help you. Challenged by Yasmin, the student. Oh. Teddy Ursa. Pokemon is not moral, but free healthcare is a good start. Yeah. Grass. <laughs> Grass. <laughs> uh, what? You're normal type, right? Well, it's, uh, 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 it's, it's like I'm really a tiny Pokemon, true. Is that your only Pokemon, or are we... You got another one. What are you gonna put out? Bow, bow, now, now, bow, now. Bring in the worm. Bring in the worm. Whoa. Now they are fainted type. Tink-a-tink? Fa fairy, right? Fairy type, which is weak to... Poison and... What else is it weak to? Bug? Maybe? Fuck, I don't know. Not dark. Ground? No. Steel, right? Steel? Or no, it's strong against steel. Poison, fire, steel. Use your fire type? Fire strong against fairy. Steel is strong against it because of iron and fairies, that's right. What throat goat can stand up against Singlizzy? Exactly. Well, we'll bring in Kripes. Because I want Kripes to learn Flamethrower so I can fucking evolve him. Uh, yeah, it's wild to me that this thing is... That fairies are weak to fire. Like, I, I feel like I never knew that. Fire is not strong against fairy, it is neutral. But steel is weak to fire and it's fairy steel. Oh! I didn't realize it was fairy steel. That makes sense. Because it's got a hammer. I'm trying so hard, but I can't find it. I just stare into tall grass. Girl, same. You okay, kid? That will point coin Pokemon runs away fast. You can't catch it. But it drops a coin if you find it. Okay. That's crazy, Dio. I didn't ask, but thanks for sharing. Not fire, huh? I'm full of for gore. Mm -hmm. Swablu's. What's up, bitches? Hi, Retro. Oh, it's your boy, Skinny Penis. What's up? 
Retro Swarma. Hi. Whoa. Items. Okay. You arrived at your destination. Yeah, it's an easy one to mix up because fire resists fairy, but because but doesn't deal extra damage to fairy. Oh. Heal my Pokemons. Whoa, thank you for the strength. This model is so cute when it stretches. And a spippy. Whoa. Bow. Fairy resists bug, but doesn't do extra damage to bug. Oh. Bow, no, 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 no. Okay, bye. Uh, save. Glottal did a great job on it. For real, for real. Did you know I like fairy types? I do too. They're my favorite type, which is probably why I should know more about them. Okay, we hit our destination, so now where are we going? What's this? The star badge, dark. Uh, trans and gay, true. The greaterer, craterer of Paldalia. There it is. Um, hmm. We're here. We're here. I guess we could go do... Any fairy was so weird, though Dragon did have barely any weaknesses. I love fairy type. Whoa, what happened? Who's that? Who's that? Buster, did you scare yourself? <gasps> Hi, Prim! Um, 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 the, um, b -b I love fairy type, me too. Fairy's one of my favorite types. Um, let's see. Well, I guess we could go to the desert, or we could, you know what, we're close to the desert. Let's go to the desert. Uh, the quaking earth titan. Yeah, we'll go to the, we'll go to the, hi, Ross words. We'll, we'll go to the, we'll go to the fairy and ghost. Yeah, yeah, we'll go here. Set as destination. All right, let's go. Wait, can we get over this? Is that a new mole? I'll come back for you later. I don't have time to waste with you. This is a perfect thematic fit for Pokemon and it feels mechanical niche pretty well. Yeah, I agree. Uh, good. <laughs> I like water type, me too. Old Dragon being weak to Dragon was a really interesting fight. Mm -mm. Well, it still is. Whoa. There are... There are four skin creatures here. I like water type too. Water is one of my favorite types. Ah! I don't want, I don't want no trouble. Leave me alone. I don't want no trouble. Nyrom. What is that? Fairy, ghost, and grass are my top three favy types. Whoa. Uncut snake? Yeah, they have four skin. What is that? That's a big dog. I like dark type and not because lol edgy. I like dark type because of, I was a gen two Andy. One of my favorite slow poke. Mm -hmm. Hey, Slorp. Apparently this desert is home to the quaking earth titan. Speaking of which, the ground's been shaking off and on, and uh, it's making me feel a bit sick. Sorry, I'm just gonna sit down and rest a little before I get back to Titan hunting. Okay. Probably dragon fire. I like fire types too. Whoa, worm. Worm. God, what even is foreskin? It's like an evolutionary leftovers from a sheath. Yeah. Uh, uh, I still have 12 years old. I like fire, dragon, and dark types, and hasn't changed since. Slowpoke is the best, TBH. I will kick myself for not getting the life-size plush of the Pokemon Center. Oh. Um, um, um. I like a lot of Pokemon that happen to be dark. Yeah. Weevil is my friend and Dragon Killer before Fairy was a thing. True. Oh, what the hell are you? What the? What is that? Huh. Okay. Oh, Dawn fans are here, too. Oh, I really want to substitute Pokemon plushie. They're really cute. I like the Poke Dolls. The joy of youth. What the? What is youth, though? Do you have an answer? Uh, I love Sneasel Weevil, one of my faves. Mm -hmm. Look at that. Oh, he's swimming. I don't know if he's supposed to be swimming in the sand or if he's just clipping through the floor. But either way, he's having the time of his life. And I'm happy for him. Uh, What typing is this thing? Brown? 
Na -na 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 Sneasel Weevil is one of my favorite types. Or one of my faves? Yeah, mine too. I love Sneasel and Weevil. I wish I or wait, no, I was thinking of Mawile. But I love Sneasel and Weevil too. I wish Mawile was able to keep their mega as an actual evolution. Mawile is probably my favorite. I like Hisui Sneasel. Me too. Edgy Cat. Uh um um um. Bori Coco? Uh okay. Bori Coco is flying type, right? <gasps> You're a different Oricoco. Uh, Discharge. A Pokemon Emerald and that was legendary was cool as fuck? Oh. Look at him, he swim. Bow now, bow now, bow now, now. You defeated Bell and the Student. Okay. Owned. Ah, the folly of youth. Stop being melodramatic and melancholy. Hello? Maybe you only really understand your youth when you look back on it as an adult. Look, he swim. Whoa, cute. Wait, what's that? What are you? Oh, it's a hippopotamus. Whoa, Dreepy is a good one. Ghost Star can steal on my faves. Mm -hmm. Whoa, they swim. I like the music here. What are you? What the hell is that? What the hell is this? <laughs> what are you, Relor? <laughs> what is this? <laughs> Beam toll? <laughs> Hanky dung beetle? <laughs> is this new? I don't I don't know this thing. Dung beetle? I've never seen this one before. Is this new or is this uh a sword and shield one? Loathsome dung roller. <laughs> yeah? <sighs> oh, I like him. It's new because I don't know it. I forgot about him. It's new. He's cute. Come here. I want to catch you. Loathsome little man. Whoa. What the? What the? And its name is Roller spelled backwards? Oh, it is. Relor. <laughs> Stop. Poop Haber. Yeah, I'll probably name him Poop Haber. All right, come here. Uh, we're going to hit you with the Great Ball. Down B. Get in the ball, nerd. Poop thrower. The real ball haver. The real ball haver. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Ba -na 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 -na. Arbok muck moment. True. Welcome to the squad, squad Relor. This Pokemon creates a mud ball by mixing sand and dirt with psychic energy. Yeah, man, me too. Uh, it treasures its mud ball more than its own life. Yeah, dude. <laughs> Same. Welcome to the squad. Uh, yeah, mud. Yeah, mud. Yeah, it's mud. I like that it sprinkles mud. Uh, <laughs> wait. <laughs> Actually, it gives me a good idea. Uh, let's see. Hold on. We're going to do that and then do this. Crypto Burrow, but Pokemon? Yeah. Mud. Uh, oh. No! Mud. This mud tastes like poop, though. Are you sure it's mud? Yeah, this tastes suspiciously... Suspiciously like poop. I'm, I'm not gonna lie. I'm, not, I'm gonna be real with you, little man. This, this, this is poop if I've ever tasted it. Mud. Haver. There we go. Perfect. It's shiny version, just makes the ball golden, golden turd. All right, go to the box. I like that it sprinkles in his little ball. Hands you a bag, it's fudge, yeah. <laughs> Kindness, take part. Ha have you ever tasted it? No. No. No shot, yeah. How much would you, how would you know? Much, how much do you know about the taste of poop? Yeah, it's circular logic. In order to know it tastes like poop, You'd have to have eaten poop. Um, 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 where are we going? A star piece. A star pee. Whoa. No? Yeah. Man, they weren't lying. It fucking whimdy. I can't fucking see where I'm going. And I don't want to run into these little weirdos. I can't see where I'm go. Person who has never heard of hyperbole. Yeah, true. True. Dog. That's that's the biggest dog I ever done saw. Wait, was that a Volcarona? Well, it's gone now, wherever it went. Why is the so shiny gold poo? Why not solid pee? 
A kidney stone, even. True. Dog. He's like a monster hunter monster. What's that big boy? I don't know. It's like a, a big Don fan. Soggy egg. If he's anything like Don fan, he's probably a grounded rock type. Hi. Hi. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, good. Yeah, good. <laughs> love, love it. No notes. <laughs> no, no notes. It is a Don fan. Hello, Slorb. This is Professor Sada. Great Tusk is a Pokemon that came from the greater crater of Paldalia. I ask that you do whatever is needed to subdue it for me. With all due caution, of course. Okay. Y'all get to see the version of Don Fan. It's cool and it's not in Violet. Get that version of Don... Uh, oh, like y'all don't get this one? Really? Uh, Terrestrialize! And then hit him with the Aqua Tail! Joe Biden. Wake up. Joe Don Fan. Yeah, they get Robo Don Fan? Oh, yeah, I remember Robo Don Fan. It's not as cool as ours. I like this one. He's, I think he's cooler. Meow. Meow. Hi, Bean and Potato. True. The cooler Don fan. Professor Sada, if you subdue the creature, can he subdue me next? Yeah. Aqua Tail. Yeet. Whoa. Meow, meow. Meow, meow. Whoa. Um, well, this is kind of terrifying. He's actually pretty strong. Whoa. Okay, stop. What are you doing? the fuck? <laughs> Why? Why? <laughs> Why? Um... Doggy Egg, no! Let's see. Um... Nianskit? Whoa. You got this, Nianskit. Uh... Seed Bomb. What the... Good. <laughs> Good. Um, okay. This is a little terrifying. All right, Fisk, you got this. Fisk, you got this. Cool. Um, body press. Think wiped me the first time I tried it. Well, I got this. Boil that elephant. Body press. Well, that didn't do much. I thought it was stronger than that. Wipe me the first time. Damn. Okay, we got this. We got this. We got this. Boil this elephant. No, stop. Whoa. Play rough. <gasps> we got him. Sometimes the gray hits when I least expect it. True. Whoa. Find the quaking earth titan. Where'd he go? Where'd he go? Revive. Uh, ba -ba. Oh, I have a max revive? Uh, sure. Why not? Why not? Can you catch this one? Because it's like a boss battle? No, you can't catch the big guys for some reason. Which is kind of a bummer. They're just like boss battles. Uh, let's see. Save. Neom. Okay, where where do he where do he go? Oh, there he is. Where could he be? Chat, do you see the elephant? You can catch him later, though. Oh, for real? Shortly after this, chat, do you see the elephant? Where could it be? Do you know where the elephant went? Well, cool. no big guys, only little guys. Oh, there he goes. Dosta. <laughs> On his stuff. The tight and great tusk began eating something. I see Mr. Walks about. <gasps> Hi, Arvin. Hi, Fanfi. <laughs> Fanfi's just standing there like, bro, are you seeing this shit? This is crazy. This is crazy. That one just clipped out of existence back there. Slorb, looks like you found yourself a Titan. Whoa, Fanfi's just vibing. Wait, that's the Quaking Earth Titan? Huh? Is that thing even a Pokemon? 
I must be trying to get pumped up with that little snack. Whoa. Time to show that thing what you and me can do, Slorb. I'm gonna feed the Titan Pokemon some berries. Fan fee? That's crazy, Dio. That's crazy, Dio. Whoa. Whoa. You are clipping through the floor, sir. Are you? I don't know if you're aware, but you are clipping through the floor. Scovillian? What the hell is that? I'm gonna use the Scovillian I caught nearby to seize a real spicy victory. This is gonna burn. Oh, is that what the weird little capsaicin thing evolves into? Oh. Interesting. Yeah, it's kind of creepy. <laughs> I kind of don't like it. Its face kind of scares me. Whoa. Brick break? Stop it, you fucking asshole! Stop spamming brick break! Oh my god, dude. Made me waste my fucking terrestrialization. Yeah, it's like evil in the lore. <laughs> Says you with that little three of yours, yeah. Um Nanskit? Come on, come on, Arvin. I need your help here. Get give him something, Arvin. Come on. Uh I guess seed bomb. Oh nice! He's got razor leaf, super effective. Seed bomb, we got this fucker. Oh, that Fanfi is just fucking chilling. Oh my god, he's like one-shotting everything I have. Yeah, that Fanfi is just chilling. He's just he's just vibing. Oh my god, dude. Alright. Let's try a funny worm. Funny worm, go. Yeah, good. Good? I saw another streamer play this and I don't remember the Tusk being this big. He's so big we clipped through the floor. Um dig. Nice camera angle, yeah. Very cool. Very good. The battle cinematics are usually good, but I hate how you can just can't see the other part of the program. Like, bro, there's new guys that we want to see. Yeah, exactly. Creature do be breaking your bricks, yeah. He breaking my bricks. Get him with the razor leaf. And then dig. Get him. Whoa. Oh god, he killed Scovillian. Oh god, he killed Scovillian. Oh, like he's a villain. Sco villain. Sco villain. Dig. Get out of there. <laughs> he's gonna fucking moiterize you. <laughs> we gotta keep spamming dig on him. Stomping tantrum. Yeah, get fucked, idiot. We gotta keep hitting him with the dig. We'll just chip away at him. <gasps> ah! <laughs> um. Yeah, do it again. Yum. Dig. There's a kid back there too. Just like wow. I'm gonna be friends with a Pokemon this big, with this big Pokemon? Bit by bit, that's how a drill works. We'll dig and we'll dig until we break our way through. You see that kid back there? He's just vibing. Oh shit, he killed my worm. Another one. He killed my worm. He's gonna flatten your worm? Yeah. Babe, wake up, it's worm flattening time. All right, Christ, you're gonna get fucking owned, but you gotta buy us some time. You gotta buy us some time. Uh, let's see. Um. Revive uh Nanskit. Bon out, bon out. Who up dying with they worm? True. Well, there he goes. <laughs> Rut row. Scarfy. Um bag. Uh lemonade. Lemonade? Lemonade? Do I have any? Oh. Uh, like Zoink Scoob! Uh, where'd my lemonade go? There it is. Okay. Lemonade on, uh, Neon Skit. Here we go. You used a can of lemonade. Drink a lemonade. Neon Skit had its HP restored. Now, Kreitz is gonna die. Rip. Providing a salty aspect to the burger to offset a mostly sweet taste profile. That's how a deal works! Exactly. Exactly. Um. All right, your turn, bastard type. Your turn. Bow, 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 bow. This isn't gonna do anything to you. <gasps> Wait, why is fairy type super effective? Wait, really? Oh, is it part steel? Oh. Well, that wasn't fun. Sacrificing his mod for his former boss. That's how a slug works, exactly. Yeah, bring in Nanskit. 
No, it's supposed to be like brisket. Cause she's 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 got yo yo. Uh, seed bomb. Please stop out speeding me. Please stop out speeding me. Steel beats fairy slug. Oh! Do you want me to tell you it's typing? Now nah, I'll figure it out. Please survive. Please survive. Please survive. You spin the slug inch by inch. Steel beats fairy. Oh, why is fairy strong against it? Oh, maybe it's dark type. Oh, because it's mean and angry. I thought Nyan was for Nyaners. No, but it does fit. Because it's a cat, but it's also brisket. Uh, let's see. All right, you got to carry this home, Fisk. Everybody else is dead. You got this, Fisk. You got this. Everyone else is dead. It's all up to you. You got to do it. Don't die, 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 don't die. Oh my god. Whoa. Fisk will die? No. Not yet. We're not done. Um, let's see. Uh 70 HP. Hmm. We'll try it. Maybe we can outspeed it. No! Fucking hell. That's it. <laughs> we got team wiped. No! Alright, we try again. You panicked and dropped $1,260. True. Yeah, I'm always doing this. You heard of the Pokemon Center shielding your po exhausted Pokemon? Yeah. This is why you can't rely on a dog. True. True. Wait. Do I have to do all that again? That's kind of cring. Well, now that I know that he's... Well, shit, dude. Um... Wait, where where was that? Glottal, no! Yeah, Glottal, no! <gasps> Does that mean I didn't catch the Pokemon I caught? Oh, no. Uh... No, okay. Never mind. I got Mud Haver. All good. We're okay. We're good. No, you have them. Let's go. Any other progress to save? Glottal's joined the dark side. You love to see it. Um... Let's see. You just died it did. Yeah. Um Can I buy anything interesting to help me in this in this in this fight? Uh I'd like to buy. Do you have any like a uh, like 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 fucking like fucking um 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 no, you don't have any like battle items? Do I have battle items? Bag. Uh let's see. Just like, and I just like enabling slug. True. True. And we love you for it. Um. Hmm. Hmm. Cool. It's a durable stone that boosts the power of rock type moves. Boosts the power of special moves. Changes the weather to a sandstorm. The sandstorm will persist longer than usual. Rocky helmet. And I know if another Pokemon makes direct contact with the holder, that Pokemon will be damaged. Oh. Chat loves this. True. Um, that's really cute because Fisk's, Fisk's mascot dog, um, um, wears a little helmet like that. So we'll give it to the Fisk Pokemon. Cute! That's really cute. It shows a little item too. Whoa. Um, let's see. Uh, I want to stir Slug's face with a wooden spoon. It will go true. Um, 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 um. Um, rock type moves, smooth rock. I don't want a smooth rock. Quick claw, give to, quick give to Nanskit. Yeah, there we go. Um, and then, and then, and then, and then, and then, yeah, that's it. That's it. That's it. Um, okay. Gmod ragdoll noises. What are you doing here? What do you think you're doing, huh? What do you think you're doing, Fanfy? Get out of my way. I gotta go kill your dad. Finish the Beacon Pines epilogue and damn, Sharper got yippee! The sink and slug cannon was the source that caused everything to freeze. Funny deer family is in debt due to massive water bill and Mayor Dogman has been fixed. Yep. You'll love to see it. You'll love to see it. Uh, all right, where are we going? Did I set it as a destination? Fanfy is just a, a poo shit diarrhea noises? What do you mean? What do you mean? 
Wait. I combined y'all's messages. Fanfi is just a little guy, don't be mean to him. That was poo shit diarrhea noises slug? True. I missed the end of Beacon Pines? Yeah, we finished it earlier. That's why I'm playing Pokemon now. I combined y'all's messages and I was like, damn. Really ragging on Fanfi, huh? I'll have to watch the VOD when I have a day off. I ran into this horse because I was reading chat. So I can't tell us apart anymore. You're all bleeding together in my brain. Because I think my brain is bleeding. Yeah. I want to see how it ended. It was really cute. I loved it. It made me cry. It's a very, very good game. Oh, wait. I don't have to do the first part again. He's over there, I think. Maybe? Mm Fanfi is a shitty poo-poo Pokemon? No! Don't be mean to him. Ah! Pommies. Whoa. Ah! Don fan. No. I have to focus. Nyarom slash J. Quick, everyone say something unique to stand out or else you'll become chat. True. We are one. We are one. We are one. We are smilers. Bump, ba -dum, bump, 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 bump. If you shorten pants. Oh, good. Yeah, I'm sure this will be worth listening to. Oh, never mind. <laughs> um, panic. Something unique. We are one. Whoa. He eat a he eat a sandwich. He eat his his ingredients. We are one. Okay, you're just scaring me, chat. Slug is totally great at video games. True. Hold that thought, kid. <laughs> Hold that thought. Slorb, looks like you sound, found yourself in Titan, and this has never happened before. Wait, that's the Quaking Earth Titan. Uh, is that is that thing even a Pokemon? Must be trying to get pumped up with that little snack. Whoa. Time to show that thing what you and me can do, Slorb. Yeah, we will. Let's go. Whoa. Dinosaur. We are one. True. Whoa. This low poly Fisk is going through it. Look how low poly Fisk became. He blacked out too and it fucked with his memory. <laughs> I like that this Pokemon has a little house where it keeps its snack. Yeah. We are number one. Look at this fist. It's struggling. Uh, to rastalize? Yeah, hit him with the play rough. I'm going to use Scovillain I caught. Oh, it's Scovillain. I kept calling it Scovillian. Oh. We all are? Yeah, we're all low poly. We are the slug mind, so we aren't even that great of a hive mind. True. Kind of mid. Oh, cute! Look at the little hat! Wow. Don't do it. Don't do it, you fucking asshole. We're all struggling. Holy shit, that did like nothing! It's Pisk! Pisk real. That did like nothing! What the fuck? I'm both low poly and high poly. Hit him again. Fuck you. Why is this thing so strong? Razor Leaf, kill him! <gasps> Let's go. You got this, Fisk, you got this. Rapid spin? Wait. Why did I heal? Higher level than you? Wait, why did I heal, though? Okay, but why did I heal, though? Or was he hitting the partner? Wait. Since when did you heal? I thought I had taken damage. Did Am I, like... Am I having a strong? It. What happened? Oh, he got hit by the. Oh, I think he hit Scove. Yeah. I was wondering. I was like, why didn't my Rocky helmet do anything? But that. Yeah, that makes sense. Oh, God, I love that animation. I love you, Slug. Thanks. <laughs> my brain doesn't worm. I thought you did too. I think we just misunderstood that he hit Scove villain. Um. Aren't you like 10 levels lower than Arvin's Pokemon? Maybe. Outplayed. High Q. <laughs> Fisk, Fisk, Fisk rotating moments. Love to see it. <laughs> Fisk rotating moments. She just spun backwards in place and hello, master. You just kicked Pokemon ass? Hello, master. Are you proud of me? I am. I pat your funny little head. Creature. Absolute creature.
Spring a Tito. Good Fisk. Again? Yeah. This game is very finished. Crepes wants to learn crunch. Why are you, why, what are you crunching, Crepes? What are you crunching for? Yeah, you can, you can, you can crunch. No more biting. Now you can crunch. Crunchy crepes. Don't dogs eat slugs? Maybe. I'm going to crunch that fisk. Whoa, don't pat it as a rocky helmet and you'll hurt yourself. True. She needs it to protect herself from me. It's her only last, it's her last line of defense. Mm -hmm -hmm. We did it. Crunch. Yes, nice going, little buddy. I love when he calls me little buddy. What even was that thing, though? I kind of feel like maybe I've seen it before somewhere. Whoa. Oh, he's got a little cup on his backpack. I never noticed that. That shit probably get mad dirty, though. Anyway, I bet if we head inside here, we'll find more of that Herba Mystica it was eating. Maybe. Did it just evaporate? Where's the corpse? It just, uh, yeah, it, it, uh, it just sunk into the earth. <laughs> Let's give this place a look before it decides to come back. It's for Spippies? Yeah, but, like, he leaves it out, so it probably gets really dirty. Should probably keep it in the backpack, right? Come out, come out wherever you are, my psionic warrior. Seal that boo-boo bear within the earth. Thank you for the scrimch of the Spippy. Where do all fainted Pokemons go? They see they they sink into the earth. Mm -hmm. They go to Rainbow Road. Yo, pass me some of that Herba Mystica. They die, die. Mm -hmm. Extra flavor. I wish all fainted Pokemon's go to hell, no matter what. <laughs> <laughs> My favorite rendition of that is it's it's the it's the it's Timmy praying at his bed, and somebody edited it to where I wish all femboys go to hell, no matter what. And I just, yeah, you know what? Valid. Fair. That's fair. <sighs> Here with a spippy. Come out, come out, wherever you are. Whoa. Have you heard of Prophecy Club? Uh-uh. What's that? Whoa. What the? Whoa. Why are there items in here if I can't engage with them? That's the second time I've seen, like... So, like, the last one we went to, there was a luxury ball. And now there was a Pokeball on the floor. Let me show you some wild shit. Whoa. It's the herb? No, 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 the Pokeball. He's fully... He's full of femboys and sharply dressed women. Bruh, I'm on my way. Quick smoke it? Whoa. Oh, it's not an item? What is it? What it? What is it? Yeah, those Pokeballs are everywhere? It's a graphical error that happens sometimes. Good. Oh, okay. When you go inside somewhere, there's one in my salon. <laughs> the Pokeballs are inert. There's always a Pokeball in the middle of every room. It's a random artifact that does for Gore to take out of it. All right. Yeah, I got no complaints here. Uh, thanks for telling me, chat. Now I know. I know no, nothing nothing more to say to uh, understandable have a have a underdayable have a nice stand Yes found it. Here's our little herb finished game by the way. Yeah Hey chat. What's in your random pokeball? There's a Persian stuck inside of every of all of it for all eternity specifically our Persian suffering. Yeah You and Arvin found the sour herba mystica. Oh <gasps> the sour sweat potion nose pass this shape the sheen Looks like it'll taste horrible, which means it's got to be good for you. Yeah, that makes sense. Shrimple as. Now then, let's see. What does the book have to say? Okay. Sour Herba Mystica is chock full of nutrients and ingredients, and it's great for boosting your overall health. It's like they, the, like a load-bearing coconut PNG, but they messed up the placement. Yeah, I think that's what it's supposed to be. Mines a Miss Magius with a unique steel-type move called Gun. Yeah. Whoa, smoking that sour herb. It says here it works wonders whether you're tired physically or mentally. Perks you right up. Hey, that's me. I'm both of those things, Harvin. No time to waste. Let's get some food going. Whoa. Bam, 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 bam. Yeah, yeah, watch Whoa. Wait, I changed my answer. It's missing now. <gasps> True. 
Time to not share with your Pokemon. Sorry for the wait. Here's a super healthy sandwich that'll perk you right up once you eat it. Plus, as a token of our friendship, here's another Titan badge. Gaze upon it in awe as you eat. I will. I won't expose you to this stuff directly. Here's the Song of I version of all the evils of uh, Pokemon. Well, I'm not watching videos right now. I don't want to watch videos right now, but, 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 but. Maybe save it for another slunch time. Eat the badge? Yeah, I'm going to eat the badge. Hmm. Bum, 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 ba, -dum. bum, ba -dum. I'll expose you to cringe later. Sounds good. Sounds good. Whoa. Creature. Grrr. Whoa. Bow, 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 bow. Sour sandwich. Do you want to give your sandwich to Crydon? Yeah, it tastes terrible. I don't like it. Grrr. Come on out and boss if food's up. That's a big sandwich. <laughs> Chad, it's in the scene. Chad, it's right here. <laughs> the load bearing Pokemon! The load bearing Pokemon is real! It's never been that prominent. It's always been like in the cutscenes loading, but it's never been like right in the foreground like that. Ball. <laughs> Ball. Um, 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 um. Can we get much higher? Um, 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 um. Oh, he eat the sandwich. <laughs> oh, would you look at that? Seems like someone's got a proper appetite now. Whoa, oh, you want a sandwich? <laughs> Honestly, could be worse. It could. Whoa, oh, he's so full of sandwich. He'll be able to glide now? Is can we can fly now? They fly now. Seems like that fella's also slowly regaining its, regaining its original strength. That guy really just put a submarine sandwich in his back pocket? Yeah, you don't do that? Still doesn't look like it's anywhere close to returning to its battle form. He flies now, don't worry about it, yeah. Damn, guess we can get much higher. Seems healthy enough physically. Maybe it's got some kind of mental block that's preventing it from returning to its true form. <gasps> it has performance anxiety! A mental block? I've read about it in books before. A mental scar. Like psychological trauma. You know? Like when you watch a Germa stream? I think that's what you call it. Men's genius has much better pockets, true. Maybe it had a terrifying experience in battle. So they're not scared to battle at all. Oh. It's a glide. It doesn't get you higher. It just gets you lower at a more controlled speed. I see. Is that a submarine sandwich in your pocket? Or are you just happy to see me? A random Pokeball within a room isn't the most immersion breaking thing. The game series of Pokeball tend to be on the ground everywhere. True. Boy, your hair is clipping through your, your, your now, your nose. Oh, your nose. Um, um, I prescribe a slug stream to it. Yeah. The slug in its brain is, is inhibiting its true power. Yeah. Yeah, it's oh, that's why that's why he doesn't feel good. He can hear everything I'm saying. Oh, stealing your powers. Yeah. Well, don't worry. I'm sure both that brute and his boss stiff will make a full recovery eventually. OK. So how do you feel, my boss stiff? How's that Urban Mystical working? Brr. He can hear chat. Yeah. Gah, uh, no pressure. Whoa. Oh. Not like it's fair to expect every kind of Herba Mystica to have some huge effect, right? Is that one... <laughs> Is that one supposed to be there? Is that Mabostiff's Pokeball? I can't tell. It's not like the effect has to be immediate, either. Or is it just kind of in the scene? I can't tell. I, I genuinely don't know. Hey, it's okay. Don't worry. Slorb and I are going to make sure you're right as rain. Yeah, that's my boss tips. Okay. I have no idea, dude. It's anyone's fucking guess. <laughs> We've got one more herb to go. And I bet it's going to be the best of them all. Oh. It's, it's just got to be. Oh, Arvin, you're so cute. All right, Slorb. The next stops, our little herb hunt should be the last. But we can't lose steam until we're done. Let's keep up our momentum. Here we go. Game, fuck it, we ball, fuck it, we ball, fuck it, we ball. True. Fuck it, we ball. Fuck it, here's a Pokeball. Sada. Hello, Slorb, this is Sada. 
When do I get to meet her? Pokemon don't really die of old age, do they? Yeah, they do. Mm-hmm, they do. By the way, the last one is around level 50, so maybe don't do that one for a bit. I was gonna hold off, but thank you for the warning. Um, um, it's been so nice to have a restraining order on a certain someone, huh? Just make Sammy's with the best friend, true. I detect that Coridon has regained more of its original power. After it has jumped into the air, you should, you should try pressing the B button. Again, it should glide now. They glide now. Press the B button when you're in the air and Coridon will uh, glide for you. Press the B button once more, you'll stop gliding and immediately start falling. One Pokemon died of old age in the anime, yeah. A lot of them do. There's, there's been like implications in some of the cards that they grow with age and yeah. There's like statues of older Pokemon that have passed. Must continue helping Coridon to recover. Okay. Okay. Whoa. Nyarum. Whoa. I need to lead with bastard type. And then where to next? Porto Marinda? Now that's an origin story, yeah. Cascarfa? Whoa. Restraining on a slug, it's called the neurotoxin that makes him think he's streaming and stay in his home and never leaves? True. Uh, I thought that since they evolve in such a complete way, there's some weird magic thing happening? No. There, it's never really been kind of like explained, but uh, about how evolution differentiates from like age or whether age brings about a natural evolution. It's never really been heavily I I implied or explained. One of the Pokemon on YouTube that's a key story about an old Charizard? Yeah, we watched that one. Um, Port Mar Marinera? Yeah, we're gonna go Port Marinera. Is that what it's called? Port Marinera? Port Marinada. I still found some Madrevious Shatters or any magic themed Pokemons? No, I don't think I've found any magic ones. Or a Madrevious for that matter. The only ghosts I've found are Shuppet and Ghastly. Look at those boys clipping through the floor. Look at these boys clipping through the floor. You'll love to see it, little mans. All right, bye. 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 Near um. Okay. Near um. They not clipping, they swimming? Yeah, but they were clipping. They were like popping in, they sand swimming. He fell for the ruse? Damn. I think that's intentional. Yeah, 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 I meant they were like popping in. Pokemon has never concerns itself with consistency and world build building after all. True. Uh, I think that's where we gotta go. That's Port Marinera, which I don't know what's there. Porto Marinda. What is this? A market, huh? Interesting. Hello, friends. Hi, Pierre. Hi, right, we just fought a giant elephant. Nyom. Whoa, cool. We fought a giant hairy elephante. This game sure looks, um, yeah, it sure does. It sure do. It, that, that do be what it do, Yugi. That do be what it do. Nyom. Nyom. Whoa, motorcycle mommy. I'm beat. I came across the desert with Cyclozar, and I'm totally exhausted. Healing my team at the Pokemon Center gives this human a chance to rest up, too. True, thank you for the strumption and the spippy. It sure is a game, and to be fair, it's not like the lore takes anything away from the game. You're not asking for a masterpiece when you play. I mean, I'd like a finished game, but... I'm having fun nonetheless. I'm in loathe with the ads, the fucking Pokemon Center, oh my god. In loathe or in love? Whoa. I think the ads are cute. If not, a little bit dystopian. Loathe? <laughs> <laughs> ba -no -ba. It's a very good game, but it's definitely not finished. Yeah, it's both creepy and wet. Um, I'm out for the evening. Have a good one, everyone. Bye, Rod's words. Thanks for hanging out. A Flappy. Oh, and a Tauros. What's that? A bird. Oh, finished, sure, but the lore is in the forefront is what I mean. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, it'd be ideal, but pig, sexy pig. Leave me alone. I don't want to deal with you right now. I want to go see what's down there. So, like, this is the first time I've seen this model. I didn't know you could get much cuter. You have Glottal to thank. Runaway pig. Yeah. Ah! Whoa! Okay, dude. Kill pig for bacon. He's unzipping. Yeah. Yeah, no, Glottal, Glottal made this updated version. It's very cute. Yeah, good. Yeah, good. 
Yeah, fucking good. Zero days since Slug has talked about the sexy pig. Listen, I didn't want to deal with it. It came up to fucking engage with me, okay? I'm not in the mood right now. Shiny Tauros? No, he would have the sparkle. He would have the Shing sparkle sparkle, right? Zero days, yeah. Well, thanks for killing my Pikachu, I guess. Poor fucking Pikachu. I really should teach it retaliation. It's probably the most unhappy Pikachu in existence. All right, bring in Fisk. This fucking Pikachu experiences more violence than this dog. It's a regional variant? Yeah. Sorry I'm uninformed on the new shit in this game. Oh, you meant like because of its coloration? Yeah, that's it's just the regional variant for it. Yeah. The, the, which is why, because I thought you were like making a joke because the shiny version of this, its fur is just a little bit darker. I didn't want to fuck the pig. It was just came up to me and when it was asking for it. Sure, sir. Now step into the courtroom. Oh my God, look. Look, you got to go, dude. You got to get out of here. Nyom, peak of violence, true. Bark, 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 leave me alone. Nyom. I gotta heal my fucking dead Pikachu now. Bow now now, bow now 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 now. Bow now 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 now. Okay. Um, I wanna go see what's that market down there. Bow, 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 bow. Yeah, I wanna go see, I wanna go see, I wanna go see, I wanna go see. <gasps> Porto Marinara. <gasps> we can get on top of it. Wow. Oh. <gasps> There's this thing up here. Oh. I am on your roof. XP Candy Large. Doesn't Torres have three full forms in this game? Does he? I thought they were all just that gray color. That gray and black variant. Nyom. Whoa. What's this? What the? Before I was even born? People say that a long time ago, before I was even born, there were always fights breaking out here. Not anymore. Now we get lots of tourists and even kids can walk around and feel safe. A battle court? What the? There's a unique form in each game in addition to the black one you, actually, you usually see. Oh. It's a battle court right here in the market. Nobody's allowed to get in fights here. If you gotta work something out, you do it. Through a friendly Pokemon battle. Yeah, you make your animals fight each other. Whoa. There's three that just don't look too different? Gotcha. There's Pokemons on the wall. Okay. The auction. Look at you, little miss student. Here to try to hand at the auction. Carefully, you don't drive up the price too high or you'll be crying into your empty pockets. Whoa. Who asked? Italians are canonically in Pokemon pretty fucked up. Yeah. Meryl! Meryl! Whoa. <laughs> oh, she's gone, chat. <laughs> Gotta go, slub. Have fun. Thanks for hanging out, Ace. Oh. She's gone. She clipped out of existence. Oh, she's back. Oh, she's gone. Oh, back. Oh, gone. Oh, back. Oh, okay. Uh, welcome. Every kind of sandwich, any way, which way you want. No, I don't want this. No, no, no I don't want this. Welcome. How about some tasty feelings and handy accessories? No! What's this? Anything catch your eye? What do you got? Huh? Oh, you're just, you're, you're pretend. Okay. Oh dear, I'm sorry, young lady, but I don't think our auctions are for you just yet. What the? Welcome, care to have a look? Why can't I? Do I have to like do something to unlock it? What the? Hola, fresh produce? No! No! Every kind of sandwich, only five options. Hi, Kusi Kusi. Welcome to Shirk Hands. No! Why can't I? I want to do an auction. What the hell? Why can't I auction? NPCs are the people of. Wait. The people are Fisk people? The people are F S K E people? You can make five or six sandwiches or just one. You just continue the story stuff you get right here? Oh. Okay. Well. Fake people. Oh. Oh. Look at this Animal Crossing pathway. That's pretty cool. Like somebody made it in the, uh, like the Animal Crossing design thing that you put on the floor. Looks just like it. That's pretty cool. Wait. How do I get back up there? Oh. Uh. Wait. Ditto. 
I want a ditto. What the? Where? Where? Where is he? Where are you, little man? Oh. Ditto. I want a ditto. Oh. Y'all said they impersonate other Pokemon in this, right? Like, you have to figure out it's actually a ditto. Oh. What's over here? West Province Area 2. Ah! Oh. Yeah? Hmm. Interesting. Interesting. How can you tell? I guess their silly face? It's hard to tell on some of these things, though. Huh. I see. I see, I see. Whoa. A Floatzel. Though, if you zoom in on them after you've seen a Ditto, it'll show Ditto as its name. Oh. Ah! Looks identical to other Pokemons, though. Oh, wait, like it doesn't even have a different face? With a huge path road with no cars is unnerving. Like, suburbs are made to exist with cars. There were none there, so what's the point of a suburb? Yeah. Well, this is a car. I have a car right here. Pretty sure it doesn't. Oh, that's cringe. Well, that's annoying. Oh, pink friends. The other Shellos. EC Shellos is. is e shells seashells by the seashore. Yummy, true. Oh, Pokeball. Wiglet. Okay, I think I can back up this way. What the? Poppin' Andy's. Nyom. Oh! Alright, hop. Glide. Okay. Castle Yoroya Lake? Oh. Wiggly. Um. Who? Who? Set his destination. I want to go there. You don't want to be here yet? Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Inflate slug till he pops? Yeah. Ah! Meryl. I like seeing a wild Azumarill. That's cool. Kind of neat. Kind of neat to see a wild Azumarill. Whoa. All right. Let's go over here. Whoa. That's a slope, bro? Slope, bro. Slow bro. Slow bro. I thought it was a slow king for a second. Got a little scheme and then just a cute little round mouse that beeps at you. Yeah. <laughs> <gasps> the Tropussy. Hi. Why are you so small? I always thought these things were enormous. Why is it so small? Slow bro. Slow bro. I always thought those things were way bigger. Oh. Interesting. <laughs> Banana. Banana. Why are you so small? True. Yeah, why are you so small? Weight ball. Slow bro. Um. How the hell do I get up there? Uh. What the? Oh, it's the weird creature that we fought. Why are you so small? I thought these things were enormous. The love slug, Docky. The love docky slug, listen here, you. Whoa. You aren't gonna catch it? I'll come back for it later. Unless it's like a new Pokemon, I'm not gonna bother right now. I'll come back for it later. I'm trying to advance the plot as much as I can. Horrible beast. The flaming gussy. Leave me alone. Ah! Okay. Okay. What's that? What are you? What? What is this? What the fuck are you? <laughs> okay, we should not be here. A friend. I'm gonna get fucking murderized. Tsushimon. It's just a little guy? Uh-oh. I, uh... Okay, bye. Man, I love that color. Me too. 
but they're way too strong for me. I don't think I'm supposed to be all the way out here. This tiny little guy will wreck your shit. Uh-oh. <laughs> um, uh, no, please. Uh, no, please. No, please. No, please. Whoa! Uh, I gotta go. Uh, oh, I gotta go! I gotta go. I gotta go. Krogan is the bestest walk cycle. Whoa. Volt switch. What just... Slug, this is why you look at the road when you drive. Listen. Uh, Soggy egg. I gotta get out of here. I gotta get out of here. I gotta go. There's an orange one over there. Run. Bye. Bye. There's an orange one. What? They're different colors? Whoa. I see. No, it's like you gotta rotate again to hide Pikachu. It makes it look like the Pokemon is attacking you. Oh, true. Nyom. Choodle and his and his and his awful father. Uh, let's go this way. Nyom. I heard a gimme ghoul. I don't know where it went though. Whoa, oh, weird dogs with a pig. A meowth. Nyom. 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 Dunsparce? What is that? Oh, it's a Permin! <gasps> cool! Is the beast aggressive in nature? Ah! <laughs> it is. <laughs> he wanted me dead. Nyom. Nyom. Permin. It was a Permin. Nyom. Nyom. Whoa. Full heal. He he he. True. True. Certified he he moment. I keep thinking those are Eevees. Slug like hates dogs but runs away from cats. True. What are you? A dog and a cat coexisting? Vile. Unheard of. Neom. I made it! Poggers! I survived. Bow bow bow. Bow 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 bow. Well, now that we're here. Wait, is this gym leader, like, super over-leveled for me, then? Is that gonna be the case? Probably not good, then. The Pokemon survived. I sure did. Nyrom. What a lucky day! I'm stuffed to my gills! Me too. Cat and dog segregation is true. How have you been? I don't know. Don't talk to me, dude. What do you mean? Don't talk to me. Wait, where are we? What's going on over here? What, what What's happening? We got the normal type gym. Is that what this is? Uh, there's not even there's not even a fucking wait. What? Fly here. Wait, when did I access this? I love Barista Nurse Joy. Whoa, he has gills. True. Ah, uh, she heals your Pokemon back to perfect health. Also makes you a cappuccino. Yeah. Wait, I want to fight the normal guy. Normal type? Are you gay or normal? I know what you are. I'm going to say long because spoilers, but Snyder fans are seething because James Gunn is apparently planning to completely reboot the DC film universe. Oh. I, um... <laughs> this may come across as harsh, but uh, I agree with what Norm McDonald said in that video where he says, I think this might come across as harsh. Those sure are words. Are you both city Pokemon centers? Oh. Um, let's see. Let's see. Wow, 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 wow. This is my favorite. What? What are you drinking? Let me see. What do you have? What do you have? What? I, I, <laughs> please. It's like fucking Sonic 06. What do you have? I want to see what's in your cup. Slug, no. It's just water. <laughs> it's just water. Can you use your camera? I guess I could, but it's just fucking water. Um, all right, where's the gym? Wait, is this the gym? Chalky milk? I think it was Spippy. Kid drinking booze? Don't steal from the child, Slug. Why not? Why not? And why shouldn't I? 
give you the stretch. Uh, it's his favorite. Oh, look at that big tail, Jim. Look at that fucking tail. Look at a chonker. Why are all the kids always carrying like a coffee? Wow. What are you wowing at? Why do you get drip and I don't, huh? Why can't I have a purple hoodie, huh? Why can't I wear that? Why can't I have those clothes? Demon? Whoa, what are y'all doing? What's the name of the gym leader again? The Medali Gym. Okay. Wow, Omega Lol. Wow. Wow. Whoa. Ooh, wait. Who is this? Well, now, Slorm. No, I gave him a British accent. That's right. Don't steal clothes from kids, Slug. I want the hoodie. Uh, how do I do a British accent? You appear to be progressing well on your gym circuit. Who's this? What's this now? Is that that kid I've been hearing so much about? 22 Goodman Josh? <gasps> Thank you for the follow. What the fuck? They're very gender. I like them. Give me your gender. <laughs> hey, kiddo. I heard you like way too good at battling, yeah? Uh, yeah. Whoa. <laughs> you got some spirit, big shot. I like their gender. Me too. This young lady would be Rika? Whoa. That's me. Rika, at your service. Whoa. I will steal all three genders on screen. Chew! And hey, I know I'm pretty, but no need to get intimidated or anything. Okay. I don't like when they know they're cute, you know what I mean? And she is a little farcical, shall we say, but like myself, she is a member of the Elite Floor. Elite Floor? Elite Four. What? I wasn't trying to be funny. Whoa. Anyway, hmm. You mean like you? What do you mean? <laughs> this one gets a pass? That's true. A sip of their gender fluid? True. Tell you something, kiddo. You look fun. Like, interesting. At a glance, anyway. The most elite of floors. True, Carnage. It's like intimidated by confident people. Listen. At a glance, anyway. They're so cute. Naturally, she is one of our Academy's esteemed students. Oh, <laughs> yeah, that checks out. But the battles you'll face at these gyms really do ratchet up the farther you go. Indeed, your average trainer abandons the challenge at roughly this very point. Not you, right, kiddo? Leap flower? What is that? Is that what pro breakers use? Yeah. Uh, see, when you hit the gym at champion assessment, you show these gyms what you've got. Oh. Best of fortunes to you. Bye. Bye. Joe Brandon, let's go. Nyrm, treasure eatery? I made too many steaks ordering at the treasure eatery. I can't eat another bite. Okay. The mentally gym leader doesn't show his face all that much. I wonder what kind of person he is. Whoa. The most bottom of bottoms. Got any badges? Yeah, too. So do I. Should I be here? What about normal types? They're weak to fighting. Uh. Uh. Who did I give a fighting type move? I know I have a fighting type move on one of these. Body press. And low kick. Alright, so the Fisk. Fisk. Fisk will be our tank. Welcome to the Medali Gym. Hi. Let me register you as a challenger. Your name is Slorb, yes? Yeah. Great. Now in order to face the gym leader, Larry. Larry. You'll need to first pass the gym test. Here at the Medali Gym, that means ordering a special secret menu item. Specifically, a menu item at the Treasury Eatery, a much-loved restaurant here in Medali. Order correctly and you pass. Right now, there are three other gym challengers around town attempting this gym test. Each challenger has been given a different clue that'll help them discover the secret dish. You'll be given a clue as well. This one is annoying? Oh no. Please find a battle the other please find and battle the other challenges. The loser must tell the winner their clue. Oh. Your goal is to gather clues and use them to determine the secret dish. Then order it from the 
later at the treasure eatery. Have fun, Slug. I don't think I want to do this today. I'm, I'm, I'm actually getting kind of EP. <laughs> Only the challenger who's able to order correctly will oh, pass no. the test. Oh, no. Or you could just cheat and look it up. Your clue is to find out how the regulars season their dishes. I suggest by you start by hearing what a regular at the treasury eatery has to say. I don't want to do this. Yeah, no, I'm, I'm good. <laughs> I'm good for today. I'm tired. <laughs> I'm EP. I'm EP. I did a lot of silly voices today. I've been yelling. I watched a lot of cringe today. I'm, I'm good. I just done this one. Yeah, we'll save this for fucking Tuesday. Eepy baby. Yeah, I'm a eepy baby today. I'm eepy. Here, let me come over here. Uh, papa. Papa. Hi. Ha. Hello. Thank you for the stream key pie. Thank you all for hanging out with me. I had a lot of fun. This this stream was 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 very fun. I love you, Slugalicious. Thank you. I had a lot of fun with this stream. We cried. We laughed. We made fun of Nintendo. We did all of our favorite activities. Um, we got a stretch. Oh my gosh. Whoa. I'm pretty eepy. I am pretty eepy today. Um, um, tomorrow I'm actually taking off. I know normally I stream on Saturdays, but I'm actually going to take tomorrow off because I want to give myself a little bit of a break. I've been going pretty hard lately. So I want to give myself uh, an extra day off this week. Many crimes were committed this day. Jesus Christ, that model is so cute. It really is cute. Enjoy your break. Thank you. Have a nice time off, Slug. Enjoy your vacay. Yeah, I'll be gone tomorrow and on Sunday. Sunday, we'll be doing anime night. Um, um, and then I'll be back on Monday. And I know, I don't know whether Monday or Tuesday, actually. Monday or Tuesday, I'm going to be collabing with Emrys. I don't know what we're doing yet, but that's the plan, is to hang out with Emrys. Rhymes with Abyss, our new friend. Um, um, I got to settle with them when when we plan to do that but um 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 love you Shlug. i love you too i love all of you so so much it was fun as heck i'm glad y'all hung out with me i'm glad y'all had fun i had a lot of fun with this stream i i cried i laughed um and i'm ready to uh relax now i'm ready to i think that's probably why i'm so tired probably because i cried <laughs> when i get emotionally worked up it kind of wears me out like a baby um um but <laughs> thank you for hanging out with me let me see who's live and where i can send y'all um let me see let me see uh open this here valid yeah i think when i get emotional i i i kind of wear myself out a little bit Oh, a lot of people are live. Gianni. Oh, not Nemo. Oh, um, Pips is undebuting the goat. Undebuting the goat. What does that mean? What does undebuting mean? <laughs> like last stream with the goat. <laughs> what does that mean? Uh, oh, Kyria. Oh, wait. <gasps> as much as I want to raid Pips. Speaking of Emrys, I've never gotten to raid Emrys. Emrys never goes live when I'm ending. Emrys usually goes live at like fuck o'clock at night. So they're actually live right now. I want to raid into M. I love M a lot. So if you don't know who M is, they're they're one of my friends and they're very, very fucking cute. They have a very fucking cute model. Their pronouns are they, them, so be mindful, please. Um, um, but they're very fucking cute. Um, we're just gonna hit them with a slug raid. Um, 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 they know who I am and they know how unhinged I am. They, they hang out in my, on my chat a lot, but, uh, we'll just hit him with the slug raid and whatever, whatever, uh, emo you might want to use slug raid poggy. Um, if you don't have my emotes, I usually default to the bugoid. I like the bugoid emote. Um, cute model, cute personality, cute crimer. They're very fucking cute. Yeah. Um, um, we do a little shrimping. So let me see slash raid their name is really long too so i'm gonna actually just copy paste it right here slash raid emrys rhymes with abyss there we go poggers okay thank you all so much for hanging out with me today i'm gonna miss you tomorrow and i'll miss you sunday but hopefully i see you again on monday and and keep an eye on twitter and discord and all my other socials and stuff um, 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 to keep an eye on the schedule, um, and I'll see you on Sunday, too, if you want to come hang out for anime night, too, but I love you all so, so much, and I hope you have a wonderful night, and a wonderful Saturday, and a wonderful Sunday. Oh, no, I got here late. Yeah, we're raining, Jax. We're, we're taking off. We're ending for the day. Have a good one, Slug. Thank you for stopping in. I love you all so, so much. Thank you for hanging out with me today. I'm gonna start the raid, okay? Have fun with M. Bye! I love y'all. Bye! Mwah. Bye!